I mean, fuck it. Free advertisement. So. Who the fuck am I? I'm the guy trying to fly by most. I gotta drive my ride, I boast. You ever eye my side piece, don't. Cause I got a piece on my side, no, I don't. I got my CD on repeat, cause the beast beat that sub. Power up like DBZ, no GT, that sucked. Except for Super Saiyan 4, that shit was fire. Fire as fuck, so when I release an MP3, better retweet and love. I'm officially meta, better get the four walls. War calls, more fall. Pop corny rappers like Gorval, Red and Baca hotter than the core, y'all. I can switch a style up. Spit it slow as dial up. Watch you fidget getting riled up. It'll take a while, but I'm spitting vile, bruh. You would never believe that I sucked when I first rap. Now all I ever get is love, and I earned that. All this sweat, tears, and blood. Fans return that. Look at all this shit I've done. I can't turn I'm back. Fun you know, in hip hop, I think, uh, I think we don't take enough time to just enjoy what we're doing. I think we focus so much on being serious, you know, being lyrical and being talented that we, we don't even stop to just think about how great the shit we do is. And I'm gonna try to change that perspective. So let's do this. Yeah. I've been giving everything inside my heart and all my music can be solo Master of the art, with the light of dark, day and night inside my dojo Can I pull some bitches with the witness like a boat, homie, that's a row row All my fans be watching me like a body cam or a GoPro They go. Doesn't really matter what beat I beat up Cause the industry shows me no love, just like Vegeta Except for Dragon Ball Super, they kinda been, uh Really be giving my boy love, so you rappers better play dead like a zombie with a toy gun. Man, I live with my music, so live it to do with the gift. Terrific, terrific, it's a give it to you. Gotta work the pen until your hand is falling off, and then you feel the genius spitting through you. Nobody told me like ever that I would be killing it. I'm living my life for the minute I'm giving it relevant. Damn it, I'm murdering beats, you can hear them in the streets like a megaphone on an elephant. Man, I'm just so real, catch me in the back, chilling with your mom, drinking dick of bombs with the baker Ron. Talk about the sun, shitty rapper songs, yo, shitty rapper songs, dude. I really didn't want to Had to put you on blast But if I get basic It's back upon you And I think It's really important that You know, we get these opportunities uh, to, to still be topical And still be able to, to flex your abilities musically But I think it's so important To, to also be able to just Say what you want to Even if it, even if it isn't you know, super crazy topical or anything like fuck Dragon Ball, you know? <laughs> Gotta get another try while I'm popping off. Blasting off on a rap song like Team Rocket Jaw. Scatter your ashes to the mist like I got Brock involved. I'm like a midget playing T ball, I can't knock it off. <laughs> Me and my team, we see past a lot. Energy seething, we had to stop. All I'm trying to say is it's fucking bullshit that the legendary Super Saiyan Brawly's trigger word was Kakarot! I'm about to beat the brakes off of your bitch ass You got no class and your girl when she gets so passed All around the room like an old flask I could even do better with no raps on an old Mac as an old man Every time I spit a verse that's so potential You was thinking I was Gohan Ready for Rohan, ready for war plans Ready for anyone thinking they got dope man Consider this you find a warning You should take a chips and get up at the dope man Grab your coat man, we give no hand Anybody who be rapping so bland I don't give a fuck, I'm having fun And I am free, you hating then You was no fan Hello everybody, welcome back to another Sunday Sunday. What's going on out there, chat? Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. Hope everyone's having a great day out there today. And right before the stream started, uh -huh. Miss Sin had one of the worst takes I have ever heard in my life. <laughs> and it, it, it's Miss Sin, so you expect some bad ones, but this, it floored me. I'm like, I, we're not even getting into this. This is what we're starting the show on. Nobody likes Prince. Prince is amazing! <laughs> I don't like Prince. I didn't ask if you liked Prince. Well, if I don't like Prince, nobody likes Prince. Oh, uh, uh, <laughs> What? It, it's okay. It's okay. I just... I don't... I don't even know... Thank you, Mr. Green! <laughs> 
Shelly, please. <laughs> I fucking love Prince Purple Rain. It, it's, it, it threw me. I'm like, this, this is a crazy fucking take. I, just, I don't like Prince. Prince is phenomenal. Okay. If you say so. I disagree. No, that's not what you said earlier. So nobody likes Prince. <laughs> Thank you for your input, <laughs> Shelly. <laughs> nobody it, likes him. It, no, you said he was terrible. It was the the live performance. His halftime show. His well, the first thing I was playing was the "While My Guitar Gently Weeps" from the uh, and that was also awful. Hall of Fame thing. Awful. With it, Tom Petty and somebody else. Yeah, it was terrible. But then the other, I'm like the the. His halftime show was amazing. Meh. It was the best halftime show. No, it was not. I'm sure it was not. I'm sure they were better. From the four minutes of it that you showed me, I thought, man, I can see why this is not the number one best halftime show ever. What are you thinking? That was it the was best halftime okay. show. It was just okay. <laughs> Meh. Meh. Bruce Campbell's chin said, that's a bad effing take. No, it's not. <laughs> No, it's not Bruce Campbell's chin. Oh, it's it is. Uh, I I I, I, I don't want to talk to you right now. He decided to go right to jail. Around. Right to jail. <laughs> I love that performance from Tom Petty. It's so good. It's so good. Go sit in the corner. No, you sit. In the corner. <laughs> oh, I walked five miles today. After that, I went to the store, then park, then store. Yes. I had a noticeable limp because my legs were hurting at that point. Some poly word walked past me and said someone had a good Valentine's Day. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Courtney Lynn said, I usually agree with Shelly, but not today. Well, you're wrong, Courtney, and that's okay. I love you anyways. Just stop. <laughs> just stop. <laughs> just throw the whole woman out. Saying, it's just, just stop. <laughs> Very good performer, awful music. music? I, I can agree with you there, Mr. Green. The music is terrible. He does a good show. He's got his fancy little purple outfits and stuff, looking like a lady. He's doing his thing. The music is terrible. We had this is the same terrible. conversation we had last week, which was the best Prince song, and you're just over in the corner like, oh. they're all terrible. The Party Man is cl clearly the best song. They're not. That's not good songs. You're so pretty. That's shy. even too old for me. I don't even like. I like old stuff. It's too old. Oh shit! Hi, Sin. Hi, Shelly. Got to spend some time with my puppy, Pumpernickel. Oh, my God. I love that name. I sent Shelly a picture on Instagram. I finally have a Sunday to relax and watch y'all. Love you guys. Can't wait to see what the girls are up to. Well, it's just one girl. And uh, before we get too far into it, we haven't had the time. I'm sorry. We haven't been allowed back to the studio till yesterday. So we'll get those packages out first thing during the week. Yes, there was some big gas issue the entire thing. It was a whole to do. We'll get him out this week. And thank you, Tina. Please pet that puppy for me. And thank you, Tina. Let's get a big thank you to Tina out there. Oh. I, I want to pet a puppy named Pumpernickel. Oh, my God. Pup Pumpernickel? Pumpernickel. I'm, I'm going to look at this puppy right now. I'm mad now. it's not Pumpernickel. Well, we can call him Pumpernickel. Oh, that was a stream boss by Tina. Nice. Uh, where is it? There we go. Bang. All right. You do that. I tagged you both on Twitter with a foodie pick I made. All right, Cougar Knife. Uh, I will take a look. A little bit later. Appreciate it. Uh, good call. Big donut to offset the room temperature take. Oh, it's room temperature. Oh, look at that good dog. That's a, oh, big, that's a big puppy. That's a good dog. That's a Shelly Squee, too. Oh. Does, does Party Man count as a movie reference? Oh. I'm going to count it. I, Party Man counts as a movie reference because I said so. A Call to Curl. I think Prince is overrated, but good. Overrated can still be good. Eh, I, I, I just don't <laughs> care for the music. That's all. It's fine. Do you like that weird EDM music? Not really. Yeah, you do. Not, <laughs> not particularly. I could not name you one 
EDM music I, artists. They don't have names or artists. They no, just they exist. <laughs> no, they do. They just exist in a giant temporal movement of boots and cats. Yeah, that's true. There is no names. There are no artists. It's just boots and cats differently. That's true. So you know, that's a damn good take. <laughs> and I, I do like the boots and cats. You like the boots and cats? In, in certain places, I do like the boots and cats. You like the boots and cats. I am... I like older music, mostly. Yeah, you, you're an old man. I don't like old man music. I, Prince like, is old man music. Prince I, is like, my grandma likes Prince. That's who likes Prince. And my husband. <laughs> my grandma husband. <laughs> I, 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 like, I like a lot of older music. I, I really like blues and jazz. I like uh, Pink Floyd, always number one. Well, yeah, everybody top. likes Pink Floyd. You don't it, have to be old man to like Pink it's, Floyd. That's just top number one. Well, what's his name? What's his name last week who got yelled at about the Rock Hall? <laughs> uh, sold me on, if I can find it somewhere, the full discography of Pink Floyd because it's like an Easter egg hunt between the package and the book yeah, yeah, and yeah. the company. Like, I, I don't get it, but I want it. <laughs> well, you just gotta look it up on the internet and find it all out. Let's see how much that is. I'm curious. Talk to the chat for a second. Well, no, you, you have to... You don't just buy the thing. You, you, have you need to... the discography. Well, I mean, you can just look at what other people have found in it. Yeah, that's... You don't have to actually own it. Sam is not a fan of Pink Floyd. Uh, All the music is not for everybody. Like my kid always says, you can like different things. It's okay. It's a, I think it's called Pink Floyd Discovery? Box set, I think. I don't know, honey, but I don't think we need to be doing this right now. And I'm sure that's not it if it's $11. No, it's 106 Oh, okay. Yeah. Anyways. I just put them all on my iPad. I mean, I have it, but... <laughs> yeah, it's just I went dumps crying. Yeah, uh-huh. Uh, you're just not a party man, babe. I'm, I'm not. <laughs> I'm clearly, I'm not. I, it, clearly. Uh, Pink Floyd goes in the same bin as Prince. Ugh. Who are you people? Well, Mr. Green was correct about other things, so I will let that slide. <laughs> <out>. <laughs> Who are you people? <laughs> Uh, I'm not even old enough. I just turned through Pink Floyd is awesome. Well, I, Pink Floyd is always good. Yeah, that, yeah that, that's for all ages. Except animals. We don't talk about animals. No, that was... okay. It's like, tool, everyone likes Tool, but we don't talk about a perfect circle. No, that's <laughs> terrible. We just, it's like the third Godfather. It doesn't exist. It's not real. Okay. But we have quite a bit to go over. Okay, I got... Oh boy! Here I got go. a hot take for you. Here we go. The Beatles fucking blow. Yeah, the Beatles are terrible. So is Grateful Dead. No, Grateful Dead's good because the Grateful Dead is good from their shows and their tours, and like even still now, the Dead is touring without Jerry. You you go to Grateful you you listen to Grateful Dead at the shows. Like that's the whole thing is the show, and it's the people in the environment more than just the music. The Beatles doesn't have anything like that. The Beatles has always just been trash. Okay. We're on the same picture. <laughs> okay, here's one that usually gets me in shit. <laughs> Red Hot Chili Peppers and Nirvana. Garbage. Mm, that's wrong. I got yelled at by the Uber driver the one day. Yeah, you did. I'm like, Nirvana sucks! Every song. It's a, it's a kind of it's music. Grunge. It's I grunge. Get, I get it, but it's the it's same thing. It's just not thing. for you. Just like Prince is not for me, and that's okay. And I love you anyway. But I actually have a point. No. <laughs> if you don't like Prince, you're objectively wrong. <laughs> Never like those two. I'm what's in on that. Red Hot Chili Peppers, I used to really like. But that, I don't know. It just kind of. I like. Okay, maybe Red Hot Chili Peppers aren't that bad. They have like a good album. Yeah. Like all, all those no, bands in like the, that 90s music era all like they had a good album and then they just kind of went Lech. and that was it all of them wait hold on Zach said something what did that what did Zach say I'm sure it was uh, I remember hearing the Beatles were great and the first song I heard was Yellow Submarine <laughs> uh, Zach said Perfect Circle is good what the fuck Animals is good what the fuck Animals okay. is the... So we're just making people angry right off the bat today. Sorry, guys. Uh, Animals is the worst <laughs> album from the best band. <laughs> a perfect circle was dog shit. 
Pearl Jam. Pearl Jam. Uh, you know what? At least we can all get along and agree that Chantel and Amber suck. <laughs> I mean, that's what we all have in common. Three Eleven is all right. <laughs> Three Eleven is a little more niche, though. Like that's a little deeper cut. Like they had a what two hits? Yeah, that that was another one of those. We had one good song bands. Uh, Foo Fighters. I love Foo Fighters. See, the fact that you say I love the Foo Fighters, but Nirvana and and whatever other thing you said were trash is insane. Who likes the Foo Fighters? Everybody. Nobody likes the Foo Fighters, babe. They're like Prince. Nobody likes the Foo Fighters. <laughs> Just nobody likes Prince either. <laughs> no, nobody likes Prince, no. and nobody likes the Foo nobody Fighters. Nobody likes Michael Jackson. Stop it. <laughs> Michael Jackson. Awful. Gone. <laughs> I like Foo Fighters. <laughs> Disturbed. I like Disturbed gets a little samey. Uh I Metallica's always good. Um I, yeah, see? I like Foo Fighters. Oh, okay, fine. Awesome. Meh. But, Meh. Lame. But Dave Grohl is amazing. Uh-huh. He, nothing to no, I, <laughs> he was okay in Nirvana. He was better in the Foo Fighters. <laughs> <laughs> People, I've seen yes, it. Livy. Oh my God, content! I told him we should not do this today. I said, let's not, let's not come on and be divisive about Prince. But no, <laughs> here we are, down a fucking rabbit hole. Ah, oh, lovely. Uh, Black Keys. I like Black Keys. They're also local-ish. Uh, Metallica is over. It's coming. Right Ooh, now. new stream boss. Look at that. Wow. Fire Ray. Fire Ray coming in hot with the two hundred dollars American. Holy moly. Wow. Uh, my 38th birthday is in 10 days. I love you both. Happy well, ha almost birthday. Happy early birthday. Thank you very much for the 200 and the donation I haven't Thank seen you for so much. fucking ever. Thank you. And yes, I agree. Metallica. Metallica sucks. After load. Overrated. Not great. Um, Melanska. Never been big on Prince myself. Oh, sorry. I can't read the rest of that. <laughs> no. The, says Shelly's correct. Sorry. You're wrong. Thank you, Melanska. Yeah. Yes, thank I'm you. correct. Uh, Dr Rob Zombie always top tier. I love Zombie. I even like his movies. I like his movies more than his music. That was Hellbilly Deluxe was the first, first CD I ever bought with my own money. I can tell. What is that supposed to be? <laughs> Wait a minute. G give me a second to get offended by that. What is that supposed to mean? Nothing. I'm just teasing you, honey. Hmm. Huh. Uh, All right. Uh, <laughs> it gets hearts in the chat for uh, birthday, Ray. Thank you very much. Uh, a few songs from those albums are good, but the album. Anyway. 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 We have. <laughs> that's a lot to him. I know. It took me a second. <laughs> yeah, that, I'm, I'm just fucking with you. No, but but Cougar Knife is right. All Rob, song, all, all Rob Zombie songs sound the same. Yes, they do. They do. They all sound the same. Kind of, yeah. Yeah. I don't care. <laughs> okay. Oh, Anthrax. Ooh, Anthrax is always good. Uh-uh. I, I never liked that kind of, that kind of metal I, music. I, think, I never really got into that. I, early Metallica, Megadeth, Anthrax, that stuff. I think that was thrash, speed metal. They all seem like hair bands to me. I just <laughs> lumped them all in with hair bands because they're all the, the men with the perms. And no, never hair bands it. is like Twisted Sister. Yeah, but they all had the same hairdo, so I didn't listen to any of them. No, they're, they're not hair. They're speed metal. They're I think speed is the right way to do it. Danzig? Yes, Danzig. Always Danzig. Danzig is very good. Not as good as Jerry only, but very good. No better. Yeah, exactly. No better. <laughs> no, he's better. Oh, you we mean no this. comma better. No comma better. <laughs> Uh, flogging, Molly, flogging Molly is S tier. I saw them live at the old Peabody's in Cleveland back in like 2006. Okay. That, that was good. Okay. Offspring? Very good. Okay. We're, no. we're MS. I'm at, oh, fuck. The Offspring was another band that had like a few good songs. They had, they had a lot of hits, actually. Eh, not really good ones, like, though. They had, like, annoying radio songs that they played 700 times and you didn't want to hear it ever again. Yeah. Uh, MSI, that, oof, that's middle school shit. Yeah. Mindless self-indulgence, uh -huh. that's good. Anyway, we have a lot of Chantel to get through because our Goral has been busy and Salad is worming his way back in. <gasps> is he? 
He's showing up in chats, talking in streams. Oh, maybe he's partly ungrounded. I think he just finally came back. Because I think he said something like, you don't, you don't let me in video, you go home. <laughs> maybe. The Thrash, the Big Four, Metallica, Megadeth, Anthrax, and Slayer. I, I don't know if I would put Slayer in with them. Yeah, it all fits together. I would put Slayer more in the death metal category with death. With death. Yeah, the, the band Death. Okay. It's a good band. Okay. Anyway, the one. Okay, last last music thing. If, if nobody, no more music things. If nobody's hip to it, and you like kind of like melodic, really musically talented metal, check out a band called Woe Fat. W. U. No W. You don't even know how to say it. It's, uh, yeah, D W U. Uh, w O F A T. Woe fat. And it they are fantastic. Okay. I I w I can just put on one of their albums and just let it play. Okay. It they're very good. So go ahead and check that out. Sinatra spells badly, right? right Zach? <laughs> and reads badly too. That was good. So I do have a couple of uh, housekeeping things that I have to get through. Okay. I have made the things. You made that things? I have been dragging my feet on. Oh, good job. I made the gorilla train gift. You made it. I made the gorilla I train we would gift. I never get that. It took me a little bit. To... <laughs> Look, I have like a backlog of shit I got to do, <laughs> and I woke up motivated this morning and got most of it done. Good job, babe. I made the gorilla train gift, and I made the chief awu. Oh, fancy. So there is a Chief Awu down below at 777. Oh, yeah, that's the big one. 77. I will put together a package for it, but I need a little time. Oh, it's got to have Eve stuff in it. So if you do decide that that is something you would like to join, I will, I'll jot your name down, I'll put it together, I will set it aside. I will get a package put together, but that is uh, May. I'll start that. Yeah, that sounds about right. Because I've got IRL pro. I think I've got like three big ones in April mm -hmm. that I'm a part of, and every week till then. So I will, I will start putting that together in May. But I can keep a list of people who join, and when I get it together, I will send it out to you. It's going to be cool. It will be very cool. It's going to be Eve. <coughs> yeah, I'll, you just send you Eve. We can <laughs> just chop up Eve and send parts of her. We could not do that, oh, okay. actually. Then you could actually send Eve. Well, I would just, the first person to get it just gets Eve on their doorstep. <laughs> that, okay. <laughs> or floofs of floof. Well, that seems <laughs> a little weird. <laughs> They're just going to pluck my dog floof and throw it in a bag. Yep. No, well, no, it's uh, going to be cute, cute evenings. Are we getting new comic club packages sometime in the future? Uh, I want to say yes, but like I said, with the, with the Awu Club, the Chief Awu, we got to come up with a dope what? name for it. Chief Awu. Alpha Wu. Maybe Alpha Wu, but... Yeah, we we got ideas for the next comic club package. We're, we've Probably been summertime, maybe. We've been kicking around ideas, but it, uh, it time because mm. all these things take time. We I do ninety eight percent of this myself. Oh well, yeah, and then you gotta like order the things, have them printed, have them made. Yeah, I got. I need to have it's proofs made. I got to do the whole gimmick. Yeah. So it will be a thing, but in time. It's coming eventually. It, like I said, I have a few projects IRL that I have to work on, and that is going to keep me busy until the end of April. Yep. So once that's done, I can start putting in work on the Awu Club, and then I will after the Awu Club's done, I will do the next uh, stacker package. We'll figure it out. So in time, it will come, but time is the issue right now. 
So I just thought I'd put that out there. If you guys want to see what the uh, new Gorilla Train GIF looks like, that is all up to you. I got to make sure I have that set correctly because I did not. Good thing I double checked. So guys, smash that like button. Share it out on your social media should you feel so inclined. Right, wife. Life good. Wife fight back. Kill wife. Look at that monkey wife butt. gone. Think about wife. Regret. Oh, poor. Right. That's so cute. Alright, that's one. That does not make a train. That does not make a train. One but it, that's the... What's the first car of the train car called? The, the caboose? No, that's the back. The oh, caboose is in the back. No, that's the first. No, the caboose is in the back. Mm -mm. The front is the engine. There we go. <laughs> that's the engine. There you go. Yeah, that's, that is the engine. Yeah. If I, if I don't tell her, I would have let it go for like 20 minutes. I knew minutes. it wasn't the caboose. I would have let that go for like 20 minutes. No, it's not the caboose. Did you ever see a real caboose on a train? Yeah. They're cool. There's one um, off the track that you can like go up onto and do all that stuff in uh, Homestead Falls. Yeah. Um. Shelly is the caboose tonight. I'm always the caboose. They don't use cabooses anymore. I think cabooses were for more like passenger trains. Yeah. Not so much cargo trains. Probably. I don't know what purpose they served. To go outside? I think. What? The, to, for the people on the train to go outside? People in the train. Go outside onto what? The caboose. The caboose is like a, like a little gazebo that rides on the back of the train. Okay. Yeah. All right, let's get to this. <laughs> All right. I'm just going to go ahead and assume it doesn't math. That, that caught me off guard. <laughs> I, I swear it is. It's like you can stand on it. It's got little railings on the side. Right? <laughs> no. Yeah. The caboose I seen had that. And it was yellow. So, whatever you're talking about, I don't know. No, Caboose was train staff. That's where they would, like, watch to make sure no one's jumping on the back of the train and to report any issues. So people could go out there? No, that's where they would live. They would, they would just live there? They would sleep in that. That's where they would... They be. lived in the Caboose? Yeah, during a train ride, you would live in the Caboose. Like, you're in, on there for two days to go from L.A. to... So all of the passengers lived in the Caboose? Oh, God. Shut up. Yes. No, they did not. All of the pa every single passenger of a train lived in the caboose. I didn't just say it was staff. No, they don't live in the caboose. They have to drive the train. You know there is more than one person that drives a train, right? No, it's just the train conductor with the hat. <laughs> so what? It's the man with the hat that so drives the train. One guy. One, one guy. One guy by himself. Yes. Drives it for like four days. And, yes. And, uh, and he wears a hat. Everybody's so creepy. <laughs> That's what I think, Jessica. But apparently, we are wrong, Jessica. Jeez, Shelly, you're so creative. You're so pretty. You're so pretty. Let me have my imaginary you're so caboose. Pretty. Jesus, I know what the caboose is for on my train, and it's for standing outside and smoking. That's what's for. <laughs> oh fuck. Okay. All right. We have 530 people watching, 40 likes. Guys, smash that like button. <laughs> Thank you for your input, Shelly. <laughs> Share it out on your social media. The, it doesn't math. Shelly is, she is the captain of this train. Uh, I know where we're going. I have the hat. Fuck. Oh. Why does he just stand there and wait to get his head chopped? Because he was nailed to... He didn't to even the, try. He was stabbed to the door. He didn't even, like, put his arm up or nothing. He didn't even try. What was he going to do to get his arm cut off, too? Well, at least try to not get your head chopped. Once you're ran through with a sword, you're pretty much done. Meh. I would still try. Eight hours of Kabusta. <laughs> history buff for the big 110. Oh, my God, content. Good thing you're so pretty, shall we? Thank you, history buff. I'm doing my best. <laughs> you are doing your best. <laughs> Shelly, you woke up silly today. I'm very sleepy. Maybe that's why. <laughs> okay, you can be sleepy, but you... I am very sleepy. Right. And no, and I know what the caboose is for. 
And I know what the captain of the train does. You know what you're reminding me? The captain? The driver. The driver. The train man. He honks the horn. That's it? And he wears the hat. That's all he does. Yeah, because you don't have to steer the train. It just drives itself. <sighs> right? No. You can't turn left or right. You're you can the, only go forward in the train. You're the guy on that, that TikTok... <laughs> Where he's like, what animal can you take? <laughs> he's bouncing off my booty cheeks. I love the way he rides. I can hardly breathe when he's pumping deep inside. I kiss him on his neck and then he kisses on my pussy. Call him daddy while I holler. Man, that boy's so damn good looking. Why does he make the face? Don't make the face, Grandpa. God. It's so gross. Uh, J. Kate came in with a full explanation. Caboose provides shelter for crew at the end of the train, who were formerly required to switch and shunting, keeping a lookout for load shifting, damage, equipment, and cargo. But so, they just live, everybody okay, lives in the caboose, by the way. I don't care about who, where, lives, right, where right. in the train. You can go outside right. on the caboose. Why fight back? Kill wife. Wife gone. Think about wife. Regret. Regret. It's gonna be you if you keep telling me I'm wrong. <laughs> I'm not telling you anything. Right, what? You, you, the caboose is for going outside. People can be outside on the train standing and riding on the caboose. Uh, I don't know who lives in it and who sleeps in it and what shit they put in it, but I know that you can go out of the little door of the caboose and be outside and on the train. I... This is true. This is true. This is that true. That is not what you said. That's exactly <laughs> That's what I said. The caboose is where you go outside. You you are on the train still, but you're outside. That's the caboose. And the people on the train can go outside on the caboose. That's what I said. That's exactly what I said the whole time. I've been right all along. The caboose is where you stand outside on the train. The caboose. Is where you go outside. The caboose is not just a rolling porch. Uh, pretty much, yeah. I mean, if you can go stand out there and you're outside and you're like on the porch, but you're on the train. That is what it is. I don't know what's inside of the inside part, but that's what's on the outside part. How do you know so much about trains, man? Because I've seen them and the one goes right down the street and I get stopped at it all the time. And one time I did see a caboose on a train there. That's where I saw the caboose the time I saw the caboose. And there was a man standing on the back of it. And that's how I know you could go outside on the caboose. You know what you remind me of? You, you... I swear. I saw the man on the outside of the caboose, so I know you can go outside on it. I don't know what's inside. I know that you can be outside on a train on the caboose. And I was right about that part. Hold on. <laughs> Oh, fuck. Oh, talk to the chat. I, I, I was right about this, right? I like trains, too. <laughs> <laughs> There's caboosery afoot. Uh, it makes sense. I've seen it. I, I gotta I gotta pull this clip. I, this, I just need to find it right now. Hold on. Give me a second. Uh, just give me one second. History buff, how am I wrong? The people can go outside. I don't know who they are or what they're doing out there, but they can be out there. They can be looking at the, the whatevers, the, but they're outside. Is my point, babe? I'm sorry, you're this guy right no, now. No, I'm not. You, it makes perfect sense. Animal in this world that you fear the least, fish, animal. <laughs> no, fish are animals. <laughs> you're this guy fish. right now. Inside of the rest you're, of it, this is I you. know there's a balcony. Fish. Animal, fish. <laughs> don't start. Don't. Don't. You're starting, and I'm not. A fish is an animal. No, it's not. I'm talking about an animal. Animal. Like fish. <laughs> Fish, fish, fish. <laughs> that's like saying like an ant. That's not an animal. Fish are animals. That's like I never a, said fish are an animal. A fish is an animal. You can't go to the zoo and see a fish. They don't have zoo fish. There's actually yes, so they many do fish. have zoo fish. There's fish zoos. No. You can go to a fish zoo. No, oh. there's so many fish that they have their own fucking attraction called an aquarium. That's different. That's for like sharks and shit. Fish. No, that's what they do. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> All right. Oh, Fine. Jeez, Louise. <laughs> how did we? How did we? How 
did we get from? Because you told me you can't go outside on a caboose, and you literally no, I can. Said it's not a rolling porch. It is if you go outside. <laughs> then the whole train is a rolling porch because you can go outside. No, of No, you every- can't. <laughs> no, you cannot. The rest of the train is enclosed. You can go from one car to the next. Outside. There's only a porch on the caboose. <laughs> it's outside. There's only a porch on the caboose. <laughs> Yeah, can we move on? I agree. Oh, oh crap. They don't have little porches in between each train. <laughs> I've seen trains in my life, and they don't have porches on them. Only the caboose does. <gasps> this is a mess. Bruce Campbell's chin, this has absolutely been derailed. You are correct, sir. Uh, I'm, I... All right. Okay. Moving on. I am correct, thank you. (laughs) (sighs) How did we get from... I don't know, but I have seen trains before, (laughs) and I know what I'm talking about. (laughs) Why are you insisting to tell me my eyes are lying to me? I've seen them. (laughs) You keep telling me to drop it, but you're just like fucking rolling aquariums. (laughs) Like airplanes. <laughs> uh, okay. 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 Lady, lady Lana <laughs> where's your rolling porch? Can we shut up? <laughs> Cougar knife, Shelly. What about the guy on the train who shovels the steam? Shovels the shovels the steam into the. That's engine. one of the workers. He shovels the steam. <laughs> <laughs> He just works there. He is not the captain, nor the caboose operator. He is just the man with the, the shovel. He's not the caboose man. He's not the he's not the horn blower or the porch sitter. The, look, it, I, I'm reading it as written: shovels steam into the engine. <laughs> uh, dirt merchant. We all know Cougar the caboose knife is also pretty. <laughs> yes, we all know the caboose is for twerking quickly. <laughs> How much train staff usually, bitch? <laughs> Okay, I'm crying. <laughs> Jesus, ammo, little Shelly Cook Girl, what is this on which you stand? Cabussy Red. <laughs> Why it is caboose? Oh, my dear child. Oh, God. Oh, thank you, ammo. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, Jesus okay, Christ. Okay, this was man. a mess. I told you we should not have started with this. <laughs> Everything went downhill from Different there. Different names. I'm talking about an animal like a monkey zebra. That's like saying a mammal. You just ended yourself. If you would have said mammal, I would have gave you different answer. You said animal. That's not a fish. Fish is an animal. No, fish. Think something with paws is an animal, dog. And fur. Is a lizard an animal? No. It's an insect. What's a, a lizard? reptile? It's an insect. Oh, That's, wow. th- that, that is. No, I know what animals are. <laughs> oh, fuck. Kimmy had an awesome weekend getaway with the boyfriend in Idaho Springs. Send a picture of my stupid cat to Shelly in the DMs. Oh, kitties. And girl, don't listen to these haters. You're smart and doing a good job. Thank you. I know, Kimmy. We're 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 correct. And your cat is probably also knows about cabooses, I would imagine. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I gotta th- hold on. I gotta think of a new goal here. I am so derailed, it's not even funny. We got we got the new kitchen chair. Uh fuck, what else do we need here? Oh, you know what? <laughs> oh, look at this kitty. He climbed up high. He's a good kitty. That's a tree cat. Oh. I, I, that's I, not an animal. That's a cat. I re- <sighs> <laughs> I read something the other... Okay, yeah. All right, that's good. I was going to do something else, but that's that's excellent. Um, I read something the other day that said cats are either bush cats or tree cats. Oh, yeah, that's a tree cat. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Anyway. What was that? A, a unknown number sent me a text message to my phone number that says, Are you Mary? I'm Annie. All right. Okay. Smash that like, share it out. To <laughs> check out that stream goal now. Thank you, Ham and Beans in the chat. Oh, yeah. I like that. Good idea. Just smash the like, share it out to thing with the thing and the thing down below. Um, 
we are one gorilla away from seeing the gorilla train gif and all that other stuff. You guys got it. Let's send a text of a caboose. That's a good answer. <laughs> just do do the thing. Let's just do the thing. Spicy chicken pizza mukbang. Hello, beezers. Did you? Oh, Shelly missed a member message. Oh no. One job. Fake gamer cat. I believe R two D two and history buff before Shelly. Yeah. Well, if I remember correctly, history buff says I'm right. I don't think that's what she said. <laughs> you know, no, you can now request no, a personalized video right. from me. I don't think that's what Hello, she said. Hello, Beezer. Cameos make great bro. Like a dead ham. Well, hello. Rat, cat, nobody cares about. I care about Bang. that cat and oh, rat. People. Hello, welcome back. What? What is going on with this audio? I think it's YouTube writ large. Back to another video. I'm your host, Miriam, <laughs> a.k.a. Chantel. Oh, you're not supposed to say your old name. He laughs at something unfunny. In her mind, it's religion talk, so I'm counting it. Alright, so, um, let's get this all over the way before I dig in. Bismillah. This is not... That pizza looked like it would have been good till she dumped ketchup all over it. Yes. I agree. I heavily, heavily fucks with a barbecue, uh, I'm sorry, a spicy, a buffalo spicy chicken pizza. Spicy chicken pizza sounds good. Ketchup does not go on No, that. it's already got tomato sauce. It does not go on that. You don't need extra tomatoes. Ketchup um, tastes nothing like pizza sauce. Mm -mm. Not even close. Mm -mm. I love ketchup. Okay. On a lot of things, but I would never put it on a pizza. Okay, I, I just want to make sure that we're on the same page here because you seem to be very far off key. Oh, me? Do you know just because they are both tomato products, they're not the same thing, right? Yes, I'm aware. Okay. I just said they don't taste the same. Yeah, but that doesn't mean so that they're can't not the just same. Put it on pizza like it's extra sauce because it's not. Okay, okay. I just I wanted to make sure you knew. Oh my leg. Uh, this is not diet food. Diet. What? I'm shocked. Food. Um. Yeah, so just struggling with eating healthier today, making a healthy choice. So this is what I'm eating. Pizza. Spicy chicken pizza. And I have some pickles, of course. So let's eat. Yeah, because that's what you do. Oh. Healthy choice. Pizza. Licks fingers while eating. No. Just. You notice every time she's got a jar of pickles, it's she always eats, a full jar of pickles. She eats right out of the jar. Well, she must eat the whole jar because the next day when she's got a jar of pickles, it's, it's a, a full jar. It's a different thing, too. Yeah, it's always full. Diet soda. Yeah, that's going to that's gonna save the calories. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Olga, me too. That wine glass is so stupid. Mm. Why? Because she's it's a very annoying big, to have soda in a wine glass. She's a big baby. She's a fancy girl. I'm just very excited for you guys to see the Gorilla Train gif. I think you're going to like it. Ammo. Explain yourself immediately. Ammo, are you okay? Hey, there's John Galt. Where are you been? Oh. And this is sped up, too. I think we might have to go to 1.5. Oh, yeah. She's very slow. Stops talking. Ooh, that hurt. Yep, that hurt. Uh, whatever, she she hit that... Uh, Why is this on foil? Did she cook it at home, or is she just using foil as a plate? It, it's one of those heat-up pizzas. Oh, yeah, okay. So she's just eating it on the I thing she put like, in the oven in. You don't know about ketchup on popcorn? Don't fuck with me. No, we're not putting ketchup on popcorn. Three months, maybe? We're not Can putting hot sauce on popcorn, either. This is strange. That, wouldn't that make your popcorn mushy? Yeah, I would think you could probably make your mush. Then you just have mushy corn. You could probably get away with like the the Frank's Red Hot seasoning. Yeah, seasoning wouldn't but, make it mushy. Yeah, you don't want mushy on it. Oh no no. Long time. I hope you know I'm gonna have to try hot sauce on my popcorn later. Slop corn. Yeah, that's what it sounds like. Stop it. Okay, you know what? Yeah, sorry. Foodie's dent your fit. <laughs> so, damn it. Sorry, ham and beans. This, That's a better one. Yeah. That's a good one. Come on, will you just let me copy? 
we go. Stealing all mad yikeses on bikes' ideas. <laughs> I like hot pie. Yikeses. Okay, so you, it hurts your teeth. That's the second like, bite that's hurt your teeth. Oh, I wasn't even looking. Yeah. Yeah, that that, that hurt. She's like, still gonna eat the whole thing. Where I, like... Oh, that's a little bit crunchy. Mm hmm. So, okay. We... She doesn't even look like she likes it. Like, she's not once made a yum. Not one yum. Because she probably doesn't like it. It's probably all she had there. She's frowning at it right now. Like Amber frowned at the oatmeal. No, we can't talk about that. <laughs> Super obsessed over, the, like, certain food. I don't eat it, like, almost every day. You already put ketchup on there. She needs extra sugar. I go through a pizza, like, everyday pizza phase. Pizza, pizza. Because that's all... Ketchup is... Sugar and tomato. Mm -hmm. So she just needs extra sugar on her sugar. Yep. Pizza, pizza. Like when I was living in Canada. And, um. Pizza and pickles. Alright, I wonder. Did. <laughs> like two slices disappeared during that. No, that's the one that's in her hand. No. No. Oh, yeah, you're right. Italy? It's been one week it's since you looked at me. Yeah, you have greasy fingers in the jar. I didn't think about that. She's putting her ketchup fingers into the pickle jar. Okay, I can't say it, but just look at I see it. Look at that. I see it. It looks like a snowman. Oh my god. <laughs> the only thing grounded. Like the only reason I probably don't eat it every day is because of the effort you have to put into making it. <laughs> the effort you have to put you put it on a piece of foil and stuck it in the oven. What is the effort? You <laughs> opened the box. Put out the foil, put the pizza on the foil, and done. Don't you like your pickles with she ketchup and... She put it on a plate. Ketchup and grease in them? Um. Oh, God. Le uh, uh, ketchup, uh, uh, spit, pizza grease. Right in the pickle jar. Mm, don't you like your pickles with extra gross? Yeah. She's got to wash her hands off somewhere, I guess. <laughs> so yeah, back then, pizza pizza. Like one of those finger bowls. All dressed, which is like mushroom, green pepper, pepperoni, with a garlic dip. Right now it's chicken pot pie. Uh, I adjusted it a little bit, so it should be a little more even. Um. What else? Oh. Again. Yeah. Did this, you see? this is painful to her. What else? Every, every time it's a crust bite, she's wincing at the pain from eating pizza crust. Yeah, she did so not. So either she burnt the shit out of it or something. Oh, yeah, she did not like that one. When I was a teenager, I went through this phase of, like, eating a box of, uh, like, the Betty Crocker mashed potatoes, the urban garlic instant mashed potatoes. So to anyone who doesn't understand what's going on, because I just had to run through my memory to figure it out, she's talking about food that she eats a lot. Mm-hmm. Yep. That's it. Yep. And I would just eat those. <laughs> like, like. Oh those. my god, get a fucking pickle. We're going out of style. Get a fork. Mm. Oh, Ooh. I forgot forks are illegal in Kuwait. Oh, uh, that one really hurt. Oh, that's spicy. <laughs> Even pickled. Are there different things in the jar? She doesn't know. That that thing that she just threw down was different than the other things she's been eating. It's like an assortment of different things in the jar. So yeah. She didn't even look at what it was before she took a bite that, of it. That was a struggle breath and a half. Did you hear that? <laughs> So it's like they got the pickles and there's one pepper in it maybe to make them all spicy. But then she didn't even look when she pulled it out and just stuffed it in her yeah. mouth. Yeah, I think so. Oh my god. Are you done washing your hands? Oh, yeah. 8,000 so. views. Mm-hmm. 
Didn't you just say that was too spicy? It sounds like Eve. It's Eve with a snack. <laughs> Pickle jerk love. I'm trying to think of what else to talk about. You're trying to think of what else to talk about. Uh -huh. Ketchup flavored chips. I don't know if you guys have those. And um, onion dip, French onion dip. Mm. I love spicy. This is a whole fucking pizza. This is a terrible video. Is oh, this I all that it. she's doing is eating pizza and saying, I like food? Yeah. Or thin crust. Does she ever sit on the couch? I don't know. I feel like we'd be able to see stains. But I would get thin crust because I don't like... Um. This is angry manic eating. I mean, it is uh, it is sped up, but shenanigans. still, it's manic. The way she's like from bite to bite and picking things up and putting them down is weird. Can we get a big all hail blue whale in the chat, by the way? Oh, hail blue whale. No reason. Filling up on the bread, I like the toppings more. What comes to pizza? <clears throat> Look at that big clump of cat hair right on her scuba, Steve. Yep. Just fold it and shove it all in your mouth in one bite. You know you want to. But right now, she should stop. You've, you've eaten half of the pizza. More than half. You can stop now. Eat a couple more pickles and be done. And by the way, she's eaten half a jar of pickles and half of a fucking large pizza in seven minutes. Yeah. So that should be out. Maybe tomorrow or the next day. She doesn't even care. Like, she's just chewing with... This is how she eats when nobody's looking. Mm -hmm. Be quiet! Shut yeah, right? Up! Be quiet! Uh, I'm stuck at home with a fever and tonsillitis. You guys are the pick-me-up I was missing. Thank you. Well, thank you, Ammo. Sorry about your tonsillitis, Ammo. Yeah, sorry about your stupid tonsils. That I can sucks. take them out for you. No, I don't think you should do that. I'm a doctor. Not that kind of doctor. We are one gorilla away from showing the new thing. You haven't even seen it yet. That's true. Oh. We gotta finish a whole pizza. Mm. In case you can't tell, I was really hungry. What are you doing? What are you doing? That dang fupa thing where she called Pete's. And he was, what are you doing? Oh my god, I was cracking up. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah? Oh, that was another hurt. Fizzy drink. I love ice. Yeah, these pickles, I think I said this before, but they're like little cucumbers, but. That <laughs> All pickles are cucumbers, dummy. Thank you. Chantel for letting us know <laughs> that they are cucumbers. I didn't know what pickles were. They're, um, well, she does call everything pickles, even when it's not. Yeah. Look how small this one is. Remember it was pickled garlic? She's like, it's a pickle! <laughs> what are you doing, pickle? <laughs> <laughs> Come here, pickle, what are you doing? Some studies and dill. Um, I use tampon and so good. Can you poop your pants? No. It's not a potato. I love pickle food. <laughs> There's some pickle food I would never try though. No offense. What? If you like it. We don't all have to like the same thing. For me? Yeah? Okay. I, don't, I would never try pickles like tongue or feet. There's your thumbnail right there. Holy moly, girl. Yeah, go ahead and grab that one while it's up here. <laughs> yeah, you guys want some pickled tongue? Yum! That sounds delicious. You want some pickled tongue? 
Uh, her talking, or her taking one bite of each pickle and laying it down is driving me up a wall. You know, she probably did that in the jar. Like she would take a bite and then put it back yeah, in probably. the jar. Yeah, probably. Thank you, Lancelot. Appreciate it. I'm not fond of pickled eggs as well. I've never even seen a pick. I've never had a pickled egg. I've seen them, but I would not eat them. Pickled cheese. Any kind of pickled vegetable. I think. No, just pickled pickles okra. only. For me, thanks. Yeah. Pickled. pickled jalapenos are all right. The crust is not as filling. That's for sure. You ate a whole pizza, and you're like, I'm not full. You should be full. You Maybe should be... if you'd slow down a little bit and didn't eat the whole thing in under 10 minutes, you might be full. You should be sick. Yeah. Medium. Oh, it's just a medium. Oh, okay. That might as well be personal pan size. <laughs> Pickled jalapeno <laughs> So, I don't really have much to talk about. Oh. Yeah, I've noticed. <laughs> I feel like talking much. Then just binge in private, then. Yeah. Literally nobody wants to see this. Nobody needed to see it. Nobody. It's been what comments does she have on this? Winter season in Kuwait rains a lot. I'm curious. Are the Facebook grandmas like, oh, you made such a good pizza, Chantal? Oh, she's not even moderating these. Oh, yeah, she's not even. This comment's attention. coming from a caring place. I used to weigh like 400 pounds. I'll never eat. Entire pizza wasn't filling. That's not normal. Check your blood sugar. No. Why are all of these. Why do you always have to have a side of something with everything? Yeah, uh, no. Yeah, she's not moderating her comments. Something. Four numbers. Something four numbers. Something four numbers. These are probably all of her new bots. What diet? What diet? <laughs> Can't wait for the dentist bees. Okay, other people were catching on to that. Interesting, interesting, interesting. The pizza went down in two hits. The ketchup uh, hit the top of it, and the sugar hit the seven hundreds. <laughs> Thank you. So when we go out, sometimes it literally, literally rains on a parade. <laughs> so now we're just saying how it rains in Kuwait sometimes. Uh -huh. Oh, there's it. Internal monologue. Yep. Oh, it rains hard. Things get wet. Yeah. Yep. Things, yep. Get, things wet. get wet. Shocking. Wow. We're at eleven. I'm. Yeah. Really where's like, your rain, Westerners? There's a story <laughs> in the news. Uh oh. With all that's going on in the world, there's a story of a. No rain. Um. No rain. A stingray. I think it's oh, out of aquarium in North Carolina. Okay, no more, because I get oh, no, the whole door. Um, and it's pregnant. And the workers there are surprised because, like... We covered this story on the AAA. A stingray got pregnant, and they think a shark did it. What? I don't think that's how that Why works. Why wouldn't another stingray have did it? There wasn't one, but, like, I don't think... I think mathematically, those two things are so wildly different. Like, you know, you can have a lion and a tiger, you get a liger, but Maybe they're born are sterile. Maybe be a shark gray. Those are born sterile. So, yeah. like, nature's like, 90% of the time you can't get to that point. But if you do get to that point, mathematically, we're stopping it there. Uh -huh. So I don't think that a shark knocked up a stingray. That might be cute. I think it made it with a shark. Well, you, uh, horses and donkeys can reproduce, uh -huh. but their offspring are born sterile, so they can't reproduce. Right. It's like a, it, it's a natural failsafe that just happens. Or it like has its own clone eggs. I don't know something like that. Did it mated with a shark? No, it, they didn't say it mated with the shark. She's just dumb. What the heck kind of creature is that going to be? I don't want to know. It's more likely a, a case of asexual reproduction. That is very, uh, 
very likely. I've been a diabetic for eight years. I uh, saw diabetes slowly kill my grandfather. This is honestly hard to watch. Uh, yeah, not easy. It might very well be the end of time. <laughs> Who knows? Anyways. I got nothing. Hmm. Been um watching things relaxing. <laughs> so I've been watching Netflix. Exciting. They're just watching television, guys. It's not hanging out with her husband. Mm, no. Right, can we skip? Yes. I'm gonna please skip ahead. See if there's anything being talked about here. Nice. Sorry, I didn't have much interesting to talk about. Well, now yep. you have and clearly not. By the way, this is at 1.5. Let's see how this sounds normal. Thanks for watching, guys. Sorry I didn't have much interesting to talk about. Well, now you know the Stingray story. I mean... Wow. Jesus Christ. You can eat a pizza without turning on your camera. Don't do that. If you're that bored, tired, just don't feel like it, whatever that you're feeling right now, just don't turn on your camera. This is sad. This sounds like brain dead. That... One more time. Just look at this. I'm talk about... Well, now you know. Thanks for watching, guys. Sorry I didn't have much interesting to talk about. Chantel is so wildly depressed mm -hmm. that she is abandoned in Kuwait. No, she loves her life. She's the happiest she's ever been. We're all just jealous that we're not her right now. Uh huh. Who watches this boring crud directly? I can't. I don't think anybody yeah. really can. I don't see how. There's no way. There's just no way. Okay, next video. This one was terrible. Guys, let's check that like ratio before we move on. We have... 650 people watching and 190 likes. That don't math. That don't math, guys. Smash that like button. Share it out. Do the thing with the thing and the thing down below. We need a gorilla for the other thing. And let's move to the next one. Bingo bongo. A Canadian explores Kuwait. Wow. All right. I, I've heard about this one. Is she actually going to go outside? I've heard about this. Users, what I have to do is... Bye. It is warm today. Oh. Man, dang Fupa nailed the teeth color on this. Look at that. <laughs> it's winter day in Kuwait. So let's go out and see what... Uh, get some sunshine, I guess. Get some breakfast. See what else is up. Yalla. Uh, food. Of course, food. Bang, food. Alright, guys. Ooh. Why would you film this? Why do you still have the plastic up on the visors? I have That's so many weird. questions. Why would you take it off the seats but not the visors? But look at this angle. Her seat is like all the way in the back and her belly is up against the glove box. Super comfortable. We're going to pick up some breakfast life, slash lunch. Oh, here we go. Life yeah. good. Wife fight back. Kill wife. Wife gone. Think about wife. Regret. All right, are you ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Are you ready? Ride wife. Gorilla train. Ride wife. Life. Yet. Wife fight back. Kill wife. <laughs> wife gone. Think about wife. I'm glad it's the butt part. Regret. I wanted it to be the riding part, but at least it's the butts. Well, the riding part is stationary. Ride wife. Well, yeah, that's true. Did that's you, true. you like that? I like it. <laughs> I, I like it a lot. I think that's good. Uh, ammo, what's this do? You know what that do. Hey, uh, message to you, Sin. Uh, just something I felt needed to be said. Take it easy and don't overdo it. Uh, 
you work way too hard and we love all, you for all that you do and Shelly our lovely goddess stay sexy <laughs> beautiful finger guns love you both oh I love you Liz thank you very much and uh, I don't know how to not <laughs> Nobody respects the train. <laughs> and yes, Call to Curl, that is new stream boss. Nicely done, sir. Very nicely done. Oh, we got the picture. Thank you. Lunch here. There's a lot of these little restaurants here in Kuwait. They sell like hot tire. This is an awful angle. Uh huh. This is a terrible angle. They sell pizza. And of course, this is the one where their audio is working properly. Sell falafel. Okay, come on, man. Wait, you're fucking with me. Awful. They sell shawarma. They sell all kinds of things. So we're gonna grab a few things. I'll show you what we get uh, before we hit the road. Oh, we're gonna go for a long drive. I always love long drives, as I've always said. So yellow. I thought you had sciatic pain. They didn't even go inside to eat. He got food and brought it out to the car. You know he did. He did not even let her go inside the restaurant. Would you? No. Would you let her, like, fumble her way into a restaurant to go, I need... Find your falafels. A four falafel sammies. Oh, my goodness. You stay in car... Okay, we see it. So we came to Wafra here in Kuwait to check out Darshaka Farms. Oh, the Wafra garbage is on the side of the road? Oh, oh, I want to hear what she's saying. Check Hold out on. the trash pile. Bulbous is a word for it, yeah. We came to Wafra here in Kuwait to check out Darshaka Farms. Wafra is an area of Kuwait known for its farms. But we first... Yeah, look at this f fertile farming land. Mm -hmm. first came across this abandoned school that we decided to check out, being that we both love exploring abandoned places. So when have you ever explored an abandoned? When, <laughs> when have we ever seen Chantel exploring abandoned places? He didn't want to take her to the farm because she looked extra round today. Oh God! Gaslights. Oh, Salad is cringe. I take you to abandoned school. We do ghost hunting. Yeah, we go to bomb school. <laughs> That's video. <laughs> On her Car falafels and empty buildings. Her nine. <laughs> 99,000 uh, subscriber channel. Yeah. She did not even break 5,000 views on this video. Yeah. Yeah. I wonder how many of those subscribers are button. Bot button? Button. Oh, this is riveting. Look at the we, piles are of we even going to it or we're just driving by it? Like we went to the mall the other day by driving by it. I thought that Kuwait was super rich as a country. It was supposed to be super rich. Uh huh. That why does it look like fucking shit? That's a good question. Like everywhere that's not a city is literally trash a bias. trash heap. Yeah, just trash everywhere. Like what? Do they not have dumps, or do they just throw their shit I in the desert? I think the desert is the dump. Look at that. It's weird, though. That. Like, the desert is the dump, and then they go and camp out there. Let's go set up our tent in the dump. We're the same place we dump our trash. It's kind of weird. Cat Mom says a lot of Middle Eastern countries are like this. Big cities have a lot of money, but the rest is very poor. But very poor still. Why Why the trash everywhere? Yeah. Like, you can be very poor without just trash piles. Yeah, you up. can be poor and know where garbage goes. Maybe that's where garbage goes. Just. I know, like, they burn. Like, they do the thing where they, like, burn billions of tires and make massive smoke. Like, maybe they just throw it in the desert and then burn it once in a while. Maybe. It's like South Central, yeah. God, look at this. Just dump. It's open manhole right there. Yeah, fun. We just saw this clip. This looks like... You could tell me this was East Cleveland. Yeah. It's 
so many artists around. It's probably like 55 times safer than East Cleveland. Oh, yeah. However, can Americans really talk? No. I'm just being judgy. Oh, our town is pretty ghetto, and we don't have trash piles just laying around. Not like this. No, no. I mean, I mean like you might see a random soda can rolling down the street, hey guys, but it's not like this. this. No. There has been a piece of furniture like laying on the side of the road know, up that time. way for it's like seven night, months. <laughs> Where? And I'm walking later. slow. Sorry about that. <laughs> oh my god! Look at her dragging the and foot. And I'm walking slow. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay. She can't walk. She can't walk. She's she's not bending her ankles now. It was always knees not bent, but now the ankles are straight too. She's just straight ankles. I gotta see it one more time. That's weird. If she's in that much pain, she shouldn't be out wandering around. Wow. Wow. I think her whole leg is numb. Mm-hmm. I think she's just learning to live with it. Uh-huh. Everybody is saying that's diabetic neuropathy. Just, it is numb. She can't feel it. <laughs> I'm just going to leave this here for a second. How's your day going, man? I'm great. Look at this picture of beauty in her country of beauty. It's so much better than the Western world. So uh, he was going to take me to a farm... But we decided to go to a bombed out school instead. Yes. I don't think that's a verse in a store. No. I mean, that was like her romantic Valentine's Day trip to drive past the mall and then look at camels. Mm hmm. I love this for her. All right, let's go see. It's like he's got to take his Looks dog for a walk destroyed. once in a while out of the house. <laughs> so he just like takes it wherever. Just, just it has to go for a walk. Yeah. Like, this would be cool to go explore if you could actually explore it. Yeah, she can't explore. She can do look through the window and then walk back to the car. There's like piles of sand, sand mountains, sand hills. Thank you. Piles Shanta. of sand. There's yes. Pi there's piles of sand, guys. And there's beetles, these weird bugs I've never seen before. That's a Thank you, Salad Shitcock, for getting down there and getting the mangles for that's us, a cameraman. Dung beetle. <clears throat> that's Salad's favorite kind. That's a di I, twice in a row. Twice in a row, Shitcock has zoomed in on something poop -related. poop related. Yep. They're friends. Leave the Beatles alone, Salad. What? Why are you fucking with them? <laughs> so unfortunately, I can't do too many adventurous things because of my leg right now is injured. But you, you notice she pointed at her hip. Uh huh. That is not where sciatic is. No. But her leg is numb. Uh huh. Good God. Classrooms are full of sand. What was that? Leg right now is injured, but. Hmm. Welcome to my <laughs> sand pile. Welcome to my face, and this is my sand pile. <laughs> you Westerners wouldn't understand. Classrooms are full of sand. This is kind of gross. Yeah. This is a little bit gross. This is just fucking weird. Nature's taking over. Y yeah, there's no windows, and the wind blows the sand in. I don't know why the schools are abandoned. I'm sure I can find out for you guys if I do well. Insert somewhere. So from what I could find, the school was most likely abandoned during the Gulf War. But more about that a bit later. Okay. So, yeah. Bombed out school. Yeah, literally a bombed out school. Just such content. This is wonderful content. And the Ooh. shoes that she's wearing, with all this shit on the ground, are not... It's not conducive for anything. No, I'm I'm worried she's gonna step on a piece of metal. It's gonna go into her foot. Yeah. I'm gonna try to. Just wearing them little over here. <laughs> flappy gym shoes is all she's got on. There's no. 
Can can we watch There's her no walk like in real time? Hardness now? to the bottom of those. All right, I'll put it in real time. This is normal speed. I'm gonna try to make it over here. <laughs> uh, this is really dangerous. There could be uh, unexploded ammo or an IED in that area. It clearly... I doubt it from this long. If yeah. it was Gulf War, it's probably been cleared over and walked over so many times. Not only that, well, they still find shit from like World War II, but this place looks pretty. Right. Well traveled. Yeah, everybody's been over there spray painting and fucking around. It, it, you know what? I look at this and I go, you know, I don't really blame him for not wanting to take her out. No, I wouldn't want to take her out either. Like, look at this. Everything you do is going to take twenty times longer than it should take. I, look at this. We're here. <laughs> Sally could have been all around this whole building by now. I love abandoned places, so when I saw this, I'm like, I want to check it out, even if it's hard for me. Yeah, now you yeah, don't okay. go to the farm. Good job, foodie. Good bird. She's looked back like, okay, how far are we from Some the car? paneling here. There we go. <laughs> Snakes Sally, in. there's a creature in there. Get your camera out. To face out of that hole, stupid. Oh my god. Some I just want some big thing to jump out at him. Some abandoned shelves. Whatever made that hole was big. Chalkboard. Some kind of creatures crawling around in there. Well, I didn't see nothing. No, you see all the footprints. Oh yeah. Something's been all in there. Just where the kids go and play. She sat outside, he went in. Yeah, she probably went back to the car. Like, this would be awesome to take pictures of. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Jump scare. She, she reminds me of when a seal gets on the edge of the ice. <laughs> when they're waiting for a fish at the, <laughs> at the zoo. <laughs> She's looking at Sally like, you toss pickle? What are you doing? I need pickle. What are you doing? Toss a pickle. I climb out. Stop. Stop. Stop it. The picture I tagged you in is from this scene. Oh, I'll take a look real quick. I'll talk to the chat. Oh, uh, there's no telling oh, what toxic nice. shit is in that environment. That's true. Like this, I feel like there's going to be dangerous things. There's yeah. going to be broken glass. There's going to be big chunks of metal. It's not going to be a safe place for somebody who can't even balance while walking on straight ground to just climb around and it, walk around in. As somebody who knows a little bit about this kind of stuff, just read, no experience. But like, you should at least have a mask. Probably. Like an N95. And like boots. Steel-toed boots. Yeah. You know, like my shit kicker Actual boots. Actual boots, yeah. It, long pants. Yeah. Gloves. Mm -hmm. You know this dumbass is probably walking around in his fucking flippy floppies? Oh, yeah. He's in his flippy floppies and his hoochie daddy shorts. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Toss a pickle to your foodie, oh valley of shithole. Uh -huh. She's resting Gunther she right on like top of it. She looks like she's having a great time. Yeah. She looks like she looks like she got cut in half, and they just figured out a way to save the upper body. <laughs> it's too high for her to sit on, so she's just resting her front half on it for a chair. Like she's just she has to just it's walk. Like she's sitting backwards. She has to just walk around on her hands from now on. Oh my it's like a God, zombie dude. that got cut in half. Like she does look like she got cut in half. Oh, that's funny. Yeah, Slimer was uh, what Cougar Knife sent. Slimer. <laughs> I giggled way too hard at Flippy Floppy. You know, with my swim trunks and my Flippy Floppies. <laughs> That's how Salad goes exploring in abandoned, burned out uh -huh. war schools. Uh -huh. Swim trunks and it's Flippy Floppies. She looks... <laughs> I have seen a lot of like Middle Eastern horror movies. Dude, I've motherfucker. And that's exactly what she looked like. She's that dark mass in the corner that's coming out in the fucking. Horror when you movie. turn around, it's gone. Yeah, that's her. That's she, what she looks like. She looks like every slasher film. Uh huh. Like, 
Jaws music should be playing. <laughs> or, uh, what is, what's the... Uh, yeah. The Halloween song. Yeah, thank you. And this thing that she keeps flipping over her shoulder, just leave it in the front. It's not going to stay over your shoulder. You all think Salad regrets his life choices? He should. Dude, he is gorilla regretting very much so. These are some arches that I don't know what they are. Greenhouse of some kind. This is an old map. <laughs> <laughs> so in 1990, Iraq invaded Kuwait, commencing the Gulf War. There are apparently five or so abandoned schools here in Wafra that have stayed abandoned since the invasion. Some were demolished, but this one's foundation still remains standing. A ghostly reminder of a violent- Weird. Oh, okay, thank you, Wikipedia. A beauty. ghostly reminder? Okay. Silent time in Kuwait. These empty classrooms are filling with desert sand, before. and one day will be completely buried if she's just reciting Wikipedia. Uh -huh. Not demolished says. first. There's Wiki foodie, nice. an eerie silence permeating the area. A stark contrast to how full of student laughter it would have been once upon a time when the institution was functional. Wouldn't there be plagiarism? It, because I don't think. I don't think that was Wikipedia. The, a stark reminder of blah, 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 blah. That probably came from somebody's blog post about this. Probably. And she's just plagiarizing. The pickles have eyes. <laughs> I don't know why, but I have a very masculine urge to knock in these little squares right here mm -hmm. with a sledgehammer because I feel like one good hit and it all goes in at once. Probably. Okay. Guys, next stream goal is to get me here with a sledgehammer. Okay, honey. And I'm, I'll, I'll be in the desert for 20 minutes, and I'm just going to knock one in and be like, all right, time to go home. <laughs> I'm sure I could find some of these down in East Cleveland, but yeah. significantly higher risk of being shot down there. That's true. To be fair, if this was here, this thing would be full of fucking... Meth heads. Uh, yeah, people would just be living here. This would be a meth This would be a house, yeah. There's one that I... Uh, <laughs> wreck it, son. There's one video that I saw. Somebody went to a... Abandoned Section 8 apartment building oh, yeah. down in Cleveland. And there were like 50 crackheads living in there. I'm sure. Historical site demolition bees. <laughs> well, we still have to get foodies denture fittings before we move on to the next one. And we're almost 20% to the way there, too. Oh, look at that beautiful artwork of a gun. That is... Punisher's team. Kuwait. Muslim. Muslim. Mislim. Mislim. <laughs> Mislim. 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 Both of us fucked ISIS. that... ISIS. It says ISIS. Both of us fucked that up so bad. <laughs> I just went off your reading before I actually... You read it, it first. <laughs> no, I read Punisher something. I read that part. <laughs> Send smash, smash school. <laughs> what the fuck is happening here? Is this the whole video? Booty went back to the car. Oh, I have not checked off Oh My God content. We have had copious amounts of content. What do you guys think of the uh, Gorilla Train gif? I told you I'd get it done eventually. And I hope you like it. I think it's pretty good. How wild Bill. How wild Bill. Or how wild Boo? I think that's two L's and the I is implied. Or how wild Poo. B, you. Yeah, I thought that was two L's. Oh, maybe. Bull? 
Why are uh, they how writing? wild are you? Why are oh. they writing in English? I love it. I hate it. Fuck off. And I like how wild Bill better. Sorry. I don't care if that's not what it is. It's how wild Bill is. Sally's got to film the toilet. Of course. Go get a zoom in on the toilet, Sally. He's going to. <laughs> He's going to look for poop in it. He had to check. He had to check it for poop. That's not a toilet. Sal's favorite room. Can you imagine Chantel just standing down that dark hallway? Really seems like that's where she belongs. He went straight for it too. That's the third time in a row Salad's gone right for the poop. You know she's probably standing outside going, Salad, uh -huh. where are you, Salad? I gotta go home. I need, to, I need a whole pizza. She has pickles waiting for her. <laughs> Cut like half this shit out, man. Yep. This is a video of B roll footage. Uh -huh. you, you think Foodie would at least put in the effort to do some type of voiceover or something? You would think, but that would be effort. Like, do a minute, a minute of research, and you could, you don't have to read it right off of a script. She like, does. Just looking at this now, like, the school was built in. 1922 right whatever. whatever yeah and it stood there until the early 90s when whoever invaded kuwait and the sound of laughing children and learning minds was taken away by the ravages of war and turned into this blown out husk of a time that once was good job honey. like you could just make this shit up and it's ten times better than in 1990. The the bad guys invaded my homeland. <laughs> <laughs> like a little bit of effort and gumption, you can make this a good video. Like the makings so are here. On our way from Shut up. The makings are here for something good. But she just took it. I was like, eh. Pizza. Salads video. The it's salads. Pizza. Yep. Just gonna roll B roll footage. School to the farms. It started raining pretty heavily, which is normal in the winter here in Kuwait. So we decided to head home because the farm is an outdoor activity and we did oh, not have an umbrella. That's why they went home. Not because Chantel was sleepy from walking for five feet. It's because it started to sprinkle. <sighs> but don't worry, we will eventually show you around the various farms. It definitely isn't heavy rain. No. Well, guys, thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye. Like you, that could have been, I'm very upset about this. Yeah, that was lame. Because we don't have anything like that here that's generally safe to go to. Right. Like, at, like comparably safe. Yeah. So that. Or that you can actually get into. Yeah, well, I mean, Without you. Without breaking into. Yeah, I mean. Yeah. Eh. Most people just kind of go, yeah, okay, finish up and go home. You're not going to get in trouble for doing that. But that. Also, none of it's close. Right. Like, there's an abandoned mall in... Far right, away. Richmond? Yeah. R Richfield? Rich... About an hour or something away. Like, you could have made this a very entertaining video. Mm -hmm. You could have gave us a little bit of actual history, not just reading somebody's blog post. Mm -hmm. You could have made this a real entertaining video, but you just couldn't be fucked to put the effort in. Nope. Not at all. She was more... She did more editing for her zoom in on her falafel. Yeah. There the was text more, on the screen. There was more editing for the falafel than any of that. Yes. Well, I didn't think that would generally bug me, but it did. <laughs> like, that, that is such a cool thing to do. Uh -huh. As somebody who's really, really getting into photography... Who's really getting into this kind of shit? I would love to have something like that nearby that I could go to, that I could explore, give a little history on it. Like that mall. I want to go to that mall eventually. I wish they didn't tear down that castle thing that was always over there. I want to go to that mall eventually. But like, 
a, a little something. Mm-hmm. History, when it was built, its peak, its decline. Give us something, not just I, Iran invaded my home country and I hate them now. Mm-hmm. <sighs> anyway. Anyway, I'm sorry. I got a little... I got a little bothered by that one. Uh, you don't want to get stuck in the desert when it rains in Kuwait or Iraq. The sand is so fine that the ground turns to literal soup. I assume so. There's not too much... <clears throat> there's not too much uh, space for the water to go to. Anyway. Sorry. Ranting over. Uh, rant over. I'm sorry. I didn't think that would get me so bothered, but it fucking really did. Let's move on to the next one. Boop. Boop. Check that ratio first. Uh, 720 watching and 193 likes. Guys, smash that like button. Share it out. Do the thing with the thing and the other thing down below. We have uh, all the stuff. The new Awu, the Gorilla Train, and yay. Quick Sand Bees. Sin does a foodie parody at an abandoned building. No. If I... Like, I can do the parodies here. The Amazon parody. You know, that kind of shit. Uh-huh. That was that was good fun. That was fun. The, the package unboxing parody was hilarious. We'll do that again at... Of age. June. <laughs> well, fuck, if we did it for June, we'd have to, like, start doing it now. But, but would that even be a... I don't think a, it'd be... It, would that be a thing to parody? Because she doesn't do that anymore. Yeah, it's not much of a parody anymore. No, she doesn't do it anymore. We'll think of something. But if I were to do a parody like that going into an abandoned building, I would just do an actual video in an abandoned building. That would be cool. Like, why the fuck would I do a parody of that? No. They would just do an actual video. I can take the B-roll footage and roll YouTube library music over it. That doesn't seem funny. And that doesn't seem very entertaining either. It wasn't. Yeah. So, sorry, that's your answer to that. (laughs) (laughs) My bad. I didn't mean to kind of, like, jump down your throat on that one. But... Ur- urbex, ur- yeah, urban exploration. I would love to do that kind of shit, but it's. 17- well, I watched a scary movie about that the other day. What was it called? It's seventeen no, degrees outside right now, and a movie. at at some point I will do it. But I think I would be getting more pictures than videos. Next one: homemade creamy cauliflower and cheese soup with crispy pita chips. Yum. Yeah. Yay. Oh, the movie was called Pizzas? Redwoods. It was urban explorers looking at old cabins in the woods. It was scary. It was good. Well, you you avoid that by not doing cabins in the woods. Yeah, it was good. Talk to my kitchen I don't, here. Bye. I, I will explore a lot. You could do creepypasta readings in abandoned building. The acoustics are probably terrible. Yeah, probably. like it It'd sounds. Be it sounds like a good idea, until my audio sounds like this, and I'm trying to tell a story, but I'm yeah. over here, and then you hear crackheads shooting each other down the street. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are fucking. I thought Shelly had bad takes tonight. You guys are doing terrible. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Ah, oh, fuck! I forgot what I was gonna say. Anyway. Well, hello, guys. Hello. So, welcome back to my kitchen here. I'm very oh, excited. Chantel eating food. Yay. And we're sitting in the kitchen. Of course we're sitting in the kitchen. She can't stand up with the sugar foot. It's ambient sin. No. No, it's not. I... I... There's a maybe aspect to it. But the amount of work that would have to go into making that work would be insane. Because uh-huh. you have to throw up like a soundproof thing. Uh, excuse me. Oh, okay. Hold on. Uh, where can I find this guy? Wouldn't mind wearing. Oh, okay. John Galt sent me this. What is this shit? I saw no this. way. That's hilarious. Oh my god. This has to be fake. Somebody just put that picture on there. That's not a real shirt. That is... This has to be fake. I hope it's real. It's a shirt, and somebody just put Aver's picture on it. I hope it's real. I can't be real. And feel very good about myself, because 
I um, feel like we're, we're sitting down in the kitchen. Yep. And yeah, she's always had the washer and dryer in there. Yeah, that's where the washer and dryer is. Where's Where's your you, washer and dryer? In your laundry room like a peasant? You westerners keep your washer and dryer in its own area. <laughs> like a domestic goddess today. I um cleaned my entire kitchen, which I will admit has taken a little bit of a nosedive um cleanliness wise. Um, Wasn't she just talking like two days ago about cleaning her entire kitchen? That was supposedly Salad's bathroom, supposedly. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, she said the whole house. She said to clean the whole house, but when she was in the bathroom, that's when she got ghost, scared by a ghost. That's when the ghost attacked. Yeah. Since I had a bad sight. Your decadent western laundry room. <laughs> sciatic flare up. Um, and a sciatic flare up when I have to do something. Sciatic flare up, which she's never had sciatic before for it to have just now flared up. It's fucking crazy. Weird. It was just, you know, I was hardly able to move at one point. So, you know, and I'm kind of stubborn and was teetering on having a maid for a while or like a... She couldn't afford a maid. No. Stop. Stop it. Cleaner. But we never did end up getting one. And um, I just cleaned everything myself. I cleaned the oven, the stove, um, my appliances, air fryer, all the dishes are done, the pods, um, the floors washed. Um, and I'm, you know, a chicken. I have a roast chicken in the oven, and um, what is with this super low BMI voice? The weird today? smiling and the low BMI, like uh, it's like she's filming an infomercial for us. <laughs> Hi, Foodie Beauty here with Sit and Cook, the <laughs> brand new invention that you can have in your kitchen for when your sciatic flares up. You know it has nothing to do with your weight. You know that you can do all the cleaning around the house. But sometimes you need to just sit down and cook. Oh my God. Well, I present you the Sit and Cook for four easy payments of $199.99. This piece of shit chair can be yours. Just look at our first person here. Then you see some foodie <laughs> resting her gut up, leaning over, chopping. It's like, there's got to be a better way. <laughs> you know, she got that wheelie computer chair and cleaned the house while wheeling around all day long. She wheeled around with the mop. She wheeled around, clean, like she wheeled around to clean the house. She this sat while she cleaned the oven. She sat while she did the dishes. She wheeled around to the, clean. And for this limited time offer, <laughs> your sit and cook, we will also send you a sit and clean. <laughs> Absolutely free, just pay shipping and handling. <laughs> Booty scooty. I'm going yep, to be making. she's been scooting all over. Uh, There's got to be a better way. <laughs> <laughs> and like she's in black and white standing there. You have one hand on her back, the other one on her leg. Uh, uh, and then it's she's in the, the sit and scoot. Yeah. And she's mopping and doing circles. <laughs> like it's a stationary in front of a doorway and you see her sliding one way. <laughs> then mopping back the other way. Uh, Oh God! Oh fuck! God, this somebody out there is a writer. I'm giving you gold here. Um, some, and I'll show you. I'll show you how. <laughs> but wait, there's more. We'll throw in an extra pair of stain protecting seats, absolutely free. And my chicken and everything in a minute. Um, you know, you gotta do the hand movements. Yes, we see. But uh, I'm gonna be making well, some. <laughs> yeah, everyone's seeing. No, I don't think they are. Cheesy cauliflower soup. <coughs> so, I've been wanting to make this for a while. Now, I'm going to be doing a lot of cooking, all right? Because I'm uh -huh. kind of challenging myself. You've seen grocery hauls where we've gotten... <laughs> she looks... She... she made that her thumbnail? Why is she looking... Why are you looking over there? She looks like... Well, not prairie dogs. What the hell are they? She looks like a gerbil. Yeah. Maybe they go see first. The... Yeah, go for thank yeah. you. Hundreds of dollars worth of food. And I don't want it to go to waste. Luckily, mashallah, a lot of it is still actually really good. Um, so we have a lot of like things I can cook with. So I'm going to be challenging myself to... <laughs> 200 easy payments of nine ninety nine every 45 minutes. Not she can't not just make food. She has to make it a challenge. I'm, I'm going to do a... A cooking challenge. Just cook the food that's in your freezer. 
Why has it got to be a cooking challenge? This isn't TikTok. I made a bowl of bat. Oh, fuck. Did you do a bowl of cereal challenge? No, I forgot there was one plate of my bachelor chow left, and I guarantee you it's gone bad by now. Oh, yeah. But I made bachelor chow last week, and it literally was just a... I'm going to do some meal prep this week. And that was it. Like, I'm not going to challenge myself to do this. Like, uh... Yeah, it doesn't have to be a challenge. It can just be making a thing. Yeah. Like, I, I woke up yesterday, or Friday, and I just made a bowl of tuna salad. Yeah. Like, you just... That's what you do. You just make food. It's not a challenge. Oh, not order groceries until I really need to, all right? So... Yeah, Sam, bachelor chow. I... I got... I diced up... I, like, really, really nicely cut up an onion. Garlic. Sautéed it. Let it cook. Took it out. Put just a pack of ground beef in the fucking pan. Cooked it. Took it out. Put the the onions and the garlic back in. Stirred it up. <gasps> made pasta. <laughs> made a cheese Cook sauce. And flip. What? <laughs> Cook and I have said, here we go with this conversation again. Another hour. You're going to tell us about cooking for an hour? Yeah, no. I, it, and it, <laughs> it was literally just... Beef and noodles with cheese. And I just slopped it in a bowl and threw it in plates. <laughs> so I'm going to use everything I have here. And it's going to be fun because we're going to, it's going to kind of be like a challenge. And maybe you guys can do it. No seasoning. Well, I used a Grillmates hamburger seasoning because I like that stuff. But I used fresh garlic and fresh peppers. Or fresh onions. Put two at home. I should have you know, put a lot peppers of the time in I put say, carrots in there. We look in the cupboards when we're hungry. The carrots you were stole the bunnies' food. carrots no. to Don't. put in your... Food. Those carrots were a nice touch. We Those have a lot of food. Bunnies. We just don't feel like eating it. So that's goulash. Try... That's not goulash. Stop it. How'd you make the cheese sauce? I <laughs> I melted a bag and a half of sharp cheddar <laughs> shredded cheese <laughs> in a pot with some milk. <laughs> to take things that we have in the cupboards and in the freezer in the fridge already, um, and which is it's not a terrible amount, but we're gonna see what we can do. Okay, we're gonna try to make delicious little meals out of it. And uh, I think also not ordering up for me for a while will also be a healthy move. So you stole the bunnies, carrots, root. They were a nice fucking addition to the dish. <laughs> <laughs> Ignore the rest of the chat. I'm interested. That motivation behind it as well. I say domestic goddess because I've always wanted to be one. I've never been somebody who's. I didn't. I didn't use cayenne because I didn't think about it. But I used fresh garlic, uh, and fresh onion. So I didn't really feel the need for onion powder and garlic powder enjoyed taking care of my home uh enjoyed i mean i love my home when it's clean and, and you feel accomplished taking care of your things you know and i've just never been one to really and enjoy of course doing salt that. And pepper so that goes on i feel really positive and really happy today that i did those things and i know some people you know have to Chantel juggle said, i did that time. D did she i'm not i'm reading the chat no i mean she pretty much did I, she's really accomplished she, I don't she rolled around on her Scooter and swept the floor. Have to juggle like two and a half kids. Dude, she did a Roomba impression. <laughs> kids and and still maintain their home oh, and feed their the family. Dogs. And honestly, if you're one of those people, pat yourself on the back because that is very difficult for a lot of people. And I'm one of those people. I couldn't even imagine if I had to do all of those things, you know. So just taking care of my home right now is a big thing for me. Uh, Liz <laughs> Lucas showing the Streamlabs link with uh, since cooking lessons. To Look, if I'm cooking, I either it's. Tuna and nor side dishes. Oh god. Or some sort of meat and noodle. with noodle. Or I'm making like a perfect flame seared steak that is perfectly cooked with gnocchi garlic parm on the side with cheese broccoli or monogot with the cheese homemade. It's one of the two. I'm either doing bachelor chow or like some gourmet shit. Gourmet shit. Or bergs. I do bergs pretty often. Especially with how I'm feeling. So, but I'm getting better at it and I'm slowly feeling better. And so I'm excited. So I want to have a really, I have some. Noki is so good. This is my first time ever making or having Noki. And I was not prepared for how heavy it was. It literally ruined the rest of my night. <laughs> Because I didn't realize how heavy it fucking was. It looks heavy. Cheese, that's probably some cheddar cheese that's probably going to go bad soon. And I do also have a um, cauliflower that's going to be bad soon as well. 
and some carrots. Didn't you buy that like six weeks ago? Mm-hmm. So all the food I'm using is going to be that food. To use it before she throws it away, like usual. Stuffed shells are gross. Why eat something with no meat? You could just use a meat sauce. And there's a lot of dishes with no meat, like every seafood dish ever created. <laughs> Pizza. Use it. So I thought, what better way? You know, if you have a bunch of leftover vegetables, if you have a bunch of leftovers in general in the fridge, throw it all in a casserole or a stew or a soup or something like that. No, I didn't make the gnocchi. I got a, a box. There's an Italian shop, and I got a box of it from there. So for this, I'm going to be making a soup. Now, I'm going to be doing it my way in particular because there's a... My way. Of... My way. She's going to do it my way. My way. Different I wonder where she got that right? from. So this is going to be very simple. I'm not going to be using flour. Um, I don't feel like making a roux to make it thicker. I think blending the vegetables will make the soup thicker. Don't do that. Seafood not being meat is cath meat is Catholic cope. Fish! <laughs> Fish! It's not an animal. <laughs> I'm praying to God she bought another cauliflower. Please don't tell me that's the one from six weeks ago, please. I think that's the one from six it weeks ago. Be. So if she would have bought it, we would have seen it. We probably would have. Yeah, yella. Let's start, alright? And look at that shit. It's brown on the outside. That's that's a mold chunk growing on. That it. looks gross. Oh she just threw it down in the sink too. I, I, you didn't I, even take the greens off. You're not washing. A... It's in the sink. I... And look at if the I'm going to rinse a vegetable, everywhere. I'm going to hold it in my hand or put it in a strainer or whatever, not just throw it in the sink where all the dirty dishes pile up. I like... was just thinking that, Sam. Look how fucking shallow that sink is. Well, yeah. But why is, she, why is it just in the sink? I, you know that sink is not clean, clean. No. No. You can technically eat beaver during let the Vatican considers it a fish. Really? That's weird. Well, I don't because they swim. That way. Beavers are from the river. That means we can have otter too. Polly better watch the fuck out. <laughs> Grill his little ass. <laughs> like those look like good sized carrots, but they also look rotten. They look like they're sitting in the bottom of the sink. That's because they are sitting in the bottom of the sink. All right, so here's John. My John, everyone, just give hearts in the chat for John Galt with the great fucking point. You cannot cut mold off; it has roots. Mold grows. Uh. My chicken for roasting. I just uh, make a rub with olive oil, Worcester sauce. Uh, seven spices, onion and garlic powder, black pepper, and some sea salt. And then I uh, bake it in the oven. She takes this and throws it away and pulls out the cooked one. All right. While the chicken's cooking, I prepare some basmati rice by soaking it in some water. Just wanted to show you my clean kitchen a little bit. Do you want some mold soup? New foil to the elements, right. which helps keep them. Yeah, okay, this is a new stove and the numbers are already out. Clean underneath. Pots are clean. My floor is clean. That was... This This is mind-boggling to me. The floor is wet. The f she must have literally just cleaned she, it. She does the cleaning where you just dump water on the floor and let it go down the drain. That's the kind of cleaning she's doing. But why? Is this a common thing over there? This yeah, that's why there's floor drains. They just dump the water on the floor. But you're supposed to dump water on the floor and then scrub it. And it, you can still see there's dirt all over. She didn't do the scrubbing. She just did the splash no, of water. It, like, the drain in the floor. Is that a common thing? Probably. Like, I kind of like it, but it kind of freaks me out at the same time. It's kind of painful with my sciatica, but it's not perfect. And it's when in doubt, throw it out. I do that even with stuff I'm <laughs> vaguely possible about. Stuff was still good stuff. You yeah, just throw like, it out. if it's puffy, I toss it. Still drying, but you know, at least it's clean enough. And or if it's here, butter, you toss it because I you don't know bother it to butter. open it. You're like, oh, this must be old leftovers. I'll throw away the fucking tub of butter. <laughs> now I have to write butter. Do not throw away really big on the side of the butter. <laughs> I didn't know. 
You didn't look either. <laughs> no, because I never assume a butter container has butter in it anymore. <laughs> My mom has conditioned me to never. <laughs> the butter containers are always leftover food. The butter is kept on the door. <laughs> so I didn't even think twice. Because I looked at it like, how fucking old is this? And I just threw it away. <laughs> Oh, fuck, I forgot about that. <laughs> oh, but it like it didn't even occur to me that it might be butter. I was yeah, just it like, was butter. God, fuck it, I don't even remember this trash. <laughs> Here we have my like, what uh, the fuck? Where did the butter go? <laughs> I know you didn't use all of the butter. Where is the butter? <laughs> it, no, it makes sense. I know it does, and that's the fucking crazy part. Like I was mad at her for putting the butter in the fridge. <laughs> <laughs> that's where it goes to work with when I'm chopping things up. I can't believe it was actually butter. <laughs> Leave a little crack of my window open and the fan on. Yeah, this is my space. So, I have some carrots cut up. I, I love the sitting down. Here, uh, can you get a pot? He pees down the floor tray. Do that. I have these Gross. nice stainless steel pots my husband bought for me a little while back. My husband. <laughs> my husband. <laughs> when he heard I, I wanted to be cooking more, he got excited about that. Butter is kept in the, Butter has its own, like, loft in fridges. Yeah. It doesn't have so to I go have there. two... What else goes there? The stick butter goes there. The butter in the tub doesn't go there. You get the small tubs, it goes there. Only if you have a small tub. Shut up. Um, carrots cut up here, and I did wash them thoroughly, so I'm just going to cut the stem out. Oh God, it's making me so... One miss move, and that knife is going right into okay. her forearm. Yeah. I don't have a trick for that. However way you construct... God, this is so... All right. I've had a chest cold for two weeks. I've been breathing like foodie. Sit, <laughs> sit cooking sounds like an idea. Oh, that is the best way. <laughs> Good luck, <laughs> John. Go. Whatever nastiness is going around fucking sticks. Oh, came out pretty easy. Just well, you saw, I was sick for like six weeks, dude. Get Echinacea, that helped. Take a knife and go underneath, kind of. Got a little garbage bag here. Okay. Just this is already the smallest kitchen you can imagine. Uh-huh. And now you're just gonna sit in it. Uh -huh. Why don't you just sit on the floor, Chantel? Since she can't reach the counter. I'm just gonna cut some of the brown parts off. Uh. Okay, so let's it's... start here. I'm surprised it's not all brown on the inside. I'm gonna be blending is. this so it doesn't have to be aesthetically pleasing. No. <laughs> you're gonna blend it. Why are you gonna blend it? What are you blending? Why are you putting broccoli in a blender? Cauliflower, Last white broccoli. Of usable cauliflower. There you go. Oh, it's all is she rotten. gonna blend cauliflower and carrots together? What the fuck is she making? All rotten vegetables. Uh, Mucinex and z -Quil not working. Dude, I'm telling you, echinacea, C, zinc. That'll help. So, I'm just gonna add some water. Barely covering the cauliflower. She got that right tic-tac soap thing my mom got for me. Wait, I can't see your hands in the way. Lean? That soap thing. Oh. And we're going to let that come to a boil. On, cover it, cook it on like medium heat, let it boil down. Let the vegetables cook till they're tender, pork tender. And then we're going to go on from there. Now, and I'll be back for step two of the soup one. Wait, I'm sorry, what'd she say? On, cover it, cook it on like medium heat, let it boil down, let the vegetables cook till they're tender, pork tender. Fork tender? Uh-huh. When you poke a fork in, it doesn't stick to the fork, it falls back off. I've That's never... how you know that potatoes or vegetables are not still raw. You stick the fork in and it falls off. I've never done. heard of that. Yeah. I just kind of like go by the gut feeling. That's why your <laughs> potatoes are always undercooked. Now, once yeah, I... a fork in it. No, I don't usually make, like, big potatoes. 
Yeah, I tried times. I tried the fancy potatoes and I just couldn't get that right. Zephyr said, "This is so gross. When I buy kali, I eat it within a week at the most. Yuck. Yeah, it's even if it's like a month old, that's still old. Yeah, yeah. And she that's... said it was from a while ago. Yeah, that's that's no boy, you know. It probably stinks. You think? Yeah, it probably stinks. And then we're gonna go on from there. Now, I'll be back for step two of the soup when the vegetables are cooked. By the way, I forgot to add. I try to make these fancy potatoes I saw on TikTok. Just fancy potatoes. But I didn't realize, because he never said how to cook them. He just said he fried them. So I'm like, all right, I'll just put them in the pan and let they them. They were still raw. And they were raw. And I did it like, <laughs> I did it like three times. I'm like, what the fuck? So I looked up how to actually do it. And you're supposed to fry them in oil. He said he just fried them in the pan, but he must have put oil in the pan. Probably. Because you watched a video I did. I'm like, he didn't really say how to cook it. No. And I'm just like, what the fuck? I, I love the kitchen door shut too. Sal was like, I don't even want to hear you. Uh -huh. Some chicken bouillon cubes. I'm gonna do that now. So these are boiling down nicely. You know, she probably shuts the door because she wants to keep the heat in the kitchen. And whenever she puts the stuff in the pan and then she runs back out into the air conditioner and shuts the door behind her. Probably, That's actually. probably what she's doing. Fancy schmancy. It was. They were cut a they certain way. They were super way. fancy. They were cut a certain way, and then you flip them over and cut them a different way, so it's like accordion. They were fancy. But he just showed you how to do it, but didn't tell you how to cook it. Next time, stick a fork in it, and if it falls off the fork, it's done. But you can't really... That, that's what confuses me about it, is because you can't really cook potatoes in the steak grease. Like, you can make a couple of fucking... Fries. fries or something but like even not then, thick potatoes though no even then they're just greasy and it just sops up the fucking yeah. stuff if you want it fried well you have to dip it in the like you have to get a pot of oil and get it heated and do it in there right but he said he didn't do that so i don't know how the fuck he did it i don't know yeah, what is that um like is that the voldemort on the back of her head we know it's not her hair. And and anyone else, I would think, oh, she must have a bun on the back of her head. Like, she's just be wearing her hair in a low bun. But she's not. There is no hair. No. That's her head. Yeah, you can't fry without oil. That's where I'm like, you must have just put it in the steak grease. Like, it never occurred to me. Oh, air... What? No, you don't use oil what in was that frame. um was that like a, a twilight zone or something where the guy had the face on the back of his head it was harry potter was it harry potter yeah it's no, it, was, it was from something before then so i i don't remember it from harry potter i remember it from some other thing it might have been a twilight zone i don't remember it yeah. from twilight zone or one of those shows like that outer limits maybe i don't know i don't remember that American Horror Story? I, American Horror Story, maybe. I gave up after, like, season two. It might have been that. Oh, yeah, The Circus Freak. Yeah, That's maybe the that last season that. I watched. Yeah, that was probably it. Okay, never mind. That was a Twilight Zone episode. Okay. Maybe it was that. You're just getting her more confused. See, there, I think a lot of different shows have done that. Yeah, it's it's kind of a trope. Yeah. Well, maybe not trope, but it's... Chantel has one. It's a... Yeah. What was the Twilight Zone episode? Shrek is love, I say. No! Shrek is life. No, he's not. It's all ogre now. That's a lie. Shrek leaves through my we window. Had this one oh, I hate it so much. I Shrek is love. Right, so Shrek uh, is life. Uh, uh, Jeff, Shelly's thirsty for a Shrek. Uh, also, for that yeah. ratio, bitches, you have one job and you're failing. Make yourselves useful. Hit the like button. Have a safe week. Dickheads. Thank you, Jeff. Thank you, Jeff. Nicely done, sir. Nicely done. Everything was a Twilight Zone episode. Yeah. That's probably true. Yeah. But That's one of those... And it drives Shelly up a wall, but Twilight Zone is one of those shows I could put on at any time. Why would that drive me up a wall? I love Because Twilight another Zone. one of them is Columbo. No, I don't like Columbo. <laughs> I love Columbo. Yeah. I try to watch Twilight Zone at bed, and then you say, don't put that on, the music's going to make me watch it. Yeah, I'm just going to stay up and watch it, so you got to put on something else. <laughs> going to be dirty, I know. I always get dirty when I'm cooking. 
fucking love Columbus. There we go. All right, we're back. Guys, while that's the milk is in the way, <laughs> while that's uh, still cooking, I'm going to um, make some pita chips for the soup. So. You are definitely an old man, 80s at heart, and a Columbo was. 60s? I. Twilight Zone. I did not remember 50s. what Columbo like, looked like until you had it on the other day <laughs> at the hotel. And why does Columbo look like a, a little boy trapped in a man's body? He's I, like teeny tiny. He's got a little kid face. He's like a little child. He's got a glass eye. He looks like a child, like it wearing a long coat, like pretending to be a detective. <laughs> is what it looked like to me. And I'm like, this you can't be serious. This is the show. He's two kids on top of each it's other. It's what he looks like. He lo that's exactly what he looks like. He's a teeny tiny little guy. How does anybody take him seriously? Col no, Columbo. Uh, Monk was a good one. I li I like Tony Shalhoub as Monk. Columbo wasn't an old man, though. He was. It was. He looked like a little kid. I think the one we watched was one of the early ones, like late. I think it was sixty six or sixty seven. So he was probably younger in that. You can use it for things like croutons, pita chips. So this is the oldest bread I have. I'm just gonna grab it and microwave it. Actually, it's the oldest bread I have. So she's just getting the oldest things she can find in the kitchen and cooking them. I guess if you're going to make pita chips out of it, the old bread's probably better. Yeah, but the old vegetables and things, you can. it's okay to just say, I never ate this in time and throw it away. Yeah. I mean, it's okay it's to fine. say, this, this is six weeks old, I can throw it away. Sally told her she had to cook something. Yeah, he's like, I know by food, you cook. Uh-huh. Uh, Columbo is far better than Monk, I agree, but Monk was still pretty entertaining. The whole bag in there because it kind of steams it. <laughs> Take a baking dish. Wait, did she put the bag in the air fryer? I'm I wasn't paying attention. Did she already do it? Oh, oh in my the microwave. God, she put Wait, the whole you can't put a bag the in whole the microwave. Is that gonna melt the plastic? I would think so. Bag in there because it kind of steams it. This is I'm only getting ten thousand views eating. Well, it's not even ten thousand, it's six. No, oh, boy. <laughs> I'm gonna take a baking dish. I didn't even notice the mini fan in the back. I'm short and everything is up here. Now look at that. Look at the bag. It's all puffed up in the microwave. Yeah, I like, you know, when you put like tortillas. I, you want I've some microplastics? I Don't never made that. those pitas before but like if I'm, you make it soft tacos and you put the tortillas in the microwave you just wrap them in a wet paper towel you don't put the bag in the microwave you, it's, you just get some get some microplastics it really it brings <laughs> out the flavor uh, her face is sweaty legs weak pulse is thready there's mold on the cauliflower mold on the cauliflower already <laughs> stomach upset stomach getty oh boy um, diarrhea coming quick. Oh no, salad is ready. Uh, you had me in the first half. <laughs> you had me in the first half. It got a little lie. wonky in the middle. Good yeah. job, dirt merchant. A little, little, little syllable-y. <laughs> Thank you. Parchment paper. Me too, Libby. The steamable vegetables in the bag are the best thing never invented. Th that is very good. For when you're feeling lazy, but it's really hard to beat just cutting it up and throwing it on a pan. And oh, yeah, the baked it. broccoli is different than steamed broccoli. Roasted vegetables, carrots, broccoli, any of it, just it's unbeatable. Parchment paper is like my baking sheet, I swear. Okay, perfect. Little, uh, look at that. She can't even hold the bag. She... Yeah, it's probably boiling. Yeah. Do you see how much steam came out of that? Perfect. Now, I'm just gonna rip it in pieces like this. That's not, you got, that's not how you do that, Chantel. Just little pieces. Put them in a bowl. Doesn't have to be perfect. They're obviously delicious fried as well, but. Just, get, do, you, do you not have a knife? Are knives illegal in Kuwait? Can you not cut this up? She could spoon kind of it apart. 
That's all she's got is this a spoon. Is, this is gonna... Th- dude, just... <laughs> I'm surprised she didn't eat it. You saw how she looked at it. Uh-huh. She wanted to eat it. She thought about it. Just cut it up. You can't put that back in the freezer. You already cooked it. Oh, no. You're just going to leave it there forever now. She was only making some for her, clearly. Because she didn't add any in the bowl for salad. And she just gave up ripping like halfway through. Uh-huh. Throw a bit of bread to the pigeons that come on the windowsill. What? A bit here. What? Oh my God! Is she fucking with us? Yes, yes she is. Like she's she's got to be fucking with us. I could feed it to the pigeons. She's full of shit. Okay. Aren't you worried that Julie is gonna jump out of that window if you leave it open? Well, the kitchen door is closed. I That's kind of so. high up too. No, oh, it's a cat's man. No, oh, it's. Well, you saw a what's her face cat. I would did hope last that night. there's a screen in the window. No. Probably not. <laughs> no. Salt is. Such a disaster. Because you need a gallon of salt, right, mm-hmm. foodie? Yeah. A little bit of salt. It's pink salt. It's healthy. Mm-hmm. Healthy queen. This little fan? Awesome for the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> this chair? Awesome for wheeling around the kitchen. Oh, goodness. And then we're just going to Shake them around, like that, so they get nice and coated with oil. Okay. So they're getting all just gracie. Just get them all gracie. Why are we getting them all gracie? What's she gonna? Oh, she's gonna bake them. What are we gonna do? Right. And I'll see you guys back when they're done. All right, let's see. She just got them all gracie. They're very tender. Now we got vegetables in the okay. in the vegetable pan. So I'm just gonna turn the heat up high and let some of the liquid just like uh, evaporate because I want to add milk. But I add too much liquid. I don't really measure. I, I, yeah, she's got to be putting. I'm it sorry. In. I gotta pull it back because I know I missed something. She right put there. grease all over the bread. That's not how you. I'm. Get, she's got to be baking it. <laughs> so that's not gonna. No. She's oiling the bread. Sh- no. 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 <laughs> Hey, okay, we saw this. And then we're just gonna shake them around. Get them all mushy. No! Okay, Chantel, no. No. S- stop it. Like that. Yeah, just flop them back and forth. Mm-hmm. So they get nice and coated with oil. Now you just stick your mitts in there. Yep. Get the cat hair all mixed in. Two... She's using that slutty olive oil, not extra virgin. None of this seems correct, because none of it is correct. <laughs> Make sure they're spread out a bit. That's not how you do any of this. It's just the sleeve. Look how crazy it is. I'm going to get to temperature before I bake these, all right? And I'll see you guys back when they're done. Right, yeah, she's going to bake. This is finished. She's going to let them soak up the grease until the oven heats up. Okay, hold on. Hold on, I, we gotta switch stream goals again. <laughs> we we uh, we got it. Just give me a second. One forty-three. Remember that. Okay. One forty-three. Okay. So I'm just gonna turn right the, in my way. Heat up high and let some of the liquid just like uh, evaporate because I want to add milk. But I add too much liquid. I don't really measure when I cook. I should start so I can share my recipes with you guys, but. So it's not a recipe. You're just making it up right, as you go. I should share my recipes with you guys. You just you steam some vegetables and put grease on so ripped up bread. I need to fill my spice jars. This is not a garlic a powder. recipe. Real onion and garlic work best. I didn't have any. <laughs> so yeah. Okay. Let's see how this is gonna turn out. Oh damn. I would I would hate to have to have seasoning in bags. I feel like this is so strange. Black pepper. I th- we must be very spoiled having all of our seasoning in little bottles like that. There we go. You like it? Love it. I'm going to add some whole milk. Into the vegetables? 
Why did I put milk in the vegetables? She put that in the veggies? Yeah. Why? I don't know. That's why I'm trying to figure out. Why? Why? Season, why are you doing any of this? She seasoned them and then put milk in. All right, so here we go. Now I'm going to blend the vegetables. I'll be right back. Why? Why are we blending them? Why are we blending? I thought we were making a soup. Why are we blending it? And, and using an immersion blender? Why are we blending it? Tissues for my tears. Fun. Sorry, Maddie. I sound like Karina's was funnier. A Just the cord. Uh, uh, uh. Why are we doing this? So that's what it looks like. Now I'm going to yeah. add the cheese. The cheese couldn't make it look like that too. Why didn't you just do like the cheese and milk to make the sauce and put on the vegetables? I, the, the ground up vegetable slop. It seems so strange. It's got to taste gross. I think. There you guys go. I, I fixed it to the, to the dime. I don't think cauliflower, carrots, milk all blended together is going to taste good. No. I really don't think it's going to taste good. Mm -hmm. It's going to taste like uh, something like, like some kind of gross baby food. I've never even heard of cauliflower soup. It doesn't sound good. I want to see the. I want a Z Tab Zero. Well, I can't. I. It's not there, so I don't know what to tell you. I can't make it appear there. Oh, he's drunk. Some cheddar. Oh my God! Oh, look at she had to sniff it. Look, she's looking for mold. Whoop. She's checking uh, it for all. Uh, uh, Chantel, uh. this stuff is too old. You can throw it away. It's it's okay. We won't judge you. Just say that it got bad because you didn't cook it. We know you didn't cook it. Throw it away. How did cheese last long enough for her to need to check it for moldiness as much as she eats cheese? She probably ate all the cheese and found this in the back of the fridge. She might have. It's blue cheese now, actually, yeah. I, I gotta see that again. Hold on. The cheese is old and moldy. Cheddar? <laughs> I don't remember what that was from. What is that from? She could have cut this out of the video. She could have. Nobody needed to know that your cheese smelled funky. She could have cut this all out of the video. She should have cut this. I out. mean, look at it. Look at the face. Look at. Look at. She's like, please be okay. Please be okay. But it. But look, it's. It's. Yes, Encino Man, that's what it it's was. It's shredded cheese, and it comes out in a block. Some cheddar? Chantel, throw it away. I have never judged another human being so if much. If she throws it away, I won't judge her. I, I, I also have gotten cheese out of the fridge and thought, is this good still? Let me look at it and smell it. But I'm, if, if I'm going to make that face after I look at it and smell it, I'm not going to put it in my mashed I, vegetable yeah, soup. I don't know. And you, okay, we know this is going in the soup. It's definitely going in the soup. But that is the it's questionable face. It is definitely questionable by that face. I mean, look at it. At the beginning of this, she said, my new pants. My husband bought me. He's so excited about my cooking. If he's going to eat, this is her cooking that she's giving to her husband. She's trying to kill him. <laughs> Foodie's out here looking for fucking COVID-20. Oh, no! It's okay, good. It's got something oh, on it. It's hold got on. something on it. Hold on. Okay, we just, we gotta, we gotta watch this in There's real time. There's something is happening with this cheese. We, we gotta watch this in real time. Holy shit. Some cheddar? <laughs> She's like, fuck. <laughs> she looked over at the camera like, fuck. Oh, one more time. One more time. Just one more time. Oh. Cheddar? Yeah, you're right. Cheddar? She's like, I just sniffed that on camera. She's like, damn it. And she's going to be like, it's fine. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. It's fine. All right. Some cheddar? Oh, my. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it goes. 
And it goes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if I don't put it in the soup, they'll know it was bad, so I have to put it in. <laughs> Slow-mo. We're going to slow-mo it. Oh, my lord. Oh, fucking regret. Fuck regret. This is making me full. That just... face. Oh, you know it smelled like... She knew... It as smelled soon as like she her, opened the bag like... and stuck her face in, she was like, this is bad. It smelled like it. her. It, according to Pete's. She could have cut all of this out. She could have cut all of this. You could have went from opening the bag to putting it in. Do you see her inspecting she it? She is. No, she's like, more. she's afraid there's, to reach back in. There's more. Is she gonna inspect this one too? Yeah, do you see that? She's looking at it. In to the slop it goes. Dude. Oh. Dude. Boy. This this has to smell awful. Dude. And dudettes. What? It'll cook. I out. can't wait to get her recipe book. I, I need I to need see the recipe her book. face when she tries it. I bet she's not gonna mukbang it, is she? I don't know. I have the heat off right now. <laughs> Dude, this is shredded cheese that it's chunked. It's chunked. It's just a solid chunk of cheese. Inspection. I, I'm, I gagged a little bit. On oh, the cheese inspection. Just look at that. Look at how hard she's inspecting this one. Oof, oof. <laughs> Dude. Dude. Funkle activities. <laughs> right, Dirt Merchant, tomorrow's live stream's gonna be. I can't believe you all thought everything was moldy. Yep, exactly. Oh, the haters said my cheese was moldy. Bitch, your cheese is moldy. We well, who saw, cares? I, I didn't see the mold, but I saw her face after she sniffed it. It didn't smell good. It smelled like it had gone bad, and she put it in anyways. This has to be a case of nose blindness. She made a face. She sniffed it and made an ick face after the sniff. She didn't sniff it like, hmm, and like nod, like, oh yeah, smells good. It was a, <laughs> and then a look real close. It smells Just because you didn't see the mold. If it smelled bad, it's gone bad. It doesn't have to be physically moldy already. It doesn't have to be green. If it smells bad, it's bad. Moldy veggies, month old milk, chicken cube, and mold oh, cheese. God. Yum. Yes. John Galt, you missed it. We already did the Encino Man gimmick. Yep. Fuck, I don't hungry about it. I don't remember for the life of me literally anything about Encino Man. Encino Man was good. That was one of the movies I liked a lot when I was a kid. Who was in it? Brendan Fraser and Polly Shore. It was the caveman they found yes, in the backyard. Yes, okay, yeah, all right. It was a good movie. Mm, good 90s Dude, Like, I, I knew, uh, it, like, I had, it was, uh, if you would have asked me 10 minutes ago, yeah. like, it's, Paul, it's Brendan Fraser, it's a caveman. Yeah. Caveman. But you said it, and it's gone, right out, immediately it's, gone. The cheese is old and moldy. Like, I knew that line, <laughs> but I couldn't place where it was from. Just immediately and the, disappeared. And the slurpees wheezing the juice. Add a little bit more milk. Why did you look at how curdled the milk is? Add a little bit more milk. We're gonna do this frame by frame. Is it curdled though? Or are you just saying that? Look, it's chunky. No, it's not. It's just it's pouring out of a jug. Oh that, wait, that might have been. A that's chunk. a huge chunk that right there. Been that's a, chunk. a milk chunk. You yeah, that might be a chunk. Look at it. Like, you see a little, a couple little ones, and then the big... T oh, God, yeah, that was a chunk. The big milk turd. <laughs> oh, 
Oh my god, that is a chunk. Don't you think I was making this up? That's I, a whole. I thought you were making that up. Look at it. It's a different color. Like at first, it just looked like milk, but that part did look like a chunk. Can you get some cottage cheese? She, she's making it my way. This is natter cooking. You know what? Actually. I do think it's about that time. You need a time. I think I need a time. So that, that Turkey, milk, and bone and spaghetti, right? That one that one caught me a little off guard. Oh boy. That's bad. Grace Summer Drake says it's fine. That's bad. You nope. sound like me saying it's fine. I would say it's fine. <laughs> and I will say it's fine. Like if I can, things can be questionable and I'll be like it's fine. Uh, nope. <laughs> <laughs> but if, not this questionable. Yeah, no. <laughs> I was so fucking hungry the other day. And the kids ate like all the bread and all the cheese. Yeah. And I just wanted a tuna salad sandwich and I, I wanted a cheese. For a tuna? Yeah. Ew. Yeah, it's not the point. And so I, I, they ate all the cheese. I'm like, fuck. Did they eat all the cheese? And yeah. Oh, shit. No more plastic cheese. And okay, hold on, real quick. We're coming back to that. I went to the store today. Not to not the park. park. And I got ham, and I got uh, three quarters of a pound of sharp cheddar sliced. Uh -huh. Did you hide it from the kids? Eight dollars and fifty fucking cents. Did you hide it? No, it's in, it's on the top shelf, so they probably won't see it. Oh, maybe not. Okay. But I'm making this fucking tuna sandwich. There's no cheese. Uh -huh. Fucking no cheese. What? I, I, yeah, who puts cheese on tuna anyways? So. That's not the point. So I found a bag of shredded cheddar, and I'm like, that had to be old. Oh, how old is that? It, it's been a while since so, we bought shredded cheddar. It's been a while since you bought it. I, that's something I pretty regularly buy. So I'm like, hmm. I checked the date on it, and the date was, it was, I think it was like March. I'm like, okay, that's a check in the good, and I gave it the sniff. I'm like, oh, okay, we're good. If I sniffed it, it was like, hmm. To just get thrown out. It's just garbage. Yeah. Oh, yeah, if the date was March, it was fine. Yeah, no, the date was good, but I still give it a sniff if I don't remember the origins of it. <laughs> Gotta start <laughs> cheese in the ham box. <laughs> in the slur box. The cheese melt. <laughs> Forgot about that. I... Uh, dude. This, this, this dude, is burnt. You dude. burnt the fuck out of it. Dude. What is this? Cut up the rest of them and make it again. You burnt the shit out of these. Dude. That's not chips. That's burnt bread. You just... You got crisp. Like, you just have crisp. All right, here's the pita chips. They're, they're not even, like... No, that's not chips. That's burnt. It's grease. It's greasy burnt. It's burnt grease. Nice and crunchy. Yum. Yeah, they're crunchy. Yala. No, I didn't have to add any Yala, extra crunchy. salt because the cheese and the bouillon is salty, but... Yeah. So, that's, she's just made soup. Bouillon. Like, liquid soup. Bouillon is salt. You can salt it to your taste. No, no salt. All right, it's just about done, guys. All right, so it's finished. Let's serve it up and try a bite with... Oh. Oh. <laughs> let's try that again. All right, let's serve this up. she just almost fall? Oh. The camera almost fell. No, fall. her. <laughs> let's try that again. All right. Right there. No. Watch. Okay, no. Try a bite with... No, watch. Oh. She didn't. She's trying let's to get herself in right, frame. No, right here. Watch. She, like, tips over a little bit too far. Okay. All right. No. Let's serve this up. She, she's, she's just leaning on the refrigerator. No, she almost fell right there. It smells amazing. It smells amazing. Yeah, couldn't cut that out. So, yeah, she just made soup. You could have had vegetables. I just threw the whole chip in there. Oh, okay. Here it is. All right. Have a seat. Here it is. Cauliflower cheddar. And of course, there's carrot in there. And the potato chips. They're so crunchy. So crunchy. So moldy cheese bowl. Oh, I got it ready. You got your thumbs? Oh, it's hot. Yeah, it's R hot. Really? It was cooking. Usually, you're used to cold food by the time Sally brings it to you. Mm, very hot. 
Mm -hmm. She's not even getting any of it. No. She knows it's toxic sludge. It is toxic so she's like putting her teeth on it going, I, I, I. Yeah, she made cheese dip and called it soup, oh pretty much. Oh my god, look how sweaty she is, too. That's where all the extra salt's coming all from. All this for cheese dip. <laughs> it, it, yeah, it is, it's cheese dip with cauliflower. Uh -huh. Yeah, we see it. You don't have to hold it out. There you go, wait for you. You didn't say bismillah. You didn't say bismillah. Mm -mm. Let's keep your chin. She has to really pretend to like it. Mm -hmm. The carrot adds like a sweetness. Oh, so the carrot adds a sweetness. You guys, this was so simple. Was it? You too can use old moldy vegetables to make cheese dip. Fabiaga said, I'm pretty sure there's at least 37 countries where this cannot be considered food. <laughs> <laughs> I think you're right. Yeah, well, soup is not food, as you say. Well, that's just a fact, but this isn't soup. This is cheese dip. Man, I just got the masculine urge to make queso dip. Some queso. I, do we have peppers? No. Uh, no queso. <laughs> no, you make queso. Okay, with a don't, stop. Velveeta and Rotel. Let's put it all together and melt it. I, you best case ever. You should have just stopped when I That's said That's the it. best case ever. That's not. No, we don't need chunks of peppers. Yes, you. you need a can of Rotel and Velveeta. It makes queso. It's delicious. You never tried it. It's delicious. We don't have to cut up peppers. That's not going to be good. You can just make it. The way Velveeta tells you to make it. You could have just. It's delicious. You could have just. But we don't have that either. You can go to the store. See, true. Iso Bandit says that's true. Yeah, and literally every... You know what? You can make it. That's how you make it. What? All right. It's homemade. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> can I have some? We're, we're not doing this again. Fish. <laughs> oh. it, white queso is the best case. Is there another type of queso? A pigeon just came and got some bread. Is there a non-white queso? A pigeon just came and got some bread on my window, so... I, nothing would make me happier than a bird getting into Foodie's Kitchen. That would be hilarious. So delicious. I, fake gamer cat, I might. Th this has been a, a series of unfortunate takes from Miss <laughs> <laughs> Chilies? There's okay. Hold on. There's still chilies. Yeah, we went to Chili's like three months ago. Oh, I'm thinking of Chi Chi's. Never mind. Yeah, there's no Chi Chi's. I had queso made with chihuahuas, chihuahuas and cheese. Cheese. You aren't supposed to put chihuahuas in your queso. Yeah, that's. that's never, I, you know what? I'm just gonna let that. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> He was just a Taco Bell mascot. It's not food. <laughs> uh, the Southwest egg rolls. Oh, I, w I didn't like it too much. Right. Are you guys in the chat okay with that piece of shit called to curl being stream boss from ham and beans? I mean, they it is well within striking distance. A couple gorilla regerts and he's out of here. But then again, Call to Curl is my hero, so. Yeah, he's a nice boy. I'm telling you, homemade. I don't always have, like, the energy. Okay, I, my mind is being blown right now. Queso Blanco is white queso. I didn't know. Yeah, there's two different kinds of queso. I didn't know. Yeah. Like, the white only. White queso is better. Yeah, th I didn't. It never occurred to me that there would be, like, a cheddar-based queso. Yeah, there's different kinds of queso. What a don't do that yeah okay that's fine uh, you know we, okay we're not we're not okay we're not doing we're that. not doing that uh tonight on sin and sass we look into the secret world of underground kuwaiti biological <laughs> weapons <manufacturer>. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh. 
motivation, but it's so much better. Yellow queso is queso and amarillo. Huh. I'm enjoying doing these videos for you guys and sharing my recipes with you. Yeah, you're recipes. A, my recipes. You're She's sweaty. Making it up as she goes is not a recipe. I can't believe you've never heard of the Velveeta queso before. Because they make Velveeta oh, I, cheese for queso. I told queso. you we're not doing this. It's like made for queso. I, I told we're it's not made for queso. Yeah, That's uh, what it's made for. You, it's for making queso. Right, I guess with. we have to do this. That's what's for. We're not doing this. It's what it's for. Okay, get that, and then you just. What chop are you gonna put in it? Shredded peppers. cheddar. No, you put peppers. What kind of cheese are you putting in it? That is, you said that's Velveeta, right? That's the what cheese. What were you gonna put in it? Peppers. What cheese were you gonna put in it? Oh, I don't know. I'd look it up. Yeah. Okay. So you don't even know how to make it. It's not an involved process. <laughs> you <laughs> melt the cheese, whatever the cheese is, and then you put peppers. In. If you put more than just peppers in it. Queso's got all kinds of stuff. No, no, just don't peppers? touch me there. Gross old hands on my no, no square. Stop Snow. arguing. I wanted to drop this like five minutes ago. We're not arguing. We're just talking about queso. This is how we speak to each other. It, it tastes like shit. <laughs> <laughs> queso's got shit. It's peppers. I think there's tomatoes. There's tomatoes. There's probably onions. There's all th the things that are in a can of Rotel is in queso. I don't think there's onions in queso. I don't know what's in queso, but all the things in the Rotel is what's in queso. <coughs> Anyway. No. A uh, stream boss, please? Uh, maybe. No. <laughs> Jeff got it. I don't know how Jeff got it, but he got it. <laughs> Jeff was first. Jeff. Oh, yeah, we can't forget the mold. Make something out of whatever you Did you read the thing? Pantry. Oh, no, I didn't. Sorry. <laughs> Uh, my lovely gift to Shelly because she's a slut for this. Also, chat, you still can't make the math math. Do I have to spank a dame or two for you to figure it out? Oh, my. I have to work on Monday, so you'll get annoyed spanks. Oh, my. Good ratio is best ratio, dickheads. I mean, it's all facts. Good job, and threats, Jeff. All facts. Thank you. Your fridge, your freezer. Don't ever think that you have nothing because Libby wants spankings. Um, I had and so does Joanne. Vegetables that we're going to go buy. That ladies cheese. line up. You know, I had to use the milk. And made a wonderful, um, comforting cheddar cauliflower soup with baked potato chips. So, yeah. looking up the recipe for queso. I am. I'm, I'm, other <laughs> I'm, I'm curious what, the, what, is, <laughs> what goes in queso. <laughs> it's sharp cheddar. Okay, seem. we're not making it from scratch with corn starch and evaporated milk and the whole thing. That's a bit ridiculous. Green chilies. I. Yeah. yeah, we're not doing that. But that's literal from scratch. We're not what? doing that. No, it's not. It's it's butter, cheese, garlic, chili peppers, pepper, tomato. You don't need corn the rest. Starch, of, yeah, you evaporated don't, milk, diced green chilies. You don't yeah. need you don't need cornstarch. I'm sure you do, and I'm sure you need Maybe evaporated milk. Otherwise, you just have cheese and butter, and seasoning. You got to make it quesoy. You gotta make it fluffy, like queso. Queso is a little fluffy. You can't just yeah. make it like melted butter and cheese. Like queso dips, yeah, it's got, oh, there are onions in there, look at that. Yeah. White American cheese, it. mozzarella, evaporated milk, corns, oh, that must be to help thicken it. Probably. Jalapenos. Milk makes it creamy. Spices. Spices. This does not seem difficult to make. Right, wife. Yeah. Life good. Wife fight back, kill wife. Wife gone. Think about wife. Regret. Regret. Uh, people in the chat are like fluffy. Uh, air right, what? It's uh, fluffy. It, it's aerated. Fluffy. Uh, hello, sins. What do we? <laughs> what do we? What do we? Do we? <laughs> uh, have a lovely week, everyone. Also, started Better Call Saul again. Thank you a lot. Oh, it, boy. It is so good. It is, I, I am thoroughly enjoying Kim. You like Kim? She steals the show. Chuck did, too. And so did everybody. Never mind. <laughs> mm. Mm. 
Livy's getting all pervy in the chat talking about spankings. Livy, calm down. Relax. Mr. Livy, get your wife. Kitchen, Spank your wife. <laughs> you don't have to use a roux with flour and butter because blending the vegetables makes it thick. But you can even blend a potato, like half a potato. What are your thoughts on the brother and better call Saul? Uh, Nacho was amazing. With, uh, cook it with Chuck, great actor. It, I, we're, I don't want to get into it right now because I have very... No, we're not doing Better Call Saul again. I have very mixed feelings. The cauliflower <sighs> and the carrot, and that will also thicken it a lot. That's... Okay, Chantal. Um, I would advise letting it sit for a few minutes before you dig in like I did, but it's so good. All right, guys. So that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. See you in the next one. Bye. Oh, before hey. I... What is this? Oh, she did put she rice in it. pour it over rice? She put rice in it. Dude. And chicken. Rice and chicken. What? Dude. She had that chicken in, that she was cooking and the rice. So she just made the soup and pretended it was a meal of its own. Uh, ISO Bandit going at it with a little bit of a different approach. 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 Ladies, send your bent over photos to Sinatra's direct mailing box here with my Streamlabs link. I mean, no. Yeah, that's uh, that's why I have Miss Sin for. She, <laughs> she's my mail sorter. So I want to show you the chicken dinner result. I did have a little. I just, I, I have an ungodly urge to just take it and go. <laughs> it looks like somebody did it with it. How it got here? You want to try that again? That's that's how it got there. Somebody went. <laughs> With the hand swaying motion like you did and put it on that plate. A little bit myself. Some rice and some roast chicken. Caboosey picks. And I made with the chicken drippings a nice chicken gravy to go on top. I thought we were making a roux. Oh, that's chicken gravy. It looks exactly look, like I, the soup that she I, just made. Motherfucker, I thought it was I think the it is. soup. It is the soup. This is not chicken gravy. I thought it, it was the soup. It's... The exact same color and consistency. It is the same. Thing. And it looks cheesy. It's the same. It thing. looks very it, cheesy. This is not a chicken roux. She's a la. It was very delicious. I hope you're having something good for dinner. See you next video. Bye. Yeah, I had chicken made well. Not with, not with cauliflower soup on top. I, I don't think I have ever hated every single frame of a video before, but this, this was terrible. might be the closest. Terrible. It's this video. I mean, it was better than the pizza bit video, but it, it was still awful. It's this video and then A Quiet Place. <laughs> <laughs> and then Bird Box. <laughs> Terrible. Terrible. We, we have more. More? We oh, shit. Look at her with the fan. Oh, that's, oh, the hide behind the tree. We have to see it. We have more. We, we have more. We have one more video. And that like ratio is still shit, guys. Smash the like, do the things with the sharing and the the, the stream labs and the, the the other stuff. And yay, that was good, right? That was good, honey. Real. So, I love the gorilla train. That's really cute. It's very. Good. Emma said, "Can we get a bingo update?" That's it. Have we gotten any? Bingos? Yeah, we should actually, because I've been very uh, lighter. Are we doing probably. Bingo? We got farts on Shelly. Where's Otter? That's uh. Otter. Three. Kitty, 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 Shelly kitty. has not tried to call the cops. I'm just going to X to doubt that that was good. And uh, tomorrow's chest day, but I don't know if I'm going to do that. I am impressively sleepy. Oh, kids don't have school tomorrow. No school tomorrow. Wait, do I have to go to work tomorrow? I do not believe so. I don't think I have to go to work so tomorrow. I owe you <gasps> no three a bingo. Tomorrow. We oh, get, we get to sleep in. Four a bingo. Yeah, I'll sleep in until seven, maybe. I'm going to sleep in until two o'clock. Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> Can I count that entire meal as shaming someone because she shamed the fuck out of herself? She shamed herself and those vegetables and that cheese. Her ancestors. That face she made at the cheese was shaming. She was making faces with her face. Aren't you your own boss? Yes, but I, st I still have a schedule that I have to go to work on. Yeah. Like I have houses that I do each day and Gig none tomorrow. Hey, there you go. Oh wait, I, this is a new one. <laughs> I like it. 
That's cute. I saw a guy do this in a toothpaste ad once. Ta da! I got really sad the other day. I saw a guy. Because I was watching old Looney Tunes. And it hit me that we will never get cartoons like this again. No, never again. Like, there were cartoons recently that were pretty good. Adventure Time, Teen Titans, like, those were solid cartoons. But this, even the new Tom and Jerry, the new Looney Tunes, it, it's gone. Like, the, the magic is not there. Right. The, the animation looks fucking terrible. Mm -hmm. They're all doing this interpolated half AI shit. This is done. Just the magic of... Saturday morning cartoons like waking up to watch cartoons that one day when cartoons were on in the morning like it's gone yeah. it's just cartoons whenever you turn on your Netflix. kids tablet Netflix yeah. whatever it's things are not the same well, that's why I still have Saturday cartoons yeah. I can come in here and watch Adventure Time as soon as I wake up Saturday well, morning well you can but it's it's different no it's, it's not it's not <laughs> it's not like a ritual and it's not on the television but, and it's not you're not watching the commercials and figuring out what you want for Christmas and seeing all the good cereal commercials it's not commercials that. anymore are it's none of the cell phones stuff. and prescriptions yeah it's none it's none of the good stuff anymore I he got his powers out of BLM okay I saw a thing a couple of weeks ago it was a study that said half half of all television ads are prescription pills. I believe it. I don't know who goes into the doctor and says, hey, I want to try these drugs. And the doctor's like, okay. If I went into the doctor, like, hey, I want some whatever drugs. I think that they would be like, no, I'm the doctor. I tell you what drugs you get. The doctor tells you what drugs you get. You don't go like, I saw a commercial about this and I want it. Yeah, it's, it's not like you're shopping. Don't, uh, we, this is a whole thing. It makes no sense to me. Okay, let's do this. Okay. Uh, <laughs> it doesn't because a lot of these drugs are just the same thing like there are a million blood pressure pills right and we as americans through good or bad capitalism pharma holding the power that it has you have the ability to go well i'm on this i want to try this and the doctor will go okay well the doctor will go okay if that Pharma company has came to them with their representatives and gotten in good with that doctor's office well, so that, that doctor's that, office recommends their it's, specific It's not drugs. even the doctor's office. It's the parent hospital. Right. So, I mean, you do what you do. No, I'm hopping up. Can't do it. I was only nine years no, old. No, we already saw this video. But I think you should be ashamed, toying with a human life for TV ratings. Uh, Homer, my face is up here. I've made my choice. I, a while ago, back when I had my old doctor, I, I s talked to her about Ozempic. And she goes, if you want to, you can. I'll tr you can try it, I'll put it in for you, but I don't really think you need it. You didn't need so it. it's it's one of those things where like if you do it they'll be like hey guys it's just so strange it is very strange the doctors should know what the drugs are that you might need for your condition and tell you what you need oh, I closed uh, the video I needed out I'll talk to chat for a second while I pull hi this back chat up. yeah everybody's upset about flamingo we can't do flamingo it gets copyright it's yeah. so sad. well hello there well hello there oh I love the hide behind the tree hello there. All right. Okay, foodie. Time to hide. Chapati, chicken Ready? fillet, cheese, some spookook, Sam spooky mukbang. Sam silent mukbang. Oh. Sam. Sam, this is your mukbang. It's your time to shine, buddy. All right, guys. Remember the liking and the sharing and all that stuff I just said before you okay, went down. Now salad's gonna count to ten, and foodie's gonna go hide. All right. Close your eyes. One. Well, hello there. Okay. <laughs> Can you find her? Ready or not, here I come. I can't find her. I no idea where she is. <laughs> Did you it's know? It's like that meme of Shaq hiding behind the telephone pole. And he's like, shh. That you can request a private video from me made just a for you that you can keep forever and ever. Just yep, that's right. You. I can wish you or a loved one a happy birthday or even give you a pep talk. I'm in Kuwait. Yeah, here's a pep talk, guys. 
I promise you don't want to end up here. Right. So if you want a cameo at a specific... Hello, okay. guys. Welcome back to another Whoa, video. Whoa, she's got three backup sandwiches uh, and a brand new thing of pickles. Uh-huh. Today I have like... Every time, brand new pickles, Jack. Eclectic mukbang. Um, That's not what eclectic means. This is what I'm having for lunch. So I have some refrigerator... Look, she's got the CPAP stuff right on her face. Uh-huh. You can see it. The cheek is cheeking today. And the teeth are also teething. Teeth are teething. The mouth is mouthing. Drainer carrot pickles that I made myself. I have my homemade gravy. You made them yourself? The eyebrows are eyebrowing. I have some. Everything is everythinging. Some chapati rashid and chapati halloum. <coughs> some cheese sambusa. And this is called Warbots. It's like a baklava pastry, but I, inside I it's I like love how stuff. all of the words she knows are food. I don't think those are secrets. CPAP marks. No, it is. That's the thing. No, I think like her this. face is just super fucking red. No, you can see the lines. Look over here. It's super discolored. Yeah, that's I think the lines. For, it goes like this. You can oh, see it goes cream. all the way around her chin. And that's the CPAP line. Water. It's all the way around I, her cheeks and down around her chin. But usually there's the straps. Well, there's no strap marks. Right now you can just see the mouthpiece mark. I don't think those are. She literally just woke up. I'm not even talking to my microphone, sorry. I don't think those are CPAP marks. It is. She literally just woke up. I don't see the strings. It looks like it's irritated her skin. Mm. Like water. she's got skin irritation from it. She probably hasn't washed her face in days. She probably hasn't washed her CPAP machine in Ever. forever. <laughs> and it's probably just irritating the fuck out of her skin. I don't know how they're going to be. It's not the strap parts. It's just the mouthpieces. Got her skin all red and bumpy. All right, Foodie, I'm going to need you to go put the CPAP on so we can see where it sits. We yeah. got to we gotta investigate this. You can follow the line around. Usually she's all filtered and her, her porcelain blurred skin is, you can't see it. This is filtered. That's the crazy part. It's just that bad. Maybe. Like, look, it, it's very filtered. It Like, the blotches are moving. They're there, though. Yeah, they're, they're very there. Mmm. Yeah, she likes that. Cheese you can tell when she likes it because she does a happy gravy? dance. Gravy? That's your cheese sauce you made. Who the fuck are you playing? That's your cheese. That's the cheese sauce that you made the other day with cauliflower and carrots. Dude! Yeah, you, her, she's very filtered. It's just that bad. My eyes were beady today, but now they're all open wide. They're, they're she, still beady. That's what beady means. I think... I, I think she's on something. Like, she's acting very different in this video. She's gone insane from being trapped in the house. You think she, she's finally cracked? Mm-hmm. It's Coco for Coco Puffs. She's very excited about food. You know what? Salad brought her food. She didn't have to cook. She's fucking happy because she thought she was going to have to cook for days. Bingo. She is so excited to have something with a wrapper. <clears throat> She's dancing. I make the best gravy. All right, so this is... Why is she trying to pass off that shit that she made as gravy? It's not gravy. Chapati bread and Indian bread. So good. Like she said she put the gravy on the rice. It, that's the fucking soup she made. It's the soup that she made. It looks exactly the same. She didn't make gravy that looks exactly like the soup. The color would be a little different. Yeah. At least a little bit. Lighter, darker, whatever. It's, it's, it's the exact same. With Zafar? And she made a mountain. Like an entire freaking pot of that gross soup. She, the, the witch made a cauldron. Yeah. Lime seasoning, tomatoes, olives. She was, all she didn't put in it was warts. Uh -huh. cheese. We don't need to see it. I, I gotta watch the wrapper. Hold cheese. All the way. She's so excited for fast food. Look at the wrap. I love the wrap so much. Look at that. Oh, I love it. Now we need to see it again. 
that looks gross. It's got seaweed in it? That looks gross. Hey, she found a fork. That's illegal. How is everybody? Illegal. I'm calling the police. Hmm. I just realized. Oh, she didn't like that. That was painful. The pickles aren't pickled enough. And that that was a painful bite. I lost my no ordering challenge. <laughs> Oh, you lost your no order out challenge. Well, uh, if salad darn. throws it at you, it's okay. Yeah, you didn't order it. Oh, shit. I didn't even realize, guys. We're like halfway to goal for her prosthetic foot. Thank you very much. Good work. Good birds. Oh, well, I'm a failure. Yeah, because you planned on it, right? Uh-huh. I should put her ring back on. I one more time, I'm sorry. I I the wraparound is so mind blowing to me. She has to shove it in It's not even that like wide of a wrap. She has to shove it in the right side of her mouth and then wraps the left side that okay. doesn't work around it. Uh-huh. Look. See? It's fucking mental. It, Dude. That's a weird way to take a bite. That doesn't work. It's a weird way. To take like if you had to do everything like this, you didn't. Yeah. You gotta wrap around. So uh, a little wrap around. <laughs> a little wrap around. Oh, I can't. I can't anymore. A bonus point to anyone who got that reference. Gonna do a little wrap around. Um. Okay, th this is whatever is this thing is. Meal? It's long. And she's um, strong and down to get the friction it's, on. It's, so, it's, ladies, it's, what? Yeah. it's ladies, like yeah. six <laughs> inches at least, and she's taken two bites and is more than half gone. You want to roll my Mercedes? Okay, that's enough of that. <laughs> Even white boys got the shot. Booty got clapped. <laughs> that's enough of that. They're like small samosas, basically. Um, I see people saying they got it, but not what it's from. So I'll believe it when you tell me what it's from. What do you got? Nothing. These little dough filled with stuff. You can Take get cheese, vegetables. Get the green ones. I don't like that flavor. D don't. I know there's no flavor. Okay, I, dude. You believed it for a second, didn't you? I, I thought we were about to go down a whole rabbit hole <laughs> when you handed me two green M&M's. <laughs> <laughs> Why would I, I, I? My mind just went 400 miles an hour, and, I, and not, none of playing. it, none of it occurred. As she just fucking with me, it was, was like, fucking with me. not even an option. Thank you. Okay, yes, it was Leahy. <laughs> We can't all chew at the same time. <laughs> Are also very popular. I'm surprised she took the peel off it. Extra calories. You know, that's true. Patty is an Indian type of bread. Three bites. Uh huh. Baby, four. baby four. got four bites. Baby got throat. Mm. Oh no. Oh, god damn. Ew. Right, wife. Yes, yeah, thank you. Wife, good. Wife, fight back. Kill wife. Wife gone. Think about wife. Regret. Regret. I love it so much. <laughs> uh, life right, is what? good. Enjoy queso will pepper. What? Enjoy queso will with peppers. With? Life good. Enjoy queso with pepper. Wife fight back. <laughs> Kill wife. <laughs> wife gone. Think about wife. Enjoy queso with peppers. <laughs> Thank you, King of the or Knight of the Diamond Spoon. Much appreciated. Like when you said peppers, I just imagine like big ass pepper chunks, and that does not go. No, you, you dice them up real small. Like it, mm -hmm. not. I'm not talking like bell peppers. Like you get jalapenos. Probably would be the most prominent one. You could probably do chili peppers. Dice super small, but. 
No, I would not. Uh, no, <laughs> <We're>, no, <laughs> no. <laughs> Don't even look at me. I'm not looking at you. It's almost like it's not like a non. No, it's not non. More chewy. All of their breads there are so thick. Like, everything is big, thick, floof bread. But it's like dough, flat dough, floof, not bread. It's not bread. She calls it bread. None of it's bread. It doesn't look like bread. It, it's it, like flat dough floofs. <laughs> and it, I don't, I've never eaten a flat dough floof before, and I don't know what it tastes like, and it all seems so strange to me. It's bread. <laughs> It's not bread. <laughs> it's not bread. Okay, it's, are you ready? Are, are you ready for this? It's dough. It's flatbread. <laughs> it doesn't look like bread. <laughs> when I think of bread, I think of bread. And when she calls it bread, I'm like, I don't know what the fuck that is, but it's not bread. It's like tortillas, but floofy. But I know it doesn't taste like a tortilla. Clearly, it tastes like something else, but I don't know you, what it tastes like. You've never like. had, like... A S Subway flatbread? No. First off, it's texturally very good. I've never had this weird floof flatbread before. I've had tortillas and I've had bread. And it you've doesn't never, look like either of those. You've never had like a pita or nothing? No. What? No. I've never had Seriously? a pita. You've I've never, never had, had a pita. You've never had a, a pinwheel? A well, sandwich I don't know wrap? what that is. Like a pin, it's like a... If, if I if I were to order a wrap, it would come in like a tortilla shell. If okay, you that, get a wrap, yeah, it's in no, a tortilla no, right. that shell. That would be a pinwheel, yeah. Uh, you've never... <sighs> I've never had this weird fluffy dough bread, and I don't know what it tastes like. I... But I don't want to call it bread, because it doesn't look like, to me, bread is bread. I know, it is bread, but it doesn't look like it. I I I'm at a never had of, a pita. I'm at a bit of What's a loss. What's it taste here. like? Bread. It tastes, <laughs> it tastes like, like bread. bread. <laughs> it doesn't look like it tastes like bread. Just because not bread shaped doesn't mean not bread. <laughs> <laughs> Libby, he said, "What does it taste like?" Libby said, "Beard." <laughs> Tired. Like a loud and proud beard. It tastes like beard. <laughs> I'm just sleepy. Leave me alone. I've never had You've never pita and I it, I'm just never sleepy. no. Never had pita. I, Are we gonna have a pita? I there's no way we don't now. <laughs> I'm gonna take you someday this week i'm gonna take if you, it doesn't taste like bread i'm gonna be furious it does it's a different texture but it's still bread like you've had muffins yeah muffins are like bread they're fluffy you've had they're like fluffy bread this is like flattened down you've but had, not flat uh, like on, a tortilla uh, hold on, just follow me here i'm gonna take you down the the airplane path you've had you've had muffins i've had muffins you've had dinner rolls at dinner rolls. You've had sliced bread? Those are all like You've the had, same family no, just, of bread. Follow me here. Okay. It's sliced bread, uh -huh. baguettes. What's a, a, a baguette? Is a big bread. Yeah, it's a long. A long bread. Wiener bread. But it's still bread. Okay, but you're following me here. Uh -huh. right? You get these are all different shapes and sizes. Those are all breads. It's that, but flat. But no, because it doesn't have the, like the, there, it's, the floofiness it's, inside. There's floof inside. It, do, no, it doesn't look like there's floof inside. It's not a lot, but it's in there. It doesn't look like there's floof inside. I'm going to take you to an Indian joint. Okay. Like a, an actual Indian joint. Is it going to be good? It, I liked it. I've never had it. Okay, I'm going to take you to an Indian. Okay. Hey, Livy, you shut the fuck up, beard bread. Beard bread. Hmm. 
Yeah, I, I figure like a, a Nan would be a good start for her non bread bread journey. <laughs> it doesn't look like bread. It looks like dough. It's it's just the way it's cooked. It's it like doesn't they made have, the dough and didn't fluff I, I, it. I don't think there's a what is it that makes yeast? I don't think they use as much if any yeast in it. Yeah, so it's it's dough not floofed into bread. Bread. It's like before it becomes bread, it's dough. Bread? What? It's cooked, it's cooked <laughs> dough without the bread fluff. That's a tortilla. Yeah, that's a tortilla. So that's, that's why I'm confused. I'm like, there's tortilla, and then there's bread, and then there's whatever that is. And I've never tasted that before. Apparently it's all the same, but tortilla doesn't taste like bread. Tortillas taste like tortilla. So I imagine that would be a third different thing because it doesn't look like bread or tortilla. It, 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 it. I'm sure I'm wrong. It's fine if I'm wrong. I don't know. I've never tasted it. I'm telling you. In my, in my mind, I saw that as a third different type of thing. There's tortilla, there's bread, and then there's whatever that is. That flat, weird floof bread that's not floofy. Babe. I know. It's different. No. I, I, I understand, but no, I don't. Just, babe, can you do me a, just the biggest favor? Oh, I did. Can you grab me one of my headhunters from downstairs? I'm not going downstairs, and I, you don't have any down there. I do. I put them in the fridge. Don't you got some beer up here? Nope. Are you trying to send me away? No, I'm asking you to go get me... But uh, Go grab both of them, please. I'll take another lime. Don't you touch my Emmys <laughs> while I'm gone. I will not touch your Emmys. If he eats an M&M, you guys tell me. Are you going to say mean things about me while I'm gone? I am not going to say anything. Take your phone and listen. I don't need to. I'm going to trust you. There's no beer on there. <laughs> there, there. There is beer. Anyway. My J Brady? I just... I needed a minute. I just needed a minute. Because I can't look at her face right now. <laughs> I can't look at her. It's the best gravy. It's not gravy. That's the the the, the, the cheese dip. Make your own pickles. Like, I used like. To oh, that was a big reveal right there. What's going on? What you got? The mange. I think Foodie Beauty's got mange. I used to think making pickles would be daunting. And then I discovered. I do think taking her to like a, a nice Indian joint or something to get. She is very food. I don't want to say ignorant, but unaware. So I, I think a, an Indian joint will be pretty good. Has Shelly ever had a chalupa before? I'm sure at some point she's had a chalupa. Refrigerator pickles. What? I heard my name. Someone asked if you've ever had a chalupa. No. You've never had a chalupa? No. Fuck off, yeah. No, I, I've never had a chalupa. You're fucking with us. I have never had a chalupa. I just... I Your car has had more chalupas than I have. <laughs> All right. that. Okay, that was traumatic enough. <laughs> you just need that brine. Right, wife. Thank you. Life good. Wife fight back. Kill wife. Wife gone. Think about wife. Regret. I'm I'm about to give you my card and send you over to Taco Bell and have right, you get like six chalupas. No, because that's not the same. It is. It's the that it is the tor it is a It's tortilla. No, it's not. It's a it's a flat It's a fluffy bread. tortilla. It's a flatbread. No, that's fluffy tortilla. The that's flatbread. not the same as what she's eating. Same genus. Right, but it's not the same. That's I, Mexican version. It's different. It's tortilla family. That's different bread. That's that's Middle Eastern bread. Oh, okay, what? Uh, life is good. Enjoy bread. Wife, <laughs> fight back. Send wife to get something downstairs. Wife gone. Enjoy silence. I was like, we just. I just need to. Well, okay, just then I won't. First. I won't share my inner workings of my mind with you anymore. There is nothing I want to hear more than these inner workings, babe. I <laughs> when she nods, I just a fish, fish. <laughs> There's nothing I want to hear more. 
than your inner workings. Sometimes I need you to explain things to me, honey. It's I'm, okay. I'm, I'm working on it. Vinegar. Um, salt. If I send her to Taco Bell, she'll come back with fucking fillet of fish. <laughs> See, if Robert says bread is bread like pickle is pickle, but no, because this shit she has here is not pickle. That's pickled carrots. Right. So bread, all bread is not all just the same. Yeah. Like all pickles are the same. This is a carrot in juice. That's different than pickles. What's on me? You got horse shit on you your face. You got shumatsami? Honey. Okay, this is chapati rashid. So this is chapati bread, chicken, like... Fried. Chalupas are that kind of bread. Fried chicken pieces, spicy mayo, lettuce, cheese. Sorry. It looks like an elephant ear. From the fair. I've had that. Is that similar? Mm. From French fries. It, wait, I, what was in there? Fried chicken pieces, spicy mayo, lettuce, cheese. So good. This sounds edible. Not a third of it in one bite, <laughs> but edible. <laughs> mm. A crunch wrap is a Mexican Pop Tart, I think. I think we can all get on the same page with that. But really doing heavy lifting saying that Taco Bell is Mexican food. From French fries. This must be the first takeout she's had in a little bit. Yeah. Because she is... She is happy. Savoring it. She happy is thing. happy. Yeah. Well, we know she made the soup... And then she made another meal with rice, with chicken, and the soup on it. So she's probably been eating no fast food for at least 24 hours. Yeah. She was probably on the verge of death from fast food withdrawal. This jar um, was a huge jar of pickles. Wow! Fish fish! <laughs> Seriously, are her lips blue? Uh, they are looking a little... Mm, I think it's just the no makeup and the color of her shirt making her look really pale. I, I really want to say the word I'm thinking of is cyanotic? I don't know what you're talking about. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Clean up the jar. Hold on. Well, if you were making more pickles in it, why does it matter? Dee Dee's Slurp Burger. <laughs> How about me and some fluffy pita? <laughs> yeah. I cleaned up the jar. Why are her teeth so shiny? I'm getting. Ugh. It's a major teeth reflection. You're a this baby. The jar. I basically... Um... Oh. Uh, so I made the, the brine with honey, vinegar, a bit of water, olive oil, salt. That's it. I don't have garlic. I'm pretty sure the word I was thinking of was cyanotic. Uh, my only question, and it's a legit curiosity, how has Shelly in her whole, whole life gone without trying all these different foods? Uh, which means she is an experience, which gives Sin uh, spoil her with new treats, sweets, and candies, too. Just saying, have fun with it. Oh, she's had, that's a nice list. She's had multiple candies. I, do, I, I have tried all of the candies. I do think that a, uh, a, a nice Indian place will be a good toe dip into something different. Yeah. Because they got good food. Look, I would have put garlic. You can put dill sprigs in there, too. We're not putting dill sprigs in our cheese dip. No, she was talking about in her pickles. She puts oil and honey and vinegar. You can put whatever and you want, like adi yani, you know? But yeah, the oil doesn't make sense. Yeah, I don't get the oil. In my novice experience, I thought... Oil and water don't mix. <laughs> oil and water. Because you can see all the oil just floating at the top. So what was the point? John, 
T message me. I'm going to have to send you this fucking old bit. Um, I, I thought pickling was just like whatever seasoning you wanted to put in it. Vinegar and salt. I have no idea. I've never made a pickle. I, me neither. Ariana says the semantic talks are 1010. Love you, Santa Shelley. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah. We, we, we figure but things out. This is all day. It, it Th is This all is day. how it gets we... frustrating sometimes <laughs> because it's literally everything. We have a big back and forth about this or that or whatever in it. Oh, it kills me sometimes. I just need peace and quiet once in a while. <laughs> but I love you. I, I love our conversations, sweetheart. <laughs> I'm not always the stupid one. Sometimes you're wrong. I, that does happen. <laughs> Sometimes my project gets thrown across the lawn. Yeah, yeah, things happen. Yeah, like that thing you made the other day that didn't work. And I, if you just would have listened to me when I said that's not going to work. But the other... Th it did. No, it but didn't. But didn't. It didn't. I followed... A blueprint. But I, you should have listened to your wife. I should have not looked at ma matrix metric. <laughs> I should have listened to your wife. That's still sitting out there. That's got to go in the thing. Uh, since I make my own pickles, yes, you make the brine, whatever spices to flavor, onion, dill, garlic, pepper, not freaking honey and oil. But it, what? it is just like salt and vinegar as a basic brine, isn't it? Dude, pickled onions are... Doesn't it take a good. while to pickle something? I imagine it would need to sit in the water for, like, an extended amount of time to turn into pickle. Yeah, it is. It's not... I mean, I imagine she just made this a few days ago. She she So she just soaked the carrots in vinegar and called it pickles. The Shelly is Shelly. I'm just sleepy today, so my brain's not quick. <laughs> my brain is slow. Just today. Uh-huh. I've had enough coffee. I, I, you know what? Hot honey pickles does not sound... I'm, I'm on a real big hot honey kick. Anytime I see hot honey anything anywhere, I'm like... Mm. But you won't eat honey mustard. No, I'm not a big fan. It doesn't taste like mustard. I, I'm still not a big fan of it. If you like hot honey, you probably would like honey mustard. Do, do you know what hot honey is? It's like a honey mustard? No. But without the mustard? No. I don't know what it is then. Okay, okay. <laughs> Just because it has honey. No. We're not, do we're not doing it. It's some kind of dip, right? No. You made me drop an M&M. Brian is salted vinegar, thank you. Yeah, that's it. And then refrigerate them for like... Have you tried the... I don't like Oots chips. I, I'm not... I really don't like Oots chips. Why? Hot honey is They're very good on pizza. So it is a dip. No, it's on the pizza. Is it a sauce? It's honey with the red pepper flakes. It's hot honey. Ew. Where'd you even find this? At the pizza joint. What pizza? When? At least 24 hours. When did you have this you magical honey hot pizza without me? I, you were with me. You had no hot honey pizza. It was at that place in uh, Lakewood. I don't remember any such thing. Woman. Any vegetables, like, I put. Why didn't you let me try it, it if it was so delicious? I didn't get a bite Ooh. of this hot honey pizza. Oh my God. I also put a little bit of hot sauce. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> I need to have a bite. It, but, okay, I, I'm gonna have to stick up for Miss Sin on this one a little bit. She thinks everything. Is a dipping sauce. <laughs> I mean, everything is a dipping sauce. And food is just Honey a, is a dipping sauce. Food at McDonald's for your chicken nuggies. Food is just a vehicle for her to eat the dipping sauce. That's true. Uh, yeah. I'm I'm whatever it is I'm eating, I'm just eating the sauce. And the food is just for the sauce. That is exactly what it is. It, I was very not sure about the honey, um, nu nugs. 
That's good. That, that's... It's also good on McDonald's fries. Now, imagine that honey. Spicy. I, mean, I don't think that would be good. It's very good, especially if you do the red pepper flakes. Whew. It has. So you're starting to win the people back. Welcome with your... home from the concert, Emma. You're starting to win the people back with your inordinate mm. dippy sauce eating. And dippy sauce is good. I like it. I like. I like me a sauce. I and like... I need a lot of sauce. I and like if spicy. they only give me a couple sauces, I'm going to be angry. I like spicy. Spicy sauce. Yeah, I like spicy sauce. But, like, I don't want ranch. I like ranch. I want the jalapeno ranch. I want whatever I'm doing. But it shouldn't overpower the food. It should be an additive. No. It should just be sauce. Just sauce. If if I ever catch you, and I swear to God, I, I'm, I'm making a promise now and in front of 700 people. <laughs> if I ever catch you drinking. I don't drink it. A sauce. I don't drink sauce. I promise I'm going to take a picture and I'm going to put it on Twitter. I'm going to be like, look at this fat. I don't drink sauce. <laughs> look at this But fat I do. Foodie beauty bitch. Scoop it with my finger. That's just as bad. <laughs> <laughs> well, if there's sauce left over and it's good sauce, you can't just waste a little bit of sauce. So you have to scoop it with your finger. But I wouldn't just drink it out of the bottle. Have you ever bit your finger? No, I'm not going to bite my own finger. I have you. Accidentally, I've bit my finger when I was eating before. When I was eating sauce. Yeah, have you ever like? Oh, no, because a, you don't bite sauce. There's an extra chicky strip in there. <laughs> you don't bite sauce. Is that you? <laughs> honey, it's like buffalo, but like with cream inside. So good. You see, I, I, if I did, if I, if I did that, I wouldn't admit to it. I don't care. That's I would you, guys, you guys are judging me anyways. I'll tell you, I'm a weirdo. I don't give a shit. But we love you as a weirdo. I know. I'm not gonna like eat all of the sauce with my finger but just if it's the only if it's a really good sauce not if it's just like ketchup or something no you can't do that it's a really good sauce then yeah i'm gonna it, i'm gonna get the last little bit and i'm gonna eat it the all sauces finger. that are 75 cents and up it's understandable yeah the good sauce yeah See, that's funny. We had raisin canes today. I am not a big fan of I don't of like their the sauce. cane sauce. I don't either. I don't like their honey mustard either. Mm -hmm. Every time the kid wants raisin canes, I'm like, oh, raisin canes. I don't like their sauce. Yeah, that's not great. But, okay, you know what? You know where's a good sauce? It's Chick fil A sauce. It's a good sauce. Not super hip to that. But the best sauce is the blackened ranch from Popeyes. I will take every little bit of that out with any like if I mean, there you could is, just use your finger if there's a little bit left over. If there's like a fucking chode of a fry left, I'm just getting it in the corners. <laughs> but what if there's no fries left? Then I'm done. You just gonna leave that little bit of sauce? I'll, I'll tongue it out if there's a little. See, I, I'm not gonna use my tongue. I'm gonna use my finger. Oh, you're good. With I'm not gonna uh, 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 and put the sauce. That's weird. You're good with the tongue. That would be. Bizarre behavior. That's weird. That's weird. That's the, that's Just the, use your finger like a normal person. You don't have to stick your tongue in the cup. God. Okay. <laughs> I would love to go to Iran someday. It's like so rich in culture, you know? Our Popeyes also takes 84 billion years to fill an order. It's oh my so God. It takes forever. There'll be nobody in line. Why? It's so Why does it take so long? It's fucking good. I, I, I sit there and I wait happily in that line if I'm getting it for myself because <laughs> I know the deliciousness I don't ever get it for me I just go to get it for you and I just order your food because I hate Popeyes I get Chick-fil-a and I go across the street <laughs> to get your Popeyes oh fuck I oh man I am I am here for the Popeyes you can learn so much about the culture too spicy that's what I, I get the spicy chicken strips and the hot ranch and I I love it until the next day and then you complain about the it next day a few hours later that it is screaming <laughs> I'll be in the bathroom fighting for my life she goes you shouldn't ate Popeyes I'm like it's so worth it <laughs> oh god <laughs> So 
Last night I did a live stream. And like. Oh, fuck the fork. <laughs> I was almost falling asleep. And then. I stayed on so long. I kind of got like a second wind. You know, all she was waiting to do was dig into that pastry. Uh -huh. She's gotten two different pickles and took a bite and put them down. Yeah, why? Because they're not fully pickled. They're still hard cucumbers, I bet. <laughs> what? They're still hard cucumbers or carrots. <laughs> they're still carrots. They're not, they're not pickles yet. Okay, hold on. We're going to take a pause here. John just sent me something I want to bring up. Oh, please don't be copyright. Please don't be copyright. Please don't be obnoxiously racist, John. Uh-oh. Welcome to Popeyes. How can I help you, sir? Um, can I get a three-piece with fries and mashed potatoes and with gravy on the side? Uh, yes, sir. Um, uh, spicy. Yes, sir! Move, move! Where? What, what do you want? What do you want? I just want a three-piece with fries. God damn! Spicy them all! Spicy. Here! Damn, go on! Shit, this is not even my order. This is it, it don't matter! Get out of here! <laughs> they always fuck up the order, too. Every time they fuck up the order. It's <laughs> <is> amazing! <laughs> this is exactly what it's... I mean, you know what? I'm like, yeah, no, I'll take it. It's good. Just give it to me. <laughs> yeah, it's it's good. Come on, let me have it. <laughs> Can I at least get some sauce? We don't have no more sauce! Shit! It's right there, though. It's not for you! Get your bitch ass up out I'm not playing. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? You need to come on! Just put the chicken in the box. Man, this ain't no five star restaurant. This is Popeye's. Pick it up with your hand. Man, what are you You cut over here using tongs and shit. Get out of here, you cut. Here. <laughs> Welcome to Popeye's here. Give me one sec. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Hold on. Welcome to Popeye's here. Give me one sec. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> Damn, nigga, I said, give me one sec. Yeah, that's what I like to hear. <laughs> he didn't take your ass home. Yeah, tell him. That tell him. For real. Nigga, pull up to the window. Hey, 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 hey. Pull up to the window, man. <laughs> See, I don't care though. I'll be in line like I'm gonna pull up. I want my fucking. <laughs> I love Papa so much. Oh, that was a welcome little break. <laughs> Thank you, John. Uh, <laughs> look at the hearts. <laughs> oh, that was good. Uh, my stomach hurts. <laughs> All right, are we being fed about foodie? Foodie. Shit, dude, I'm crying. That was good. Yeah, and he just They were making the orders way too fast, though, to actually be at a He list. had that ready, too. Like, that's something he watched yeah. the past day or two. Yeah, he knew. There's a drill sergeant behind the counter. <laughs> no, that was good. When I crush? Not enough end bombs. I've never been called the end n word so many times in that of Popeyes. I'm a giant white dude. So, <laughs> I crashed hard. This feels so low energy now in comparison. Right. Did she just tap it? There's no dipping sauce there, Amber. She's doing the imaginary dips. <laughs> Amber. Amber with her imaginary <laughs> dipping. That video was hilarious. What is the other hand doing that it can't come up and assist? Uh, that's Let the poop hand, up, right? Like, yeah, but we've seen her lick the fingers off of it. Yeah. It's like flaky kind of. Oh, it's good. I bet that she hates that she can't just double hand eat anymore. Well, we've seen her do it. Like, she's perfectly content oh, yeah, double fisting. Oh, yeah, she does fisting. it all. Yeah, but she's not supposed to, and she knows she's not supposed to, so she tries to stop herself. 
Like when we saw her almost reach it into the pot pie oh and then God. stop. The, her reaching into the pot pie was one of the greatest <laughs> fucking things. Of the things you've seen me try here, what is one thing you really want to try? Okay, wait. That's a good pause. I thought those were pastries. No, just that one thing at the end was a pastry. Those are some other cheese-filled things or something. Oh, so we're putting cheese on the cheese? Yes. Look who's here. Uh -oh. Just in time for her bingo. I think we had her bingo. We didn't have her yet, did we? Yeah. Did we? Oh, Good. that was wow. the best meow, Otter. Good job. You know your job. She understood her assignment. Yeah. The cheese inside this time stuff are like... It's a very salty... Yeah, it's... It's a pickle. Look at that oh, face. look at that face. Look at that face. Squish that foodie. More otter. Cheese kind of like feta. You more? <laughs> no. Actually, There's no it. more. Just push her she out of the way. She said you get one mouth. <laughs> one mouth for you. You come back, one show. <laughs> <laughs> Is there, uh, Soma's think of an Arab uh, egg roll. Lamb, cheese, fat. Ooh, that sounds pretty good. You can't see it. It's like a white cheese. You're a white cheese. <laughs> Massaging her sun dried sciatica. Look at this precious baby. Look at her eye in my lap. Don't you go with that. You're my let, kitty. Let her go. She's going to come, right? I don't even want her. I'm so don't tired, you go over there. <laughs> I didn't have my unit much. Don't you there. even think about it. I'm petting you. Dad's not going to pet you. Oh, you little oh. shit. What are you going over there for? Mm, your lap is more bigger than mine. That's why and she goes she to you. She just lays right down. I know. Okay, I'll pet you. You better too. pet the cat. No, Unimate? No, she took all the Unicity shit out of her description. They weren't making any money on their MLM? I'm shocked. No. See, Otter loves him now, but at bedtime, she won't go anywhere by him. She's got to lay next to Mom. She'll come over I've... and she'll check it out, but I don't lay on my back, so she don't want it. No, nope, she goes right back to me every time. <laughs> Damn. What are you sharking about? Da, da, oh, Gray's da, in here too. Hello, oh. Gray. She, she spotted Gray. Are you in here too? You get another mouth from you? Huh? Where'd you go? Yeah. That's life. Hurt. No, foodie, don't do it. Don't. Don't what? you dare. She's gonna do it. No. I. I. Well, she's I going her. to, but I. I'm praying she doesn't. That's life. Say life. She's, she's, she's gonna. Oh no! Okay, never mind. Look okay. right. Her lips are blue. Whoever called that out. Um. Sticky. Well, that was yummy. I can't believe how well my pickles turned out. I was like, mm, are these gonna turn out okay? But they did. It didn't pickles. seem like you liked them. Why? Why is every other nail trimmed? I know, I would have never noticed that. They're so good. Anyways. Hey, look, pinky. They're not trimmed, they're just bitten off. Pinky bit, ring they're finger not knot, middle finger bit. Yeah, well, mine are all different lengths too, because that one broke the other day. Guys, I guess that's it, really. I'm kind of tired. She doesn't tired. do her nails, she just rips them off. Okay, we're done with this one. We're going to go where Salad showed up again. So we had to Salad? We, he, salad Man. The poopster himself has turned back up. Guys, we still have like 600 people watching this. What? I, I don't know how you're all still here. I'm sorry. But I'm glad you are. We don't got to get up early. We're That's in true. A, we're in it to win it at we this don't. point. And this, this, this is B&D. It's what? This is hardcore B&D. B&D? Bold and daring. Oh, okay. My love says... 
Hi. Isn't this how men wear their hats over there? Yes. This is the men's style. Maybe. I I don't think women wear the hats like this. I didn't think women wear the hats at all, but I'm not... Like the way she's got it wrapped up with the twist around the thing? I think that's how men wear them, I, is it not? I couldn't tell you. I could not tell you. But what I will tell the chat is, this is no longer a request. You have to smash the like button. Oh, yeah, that's true. You must share it out, to Livy. <laughs> she's not wrong. <laughs> and the, the 2666 is... That's your perfectly timed donut right there. Anyway, uh, wonderful starting frame. Could not ask for a better start. You're working the camera. You're really... Oh, my God. Her eyebrows look like when she fucked it up and just ended up like crayon. Oh, yeah. Bleh. Yeah, she filled them in good today. That was my foot. Okay. That freaked me the fuck out. All right. Are you ready? I'm ready. My love says hi. Salad's ungrounded. Because we were never going to speak his name again on this channel. It was just Chantel only. We were not allowed to ask about or hear about or know that Salad exists ever again. Yep. Yeah. So that he's in the title is a big change. I aim to Olise. Please. <laughs> okay, guys, it's a scarf, just a scarf. She's wearing it in a men's style. It is in a men's style, right? The pattern is Palestine, and that's as deep as it gets. Okay. It no, is. I was just wondering, that's the men's style of the way the men wear it. That's all I was wondering. I, I wonder if... Because the women do it around under their chin, and then the men wrap it around just their head. I wonder... I, I wonder if it's kind of like... Kind of like a blouse v shirt distinction. Yeah, probably. Like nobody would ever know unless he pointed it out. Maybe. Cats girl. Hi, sweetheart. Okay, so maybe cats do come when you call. <laughs> cats do come when you call. Her just street not ours. cat. Just, they uh, only listen when they want to listen. Peanut came when, when I, we call them at bedtime. They come sometimes. Peanut came when I called it. We were at my friend's house, our friend's house, the girl who helps me shoot my videos. We we're at her house last night with her husband, and I'm getting a beer out of the fridge. She's like, "Check the fridge." I'm like, "It's still here." And she goes, "No, make sure the cat's not in it." And I was like, "What?" And I open it up, and there's no, there's no cat in the fridge. It's like, what the fuck are you talking about, man? And she goes, "Watch." And she walks over to the fridge and opens it up. And this cat spawned in, in the hall. Like, <laughs> it wasn't there. Then it was there. And it spawned in, in the hallway and it went voop, right in the fridge and just sat down. Yeah. It just wanted to be in the fridge. It just wanted to be in the fridge. I'm like, that's the weirdest fucking shit I've ever seen a cat it do. It seems very dangerous. Yeah. Well, like, we gotta just like, close it and then you have a frozen cat sickle. You gotta really pay attention to make sure the cat's <laughs> not in the fridge, apparently. Your first. <laughs> Susu. She's trying to attach herself to a cause we, cause we all know she's an idiot. I don't remember where it might have been from FFG because she was on autoplay earlier. But somebody made the point that Chantel has attached herself to Palestine. Look what the cat fucking did. And she drills. A lot. Mm -hmm. Chantel has attached herself to Palestine and assumes that FFG is Israel. Mm -hmm. And that's it. That yeah. it's no, she's the the war will never end because of FFG. Like yeah. in Chantel's mind, that she's got her own little war. That's happening. that's that is the war. That's the war, and that is fucking bonkers. That it's I, and I heard it. I'm like, she probably. Is. It, that's it. That's pretty accurate. She was super gay just three years ago. Three years. It was less than that. Greta McGriddles. She shaved her head. I think. 22? Maybe. And she's been in Kuwait for just over a year. Mm -hmm. So, she was super gay 14 months ago? Yeah. <laughs> hey, Ula. You always remind me of like a McGriddle from McDonald's. Kelly, hello, Yosef. Darren, hey, Darren, hey. You're not first. I had to break it to you. What? what? 
<laughs> a griddle. Better yeah. luck next time. Uh, can we all agree that Pacific McDonald's breakfast Pacific? is S tier? I only oh. like their oh, yeah. sausage gravy biscuits. Hold on, guys. I gotta open the curtain. I their bagels are good. I don't like I don't like breakfast sandwiches a lot. I think as far as breakfast sandwiches go, McDonald's probably got the market corner. The McGrill. I, I, I like if I were to get a breakfast sandwich, I would want the Burger King croissant sandwich. The croissant sandwiches, sandwiches are good. The croissant sandwiches are very good too. But I'm getting the enormous burrito. But the, the McDonald's it's 9 so bread it. is dry. Well, because it's a muffin, a biscuit, or a McGriddle. The McGriddles are pancakes. That's, that's too sweet. That's why, I, that's why I would choose Burger King. Okay, it's not dry. So I'm going to have some collagen and cold water. Oh, man, the croissants are Hi, Simon. But if I get a McDonald's breakfast, I'm getting the bagel. Yeah, I'm getting like the steak, egg, and cheese, cheese bagel is amazing. <laughs> Whatever sauce. sauce they put on, it's fantastic. Sausage gravy. Well, so, sausage gravy. Sausage gravy. Chantel, the way is, my name is spelled, the other way. You, there's different ways to spell Chantel. It's not on the menu. Like, you just have to order it. Like I mean, the so breakfast menu that. doesn't say sausage gravy yeah, biscuits, it's but it's there. Livy says and the hash browns best, but I don't know who she's talking about because both hash browns are amazing. I like the little circle hash browns better. I loved, I loved Duncan's hash browns. I don't like those. Or, until I went there the other day and I was like, can I get a order of hash browns? And it was like two dollars and seventy five cents, and I got six little nickels. Yeah. <laughs> I was so mad. Are you okay? You can't have collagen. You have like collagen or something, or? You know what fast food place well, is ridiculously some. underrated? Uh, Arby's. You guys, I swear. Arby's you isn't bad. Arby's are, you so know what? Fucking Arby's like, sauce um, is good. The horsey sauce fingers? is no. great. Sauce. Yeah, I didn't get yeah. really hip to horse to horse radish like until sauce. Rob made me put it on the sandwich. Oh, that was good on that like, sandwich. Oh, that that one particular shit. time, that was good. Well, that's how you're supposed to eat horse radish. And I was, I thought it was something else, but he did that. He's like, no, I'm putting it on the sandwich. You fucking try it. Rob is the guy who does our comic club songs. Doesn't really have a taste, but. He's like, you're putting it on the I sandwich, you try it. And I tried it like, coffee, dude, cold water, I've lived 30 years yeah, without this. <laughs> I feel cheated. Thank you. You're always awake to your job. You're like me. Thanks, Sidman. I figure we could just ramble while she does this. Yeah, yeah we might as well. We got like, she's just background noise. We got like five more minutes till she actually starts talking. Like, a lot of them walked away from me, but then there was, oh, there's always one that likes me until it kicks me. Hi, Blondie Barstow. They're so tall, yeah. Perfect wings. They're actually not looking. Look closely. This one is shorter. She's got the amber wings. It's mm. it's nine fifteen. Yep. You know what? The only thing I can suggest is practice makes perfect with that. Oh, I forgot. Superstorm. I completely forgot that Arby's had those loaded potatoes. I don't. I don't think I've ever had. Them. Does Does Wendy's still do the baked potatoes? Yes. Do they really? Yes, they do. Man, I have. That's been why I usually get at Wendy's. Up. Because I don't know. And look at like, John, I saw that, and it, it was on a local Facebook page, and someone's like, is this a Compton in Cleveland? And then the, every single comment was, dogs bred to kill and guard dog, malls, person. Shocking. <laughs> yeah, right? More at 11. I don't know why I bother. You know what? Because if I don't wear makeup, if I don't, I seriously look my age. I look 40. Like, I look old. I go from looking like... You don't, though, Chantel. Makeup makes everybody look a little bit better, but it doesn't make you look years younger. I used to love the steak, egg, and cheese bagel, but I can't get them anymore. Why? That is the best. Now mid thirties to like. In the realm of breakfast sandwiches, you have your croissants, you have your sausage McMuffin. Shit, man. I have been known to just get a sausage and cheese biscuit from time to time. But the steak, egg, and cheese bagel. That Did they put extra steak on it? Steak. Never had one. It sits in a realm of its own. Okay. It is the upper echelon. Like, yeah. I swear 50 if I don't want to go. I'm not kidding. Angela, I can imagine you? steak from McDonald's would the be good. Seem to roam, yeah. It's Thanks, not good steak. Um, yeah, yeah. Okay, so not. It depends. Like if you're driving, it's your ribs are terrible. It's like, hold on. Oh. 
The ribs are not ribs. The Mc... You don't like the McRib? No. Uh, what? It's gross. Mm. You know what? I only took one bite of it one time, and I didn't like it. But we're not doing it. Like... Uh, first off, thank you to all who wish my girl a happy 13th birthday. Second, funny princess and never mauled anyone. Yeah, right? It's weird. It's almost like... Huh. Um... Also, happy birthday, kiddo. One week or two, yes, happy birthday. Um, when you're driving along the long stretch of desert area, you'll see all kinds of camels all over. Now, um, they're owned by Kuwaitis, and usually the McRib is marketing 101. And that's the thing is, it's not. It's not good. But when they're back, I'm going to get six of them. <laughs> I'm going to get them as much as I can. Camel guard with them. Um, but sometimes they're just roaming around freely and the guard's not around and whatever. If there's the guard, we usually just say, do you mind if we hang out with your kids? And you know what it is? It's the texture. That's my, the, that was the gross part of it. My teeth like them. I don't, that's what I don't like about it. Animals and they're like, nah. But it, it's like Chipotle really steak. My them, teeth so. like it. Hello, Cynthia. Yeah. It's my hard leg, to it explain. Really hurt, so my leg's okay. There's a Maddie, hi. I want McDonald's french fries. I could, the Shamrock Shake is back and I have been, I, I have been self-indulgent than I got on the scale. I texted Mrs. <laughs> yesterday morning. Oh, yeah. It was like 258.2. And then I texted her a little bit later, and it was 256.8. I said, why are you sending me numbers? And I was like, I took a 1.6 pound poop. <laughs> <laughs> so I have been self-indulgent. That, and I, that's, how, that's how Amber does it. Put the shamrock shake, man. It's so good. It's so good. Show. How are you guys? Yeah, Julia's always bees in the back. Support sins McRim. 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 Oh, God. Julia. <laughs> Not his McRim. Head, please, no. I'm 15, don't, I don't, don't support, don't support that. Oh, brother, you're beautiful. You know, there's nothing wrong with looking. Oh, what's your face? Got that I mean, oh, no, no, no. I don't know. I don't mind. I mean, whatever. I don't like anybody. Everyone that. ages. Hi, Simply Ravishing. You know. Yeah, they have to roam around and get, you know, the desert's perfect for them. I've never had a shamrock shake. You should give it a go. It's good. It's, not min good. it's minty. It's mint milkshake. It's good. I like it. I like mint. No. Oh. I don't like, like it. Like grasshopper is one of my favorite cocktails. Yeah, I don't like it. I'm 59. I feel you're Robin. Angela, you don't look that from your picture. But what is 59? <laughs> NS Gaming says I'm on the replay and the caboose is popping off. <laughs> um, I, remember, I mean, everyone looks different at different ages, you know? Hey, I don't it just like, gets worse from there. I don't like the frosty and fries. No, no, that, no. That, that's not a thing that belongs together. Well, technically, legally here, my Muslim name is Miriam because you know I filled out the form and took my shahada and everything. But it's not like not legal. Like it's not really like a legal. Thank you, Ken and Nikki, for supporting my McRim. The legal thing, but yeah, I don't think some people have noticed yet. You know because. But I don't like mint chocolate chip. I like. The shamrock shake. It's a different flavor it's, of mint. It's just no chocolate. Yeah, like what Jean said, says, it, it's it's, the now. shamrock it's, shake it's takes like, like it's, it's artificial mint. It doesn't taste like mint. It tastes like mint flavor. Yeah. yeah. Like mint chocolate chip ice cream is good. No. Mint, like York peppermint patties. Those are good. No. Shamrock shake is like mint flavor. Do, do you notice the thing missing there? Mint. No. <laughs> The mint is missing from the, the shamrock, shamrock shake. The shamrock shake, the mint chocolate chip, and the New York patty. Those are all mint. The chocolate. It's got no chocolate. That's why you don't like it. No. It's just not good. There's no chocolate in there. Yeah, but there's not chocolate in every bite of mint chocolate chip ice cream either. Most of it's just mint. No. There's only little bits of chocolate chip S here and there. Stop it. S stop. Fish. Fish. Thirty-six or something. I love the coffee, well done. We also had a loot of rain here. I can't look at chat and I can't look at you. And I'm yeah, It tastes like sweet toothpaste. Yes, that's what it tastes like. Sweet toothpaste. I agree. Perfect description, witchy nonsense. Julie, I heard that, yeah. How are you liking Dubai, by the way? You people. Are you liking craft dinner? <laughs> Yum. Yum. And, you know, I planned this ahead of time. What do you plan? 
I hold on. Someone just sent me something good on Twitter. There's no planning I, here. I not no not this. <laughs> I I uh, this is from Helen Bottom Farter. Oh my god! <laughs> and I love the name. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. It's amazing. Oh my god! But uh, I I I skipped because I had uh, lunch with my brother and my aunt. We had Arby's. I skipped the dessert. Oh, that's you, chickens. It's, what? I thought you were anyway. That's your name. That's a good name. I I skipped dessert specifically to get a small shamrock shake tomorrow. Ah. Oh. I gotta watch what I'm doing, man. I, I I packed on a couple of pounds. Me, oh boy. I I got on the scale. I saw the five. I was like, ooh. Then I saw the eight. I was like, ooh, <laughs> bad. <sighs> I was sick for like a you month. I didn't eat shit. I feel old too. You have such a pretty face. Thank you, Kaylee. Thank you, Diana. I don't feel in the mind, but my body feels older. Yeah. It just like I don't know. I do too. I do miss you and Sola's couple channel. I hope he's doing well. Any chance you can do a grocery store vlog? Yeah, for sure. Next time we get groceries, yeah. Um, just got a few top-up things the other day, nothing worth filming, like pita- Hair poking out. The bread. Pita- She's got one lone strand of hair. Who- okay, listen to this. Uh -huh. <laughs> the face- the Facebook grandmas. Okay, they're- I feel like this is fake. I- I don't know who is- is typing this, but Cynthia writes, I just subbed a couple days ago. I'm also 39. You are so pretty. <laughs> now, how odd is it that someone out of nowhere would say, you are so pretty, and I just subbed a couple days ago? When there's just a couple days ago, <laughs> mysteriously, know. a bunch of new subs supposedly <laughs> come out of nowhere. You've had many people in the chat tonight say you're so pretty. <laughs> Do you believe that the Cynthia person is an actual new sub of Foodie Booty who really enjoys her content and thinks she's pretty? No. Or is this just someone trying to cover for Chantel's bot subs? No. I don't. Bread and Labna. We always need top-ups and drinks. Okay, now it's dissolving. This is going to make your your skin, your joints, everything is supposed to make it like help. And you know what? I feel. I is she chilling the Unamate again? I think she is. Knock on wood. Mashallah. I don't feel any pain right now. Like, I don't know. I've been taking... Well, the Unamate cures diabetes and sciatic. She doesn't feel any pain because she drank a Unamate. You well... Can, you can buy comments and bots on lives? Really? So that seems That seemed very suspicious to me. Her saying I subbed a couple days ago when there's just been all this hubbub about these <laughs> mysterious subs who aren't actually there or watching any videos. It's kind of coincidence. Uh, Natal's in the chat said collagen. Natal, thank you, and I love you. Those vitamin, Most, uh, vitamin injections, shopping. it's called Neurobiona. No, like I love Natal's B12, B6, B1, and some other B vitamin. Biotin, I've been taking collagen. I've been taking... I, I, look at her. I, I have collagen and biotin. That's why oh. she looks so young. Chat's telling her how much younger she looks than 39. It's wanna, the collagen. You want to hear a vitamin maraca? Because she just started taking the other day. Oh, you're a vitamin maraca. Yeah, I know. You got your vitamins, honey. In my weak pill dispenser. Doses of vitamin D. Two are prescription. Um, because women past a certain age, like especially if you've gone through menopause because of my surgery, um, my hysterectomy, you know, your bone density can diminish more quickly than others. Why is she but whispering? Like, I don't know. I don't want to whisper about it. Whispering like someone's not sleeping, but... <laughs> Um, you drink collagen. Uh -huh. That's I, that's the one thing I don't take. I have some, and I I put it in my coffee when I remember to. Yeah, well, uh, I should start putting it in because I make your coffee. Yeah, you should start. I I don't I don't do collagen. I do. You do everything. Everything else. else. You don't need collagen. <laughs> I you do, do everything else. Um, oh really, money to Venetia? I slept a couple of days ago. I'm also thirty nine. Nice. Sophia, I love your cup. Yeah, yes, thank you. <laughs> Magnesium, zinc, vitamin E, vitamin B, ashwagandha, uh, echinacea, my blood pressure medicine, le 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 lactesian, uh, CoQ10, potassium, oh my God, biotin, vitamin, no yeah, that's what I take. 
Yeah, I like it. I, I really like it. You can get protein with Should cologne in it, cool. says You're John. Very smart. Thank you, Cynthia. Baby I think face. You meant collagen. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I, I don't know. Kind of like my my mom too. It looks younger. She's vitamin D. I do a once. That's the I. Blood pressure medicine and vitamin D are the only prescriptions I'm on because I get the fifty thousand milligram once a week vitamin. Like I think almost sixty. Or not so. milligram. Uh, you. you. Oh, really, Diana? Good night, Libby. Yeah. I could be your mother. Wine's trends. Well, I always like having more mothers. Hi, Eva. You love the video with DC Media? Thank you. Yeah, I don't know. I don't like to focus. I always go back between, like, I don't want to focus on drama because I hate it. And mentally... It's oh, there we go. Thank you. I was looking for that one. <laughs> it's draining. Um, but then again, when you know I see something that's like... I don't know. I, I CoQ10 is good, but I've noticed no difference from taking it to not taking it. So I think that's going to be one that gets cut out. I have trouble shutting up when I see, like, something that I feel should be pointed out. Oh, something? Livy, I, fuck. I, if you're still here, let me know. I'll show Shelly that what you sent me right here so you can hear her reaction. I completely forgot to show her. What was it? Blah, 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 yes. Show me now. Her, the lashes. I but I want her to know you. Yeah. Uh, oh, you can lose hair with COVID? Hi, Melly. Can we skip to salad? I don't know when he comes in. So we're just ch Okay, she's here. Yeah, we're, we're pausing too much. Yeah, we're just chilling. We need to get to salad. 12 texts. Oh. Let me see. 9.15 p.m. here? You're playing Fortnite. Is that fun, Melly? Vanessa. Ah. The video is epic. Yeah, I mean... Oh, you do a good job, yeah, Livy. It's great, but hello. But how expensive are they? I'm watching you because I want to make Breezy jealous. Lashes are so good. They do look good. <laughs> Peace, nice design you're wearing. Thank you, Belly. They look so nice. <laughs> so nice. They look so nice. I want some. Vitamin D is like very important for your bones. It's very important for vitamin, yeah. Like the train text. Some more there? 180. Okay, I don't want them that bad. <laughs> Starts at 180. Yeesh. Holy moly. All right, Livy. That's probably why my lashes from the mall fell off in like three days because they were like $60. Good luck. <laughs> yeah, I can't, can't swing the 180 right now. No, you said she had, she had me at, she, so she was 16 when she got pregnant and she had me at 17. So how old would that make her? 56 or 57? It's, um, it's Mariam, M A R I. Marie. Uh, the CoQ10 helps improve sperm quality and mobility. Oh, I know. It's it's definitely worth it, Livy. I believe you. Okay, I thought you were talking about something else. <laughs> no, we're not We're not doing sperm quality pills anymore. The quality and no, or quantity. We're not doing the sperm quantity pills anymore. You don't want to what, get... Whatever those were, don't take them anymore, please. <laughs> no, I... That... <laughs> Call me whatever you want. Vitamin D3, yeah. It, that's still a thing. It's natural yeah. to defend yourself. I know, yeah. And I'm going to try to do Ultra it without, like, not, you know, it's, I haven't always done this, obviously. I've name-called a lot. But I'm trying, <laughs> Don't look at me like that. <laughs> trying to, like, not be like that. Because, honestly, when it comes down to, like, brass tab. Takes two and a half hours for a full set. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I, yeah, I believe it. Saying from. Um, in the end, it how much they weigh, doesn't, what they eat, what they do. Like, none of that matters when you're, like, trying to argue with someone. Like, if you want to have an intelligent argument. What put... Okay, so guys, this is just for you. Ladies, ears off. No, guys, when, don't do it. When you're playing Metal Gear Solid. Right. It's just the guys now. I cannot beat the Ender Dragon on my own. Now it's for sure just the guys. If you want more. No, you don't. Zinc, magnesium, Tyson. No. That's where you start. Don't do that. You know, with somebody, like, you know Don't what I mean? do that. It doesn't matter. What matters is, like, the main points or pointing out important things. You know what I mean? So, I don't know. The, the Latissin or whatever is a pineapple extract that is fantastic for volume. I watched the Melon CC JFS yesterday and lost some brain cells. Now that's some drama. I, like, saw some clips. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I saw some clips and, like, because I used to watch them, so he always gets recommended. Um... I don't know. I don't want to be mean to this person that's with him, but I don't think, like, she's really... I don't know. They're, like... It seems like ever since they're together, all they do is, like, get super drunk. No, Joanne, no. Uh -uh. That's 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 a wrap on that one. Like, she's apparently lost her channel, and, like... If we count the dog, I have 600% more kids than I've ever wanted. <laughs> I don't know. There were some moments where it looked like she was just, like, tweaking out. So I don't think that... I don't know if they're, like, really healthy for each other. If all they do is get super drunk... Oh, zinc! Don't forget zinc. You know? Like... I don't know. That's my opinion on it, though. I like he 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 won't want to lose his channel, you know. Hi, Suman. 
<laughs> okay, thank you for being here. Hi, Alexis. CK or Tom. Hey, how you doing? Long time no see. Southwest US. I was pregnant at 16 and had my first at 17. No way. That's, that's just like, yeah, just like my mom, your uh, teardrop. What alley, wait, or beach did Julia come from? Julia? Are you a street cat? Yes. Julia is a street cat. Yes. Are you? Who knows? Maybe she was. Just don't feed into it. Stay away from the dark side, yeah. Vitamin D, serotonin, it doesn't matter no if she was a street kid or not. What matters is that she needs the vaccinations. Really? Coffee is my love language. Oh, I said zinc. I thought I said uh, potassium. No, you can call me Chantel Tristan, Maddie. You can. Yes, I have four wonderful grandbabies. Mashallah, Robin. <laughs> Just stopping in before I go to bed to say, hey, my beautiful friend. Hey, no name. Yeah, how are you doing? Thank you for stopping in. <laughs> it's nice to see all you guys. I'm also getting a little bit tipped, so yes. thank you for it. All right, let's try this bottoms up. It's for health. It smells like pennies. No. Hi, Silvael. I don't... Yeah, collagen has to go in... something. No, I think you just take it like a pill. Or you mix it with a drink. It, there probably is a collagen pill, but I can't... There is. I couldn't drink collagen water, like... No, they, it's like flavorless. You can't taste it. But it's... You, but you know. No, you can't tell it's there. It's like, what's her face? It's like, you take Metamucil, you just do it and you do it like a shot. No, you, no it's got to go in something. Yeah, they make it in pills. They're just very big horse pills. So you, can't be bigger than well, those. Well, yeah, I mean, they're just big fucking pills. So people put it in their drinks because it's, it's easy. Like you can't for, taste um, it or know there. I haven't seen any. I know Canada has recently. Collagen gummies. That sounds not very useful. <laughs> Are you an, a nighttime person, no name? If I lived there, I'd have 20 cats. I love the rescue cats. Yeah, I know. <coughs> Some of the cats, like most of the cats I see, like imagine you're a cat, okay? Is it, like, does I, I Kuwait they have, have protests have for Palestine? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know, the cats always... I, I love when people ask these questions of foodie. Like, like she, she go knows... Care. Trying to get out of the house, right? They want to go outside and socialize. I'm well, not socialize with other cats, but be in nature. That's my thought on it. But as long as they're well-fed and stuff. Especially the cats who hang around the parks and things. They are getting fed. There's always kibble around, you know. And they probably fish in the sea. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe the drain rats are feeding them. You could feed them when you go Sorry, out. I never have I ever. I didn't see it. Uh, once upon a time, John, she said she I, I was uh, right there no, with she, you. She, she was pregnant at 16, and I think she gave birth at 17. Thank you, Diana. Vanessa. How's my back? I just had my cortisone injections. Oh, you have to get them for like for back pain? Um But I did the thigh. I couldn't do the back. I had an injection, no name, so like right now, I don't feel any pain, not like mashallah. I keep saying that because you know I don't want to jinx it, but um ever since I had my last injection of vitamins and um from they gave me Olfin? Olfin? O L F E N or something like that. It's an NSAID. They don't do like I think it's like an maybe with like a I have, so they give her like a Tylenol injection? I've never heard of an NSAID injection. I, f I think she's probably getting insulin injection. I, I feel like she's making the shit like, up. Like my vitamins? I have no pain now. I have vitamins <laughs> and a Tylenol injection. What? I don't know. I thought it was steroid shot because when they inject me, like, I feel weird. But I don't know. Maybe mind over matter. Because of the store tonight and bought dill pickle chips. <gasps> Wait, you're you getting... <laughs> That's good. It's, it's, it's my favorite. Uh, sorry, but I missed this one. I just had to. Well, you should be sorry. That's inexcusable. Knights of the Diamond Spoon. Diamond Spoon. It, this is a he's a new cat that's been coming around. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you. It, let's get a big thank you to Knights. Very. I. That's it. That's gonna be stuck in my head for the rest of the night. That's good, sir.
Oh, ham and beans, that's a cute story. Uh -huh. Aw. Oh, kitties. I imagine it's therapeutic. <laughs> Those are rascally Russians. Sorry, wrong button. I follow you from Italy since 2020. Rossella, I'm a painter and working with your videos on the background shows me a lot. A big hug from Verona, City of Love. Wow, Rossella, the fair Verona. <laughs> Romeo and Juliet. Thank you. That means a lot to hear that. That's so cool. Thanks for watching me. That's a long time. Three cats over 20 years. Oh, wow, Kaylee. How do you feel? Uh, uh oh. Oh. What does that mean, Don? Oh! <laughs> All right. <laughs> Let me pull that fat. I'm not going to read it, but if you know, you know. How do you feel about Pete's being a 41 percenter? What does that mean, Don? <laughs> you change your name, you look amazing as usual. Hi, Miss Southern Billy, I did. I'm rebranding. <laughs> She's rebranding. Uh huh. It just sucks that the highlights, you have to take it out or mute it. Well, more. The, on that song? Yeah. The, it copyrights it? Mm hmm. Ah, uh, but yeah, our Olfin. That's the song. It's the song. Oh, excellent! I was worried. Yeah, thank you. I hope you feel better too. <laughs> Never have I ever. Andy, what's wrong? Oh, I okay. I completely forgot about this. I put up a uh, Twitter poll earlier today, mm -hmm. and it's because I I had to do a lighting test, so I did a test shoot of the things I wanted to, the figures I wanted to shoot. Uh -huh. And I put it up on Twitter. It's like, if I did reviews of figures, figure arts, uh, Kong Studios, uh, Demonical Fit, shit like that, would people be interested? And it was pretty resoundingly yes. But it's I'm not going to be videos. It, it would just be, like, shit on Twitter. Yeah. <laughs> Too harsh? You know the vitamin injection you're getting is only to be done once a month. With other... Once a month? Yeah, you they post whatever you want on your Twitter. Spread yeah. it more often if you're healing. I'm sure people will like it. For long-term maintenance. Yeah, Miss Southern Bell, I think the injections help you yeah, the vitamins. Because the vitamins neurobiome, that's why it's called, it's a cocktail of vitamins, B vitamins, to help um, nerve damage heal. <clears throat> I'm sorry. I'm not that kind of doctor, but I've never heard of B-complex vitamin injections helping your nerves heal. I thought that B12 is the injection you get for energy. Like, if you're low on energy, they give you B12 injections. Yeah, that, that's, that's... not for healing or stopping your pain. That's one it's, of the pills I take, is a B12. Right, it's to give you energy. <coughs> I've never heard of it repairing nerves, especially, especially for sciatica. No, that's why she said when she gets her injections, it makes her feel some kind of way. It's because she's getting energy shots. I thought once nerve damage was done... It was done. You can't really undo that. Yeah, Ner I don't think you can. Nerves are wired. Like, you can't fix that. I don't think you can. Because it's for diabetes. Does oh, look vi vitamin B affect diabetes? We have Jamie Padilla is a medic and works in the ER. And is new to our channel. We have a new nurse in the chat. Oh, finally, a replacement. <laughs> We're going to be coming to you right. for medical Jamie, information, Jamie. Jamie, you're you're the go-to now. Do nerves reheal themselves if you take a B12 injection? You, you got to have all this knowledge on deck ready to go immediately. <laughs> hey, Luna Spirit, long time no see. I like your style. Thank you. You have suitcases under your eyes. I know. This is new, a new development. I don't know what to do. I even put concealer. I look tired, huh? I'm not sleeping consistently the same schedule. Like have nerve problem. damage. I was told I could slow it down, but never repair it. Mm. Oh. Yeah, I don't think Thank B12 you, is going to fix broken nerves. Well, Thank B you. complex. I said 12 because it's just. Well, she said 12. Oh, no, me. Oh, she said she <laughs> gets. Lovely. I thought I fucked it up. No, oh, that's what like she it. said she gets. Oh, there we go. These are strong fucking beers. Holy shit. What, are, what is this at? 8.5. Thank you, no name. That means a lot. Thank you. You too. Have a good night. Thank you for coming in here and saying hey. It, it, it's possible, Miss. Well, I know about what I take. I don't know what other people take. And thanks for the super chat. I hope you sleep well. <laughs> Better than I've been sleeping. Look at this. Hi, oh, Italian from South Africa. You made it. How is it? What's the weather like there? There's always weird ones, yeah. Julia? Come here. You're cute. Everyone wants to see you. Will you do more Abaya Modest clothing hauls? Yeah, for sure. I want to try to see if I can find anything. Maybe some new Abayas for Ramadan because of Ramadan's like... 
a month to get out your habayas and things. <laughs> so, so we're not doing Ramadan. Again. No, and she's got diabetes, not. so she has a medical uh, excuse. Yes. Have you been sleeping well? Not terribly, Lexi. B12 is good for your nerves. You can take vitamin pills too. Yeah, true, Mary. I don't think oh, vitamin oh, pills are going to heal your nerves. Any trouble, blog? Oh, hey, I found it. I'm gonna... That seems like misinformation. Yeah, that's probably safe to eat. It's an orange one. Fine. It's orange flavored. Hmm? Get the head in sure, charge for a second. Any more floor M&Ms over there? Uh, no. I got to go talk to the horse, though. Okay. Right Sciatica is like nerve damage. You love ice bath for your face. That would be good. I'm going to try. <laughs> I hope you get some good sleep. Hi, Just Eight. No, I did the headdress my own. Just be so squeaky frog. Nice. <laughs> good for you. <laughs> Regina, hello. She loves the sunshine, yeah. Most creatures do. What's your other attention? Jamie, you know what? That's a good yes, point. Exactly. We she we might just on. be telling her doctors that she's having this sciatica pain so that she can get painkillers, but they're just not giving her any? I could see her do that. It's a summer, but we had a rainy day on arrival. I don't mind as it was nice and cold. It's summer in South? Really? Oh, wow. So the summer's like the winter months there. I take a teaspoon. Yes, nutritional yeast is good, too. Okay, good night, Kaylee. I, I did it myself, Lexi. You like the candle <laughs> And she can't get weed what? there. She's no way squeaky. That's not doing bad. coke there, but she likes drugs. Either, That's probably That's all crazy. she thinks she'd be able to get is some painkillers. The devil's lettuce in Thailand. <laughs> They're actually um, making it illegal again for recreational use, I heard. Yeah. Yep. But oh, Joanne, she might <laughs> have a visa run <laughs> around see. Ramadan time. Is it? I never tried it. I want to try Vegemite. I was scared of the camels. No, not really. At the end, yeah, I had to run. I didn't like film the whole thing. Yeah, you should have been scared like, of that camel. It, it didn't like, like you. It was being really cuddly. You saw that, right? Um, and then whenever it I, wasn't like, being lovey, um, he was trying to keep you away from his friend. He was trying to kick the, the fuck out of you. Camel, like, it was being really lovey. And then the whenever, was trying like, to UFC her. Yeah, it was trying to push you away um, from its buddy. It started to like. I was like, I gotta go, but like it was wrapping its big neck around me, kind of tighter and like pushing me more. And I was like, whoa, like what are you doing? And then I was like, I'm getting out here, and I started backing away, and it kicked me. And then it was like chasing us away. Yeah, maybe don't bother wild animals in the oh, desert. Really, really? <sighs> Hi, Crystal. Thank you. King Cobra got himself another five day suspension on YouTube. Uh, I, I've been seeing a lot of his stuff floating around on the Twits lately. Yeah. That, that might be something we should dip our toes I've into. I've not seen anything about it. it I, is. It's, that's probably got a lot of lore behind it that we wouldn't know. We got to do homework. We would have to. We have to do destiny style research streams. Oh God, <laughs> man, I I have notifications on for him, and he went live the other day, and he said, "Research streams now until the twenty eighth." I was like, "Holy shit, man! What is he getting himself into? Yeah. He's gonna be a savant at whatever it is." But yeah, I was close. I don't know. I I, I, I kind of regret doing that because I've been trying to stay away from it. Ooh. You know. Don't so drink it, no more uh, weeds bees in for me. What's your sun sign? Are you a river? Or a <laughs> okay, that got some responses. Do oh, cobra man. content. He rules my throw life. Uh, uh, okay. You need me to send y'all some stuff? It's a wildly different beast. Okay. I, I got to do some solo recon on this before I bring it up on the channel. This has been suggested quite a few times. Yeah, okay, we can look at it. Uh, you, I'm we, down. Yeah, John, you're going to have to send me some, like, Canadian horror story shit. Sit up in the queen he'd have to fit in. Um, no, I did actually. I'm a convert, yes. I've seen him make alcohol. I. Uh, Alright. So I was like, it's mad, it's mad. <laughs> the camel's mad. So I was like, oh no. <laughs> Thanks for being you. Oh, Blondie Barstow. Thank you, thank you. Cobra is somehow grosser than Chantel. Okay. Oof. Thank you. It seems like the people want to see it. That is quite the claim right there. Here's a series we're supposed to watch. All right, someone's going to have to send me a link because I'm definitely not going to remember and also won't 
look it up if I do. Thank you so much. That's so sweet. I appreciate that. <laughs> you got to live a little every now and then. Well, for me, it's just because like, I was always addicted to it, so it was hard to stop. But I noticed when I was doing it there, I was like less motivated and more tired to go out and do things. So, you know what I mean? Islam is such a beautiful religion. It is, yes. You're always welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Camel seem, seem to have a thing for you. Yeah, there's so at least there's always one. Look at that cat just catting around. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> Your hamster is so cute. Yes, Blondie, your hamster is cute. Howie. Should I go get Howie? No, I don't want the cat to freak out. Do you want me to go get Howie? Put the cat in the bathroom or something. Going to Mecca in 2024. I don't know yet, Dawn. Look, it, the hamsters don't live that long. She has to have gone through at least two of them. By no, now. they live for two to three years. Her hamster? Yeah, I mean, as long as you're feeding them and... No, we've got to be on water. We've got to be on Henry the Eighth by now. I I don't I do not believe divorce beheaded answer. died divorce beheaded survived. We're I, on the last one. I would have to see him again, but I when everybody was saying it was a different hamster, it wasn't a different hamster. This is another caboose thing. It does destroy motivation, Squeaky from yeah, for sure. She hasn't do. shown him in a while, but like that <sighs> one in her um. Her little beginning montage for the cameo, yeah, because that was that's the, the same. That hamster. was Henry the Third. No, that's the same hamster as it always was. No, that was Henry the Third. Muslims don't celebrate it, so I don't really celebrate it anymore. But we did our own little thing, anyways. <laughs> you, you, your own little thing for Valentine's Day was going to get kicked by Cam. <laughs> that's what you did. You, you drove by them all. Sally didn't let you go in, probably because there were cars outside, and he didn't want anyone to see you. And then he took you to look at your best friends. <laughs> he took you to get kicked by Cam. <laughs> That was probably his favorite part of the day. I'm sure it was. Well, his favorite part of the day was the poop. Yeah, it did. It did poop for him. That's he, true. He did a lot of zooming in on the poop on its legs. And yeah, he, he really liked the poop. He started like that scene in. Fuck. Oh my god, the void. It's like the triangle. He started perfectly. Right. Right there, and then like zoomed it in. Yeah. He liked that. And he also liked that toilet in the abandoned school, yeah, it which was, was weird. Like, he had to go all the way up to it so he could look to see if there's any poop in it. And then the, the dung beetles, he's like, where? Yeah, I know. He was checking them for poop. I know you got the goods. That was, he's, he's a weird fella. It's like Bane, interrogate, or Batman interrogating Bane. Where is it? <laughs> where is the poopy? <laughs> I'll just leave it at that. Oh, sorry, Blondie. They passed away at 2.5 years. I hope I have Howie for another year and a half then, because I had him for about Blondie a year said, now. I had a real <laughs> hamster, but he passed away at the age of 2.5 years. What is a real hamster? What do you mean I had a real hamster? <laughs> <laughs> As opposed to what? Uh, the fake one Chantel has, I need clarification. You can't just say that. <laughs> I had a real ham. Okay. I had a real hamster. I also have a real hamster. Do you? I haven't seen he him only in comes a couple out of nighttime. days. I never see him. He only comes out at night time. Yeah, but he eats his food. That's how I, I He eat. hasn't tripped the camera in a couple of days. He's out. COVID he just, COVID comes out to eat his food. And run in his wheel. Yeah. Oh, you never had COVID? Good for you. My mom called me. Me neither. Oh. What cube? What cube? Desert Rose, hello. You feel like you're on a dungeon. Scratch. Scratch. You look tired, dang. Yeah, pew pew, Tasha. I was up pretty early. And... Scratch. That's that's a good catch, Jamie. Scratch. She was Scratch. talking about the plague yeah. a few like, days prior to rubbing all over a sick camel. Stay awake, I uh, have trouble. Oh, I'm all dolled up just to like be on camera. I switched out of those past summer. They're all around there, especially for lungs. Yeah. It's like 30 seconds. It's slowing down. It's too much scratch. What do you think? See? What do you think? You think that's true? Come. Come. Look at that precious kitty. Are you sunbathing? Oh my god, that cat is so cute. Look at her belly. Uh, it's doing like Otter does. Did I have COVID? I, I probably had it a few times. I don't know. Maybe just. Oh, like, did you hear me talking about another cat? You want to come no. see her? Um, this is called a. <laughs> Mersbeezing. I mean, yeah, you might as well. She won't come. Yeah. 
She won't come to you. You call her. She knows I want to pick her up, so Great. She, she backs up whenever I get too close. The fuck out of here! I don't yell at Gray. I didn't have breakfast yet. She just looked at me like, what? You're such a pretty kitty. Come on. I, I give you a pet. I give you pets. Come on. I, I don't why know. are you petting yourself on the door? You can come here. I don't know why you. cats think this is going to draw, or why we think this is going to draw them in. Come We're on, just Gray. wiggling our fingers. I wiggle my fingers. That means I'll pet you. Come on. No, don't pet yourself. <laughs> I will pet you. Come. I will scratch your cheek. Door doesn't have to do it. I will do it for you. You don't like that tickle? Don't tickle me. I'm trying to pet the cat. That? It's like a weird aftertaste. Come on. Come on. Like a bull. How come hamsters always die in the most ridiculous and strange ways? I, I've i never seen one of my dead hamsters because once they stop coming out to eat, I cry and I tell you, find the hamsters! Yeah. And they're fine now. And then I've got to dig through this fucking fortress <laughs> that she's... Fuck. Oh, stream's dead. Son of a bitch. What happened? We're hitting the red. What's that mean? That's this. This is uh, green, yellow, red. Oh, oh. we're back. Uh -huh. So it's not working? This is internet. So that means people can't see us? This is weird. I've never seen it do this before. People, can you see us? We're red. Over here? But we're bouncing between 12 and 11. Oh, can you guys hear us? See, it was just at 11.40. Now it's at 590, 12, 18, 18. Four. <laughs> Ten. Merchant just said slursters. 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 Oh. <laughs> How did we not catch that? Well, I don't know what's going on. This is some weird bandwidth. Uh oh. Okay, yep, they see it. Uh oh. Uh -oh. oh boy. Oh boy. Can, can you go on, uh, tell them our internet's being fucky? Who? Oh. Who? What do you mean, who? Well, am I gonna call the internet company? No, it's the chat. Oh. Because that is, that is all the internet. That's not YouTube. I don't think it hear us for a second. Yeah, that's uh, probably the last part that went out. Uh, YouTube is not receiving as much data as it needs. Viewers will expect buffering. Should I say hold on? No, just say we're having internet issues. We're waiting to we're waiting it out. It's coming in and out, back and forth. They're coming in and out. You keep cutting oh, it up. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. It's Stupid internet. It's just the interwebs, man. Stupid. Stupid internet. Dude, what is YouTube doing? The stream is constantly stopping for me. Uh-oh. Oh, I didn't press. Oh, boy. Uh, how long has this been going on? I don't know. People just started noticing 4,400. We should be as green as it gets. Can we refresh it? Not without restarting OBS. Oh. Oh, boy. Little Gray, are you going to give us some good luck? Come here. I, a few people in the chat saying we're good now, but can you restart OBS? No, because then I'll have to restart the stream. Oh, yeah. That... Refreshing did not help. Oh, boy. Yeah, no, yeah. this is... It's on our end. It's not even, it's on our internet side. Yeah. It's not even YouTube fucking with us. It's just our internet. It's looping. Yeah, they're at the end of it. Oh, fuck. Damn, man. Uh, Okay, we're just sitting zero. Oh, never mind. We're at 44. Nope, back to zero. If I turn off the Wi-Fi on my phone, will that help? Probably not. Is that how it works? We're going to investigate one more thing.
um, I can I can hear you <sighs> change internets yeah that would be helpful alright yeah we could try it how do you change internets All right, hold on one second. I think we only have one internet. I, my computer has Wi Fi. That's us. Oh boy. Oh boy. For twenty thousand kilobytes per second output, and it's still not. Oh. Ah! Uh, 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 oh, we might be good. Is it working? We might be good. That was weird. That was really weird. It was bouncing. It went to 24,000 kilobytes per second output. Then to 100 kilobytes per second output. That's weird. Then we go like 18,000. <laughs> okay. That We're okay. Was weird. We survived. It looks like the monkey method worked. It worked. All right. Thanks, monkey. Okay. I don't even remember what we were talking about. Uh, I don't remember. Camels. Yeah, foodie being abused by animals. <laughs> and dirt merchant said slursters oh, yeah, instead slursters. of hamsters, <laughs> and that was my favorite thing. Egg and avo. Really? I don't like avocado toast. I don't know. I wouldn't make a good, like... Rasputin fucked everything up. Yep. All those people that, like, avocado toast and social media. <laughs> wow, Desert Rose. That's good. Yeah, it tastes like both. Uh, here's Kara, like, I was listening the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know. You heard me beating test. Shelly. <laughs> Why'd you break the internet? <laughs> You don't like avocado? I only like it in certain things, like guacamole, if it's made right. Not yeah, we're in the green now. YouTube just, or not YouTube, uh, OBS just dropped right to the red. That was weird. But it was still, it was giving 20 times the output it is now, and it was still in the red. Yeah. So that was just, must have been something with my internet. I did type in the chat for a second, Gray. One second. Whatever. Sometimes. As a scarf, not on his head. Come cook, eat with us. You seem much calmer and happier. See, we just waited out. We don't gotta end the show. Yeah, that would have broke everything. We ain't got nowhere to be. We just waited out. Chill. Yeah. Well, we have to go out for a bit, so... I think we're just gonna get something out. There's, like, so many, like... Yeah. I'm just probably gonna do a vlog today, too. Okay. Go drop that vagabond off. Oh, okay. Shit you need, you need okay. two internets like monkey. Well, I, whatever I did fucking worked, so... Hey, coffee is my language. I hope you enjoy your coffee. <laughs> guacamole is avocado. I know, but like I only like it like made into guacamole usually. I worked in hospital the first two years when COVID started. I never had it until last November. When I had just had my baby, it was the worst. Oh, yeah, yeah Rosalia. You don't know what his blind eyes are talking about. Oh. How would I know? Yeah. Okay, let me pop the chat back out. I think you guys are trolling us. Is behind. Holy moly, it's just going fast on that well, side. Well, this, this also, yeah. Um, Tim 
tell everyone in chat, check if you're behind still. Oh yeah, try to refresh. My chat is where it needs to be. No, he wasn't telling me to tell the internet company the internet was down. I'm just stupid. I'm like, what do you want me to do? Call the internet company? <laughs> no. He was telling me to type in the chat that the internet was yeah, down. Yeah, no, we're fine. <laughs> I got to yeah, call the internet like, company. Have the energy to deal with a newborn, right? And then uh, you're sick. I know what I'm doing. No. Yeah. Really I didn't looking? know what you were talking about. They're really good for you. Avocado. Actually, you wanted me I to like tell them, like, the shakes, chat. Not the I shakes, thought you meant tell them, like, juice. internet. I can't tell them. <laughs> they don't care. But You're like, oh, fuck you, you still have dude, to Every time it. you call and say the internet's out, they say, we're having outages in your area. That's it. Well, the thank one time... You, thank you for your help. The we one know. time I fucking pitched a good bitch and they gave me like three months free? It did not. It, Maybe like $30 off. No, they gave me like a month or two months free. Not here. Yeah. No. Yeah. Well, I still paid the bill. Then we're ahead by two months. No. <laughs> They're full of good vitamins. They lied you. to you on the phone and still sent the, the bill. Consistency of guacamole turned me off. Yeah, there was never a time we didn't get a bill. You want to talk about a bill? There was never a time that they did not send a bill. You want to talk about a bill? I got a big one today. Oh, yeah. Bread and butter? Ooh, wow, that sounds ooh, bad big. <laughs> I would imagine the gas company. I don't have to wear like this. I can wear like different types of hijab, but yeah, if I'm out in public, um, yeah. and around people From that are not. Three like, years ago. No, oh, boy. Hey, you owe us. Poor like digits. Jesus. Like, like uh -oh. so <laughs> Oops. I, love the sound I don't think I do, actually. I have, so I like, gotta make like, some phone yeah, calls. Yeah, I don't think you do. Don't you consistently know. Looking forward to it, thank you. Is there a Chipotle, Stephanie? I don't think so. I think there's one coming, though. I want to bathe in avocado and eat my way out with cheesecake. But that's Ooh. gonna be a, a great hour and a half long wait time tomorrow. tomorrow. Yeah, would you have it with, like, nuts and honey? Hijab is optional. Um... Yeah, like, like you're not forced to wear it, but because of Muslim, yeah, it's like a requirement. But you're, you're not, not forced to wear it, but it's a requirement. So are you required to wear it then? Yes. I didn't even catch that. <laughs> that. That didn't even occur to me. But no, it's not a requirement because we've seen her out and about and there's other ladies knock, not wearing knock. it. Who's there? Oh. Nuh-uh. Oh. Aww. Oh, I like the song. You like it? Aww. <laughs> <laughs> Aww. Did those four digits include decimals? No. Let me replay that one more time. One more time. Knock, knock. Who's there? Awoo. I really like this song. You it's like very it? like jazzy. <laughs> oh, I love it. Holy I shit. I love it. Nice of the diamond spoon. Hold on, I gotta, uh, I gotta take a breath. Uh, give me one second. I'm gonna do some magic here. Uh, uh, hold on, I Shelly's like, you gotta do the thing. Give me, give me a second. I'm gonna run some magic here. Talk to the chat. What is the magic? Just talk to the chat. That is not forty-five thousand HP right there. Talk to the chat. Okay. Let me do this. You gotta fix the I'm, HP. I'm gonna, I'm gonna set them up right. Okay. Yeah, I do always catch the bullshit, Jen. That's true. What what is this? Refresh the chat. Why are we saying refresh the chat? What is it, going it's on? other chat people? They have to refresh. Oh, we you guys are, have to refresh your we're chat. We're square. Okay, okay. Or if you hit that little thing in the corner where it says live, doesn't it bring it back to where it's live? Or does that not work for chat too? You have to open and close the chat, or hit um, things and do all messages. Okay, there's that. Let me click this. Jamie is in Arizona. We are in Ohio. Knock, knock. Who's there? No. Did oh you fix it? That made you, your picture. You fucked it up. There you go. There you go. Knights of the Diamond Spoon. Coming in with 3.8 million stream boss HP. To Holy be moly. The first... 
flagship member of the Awu Club with seven hundred seventy-seven dollars and seventy-seven cents American. <laughs> Guys, that's the Alpha Awu. That is the Alpha Awu, or is it Chief Awu? What's the What's the final decision? We'll let him decide. Yeah, what should it be, Alpha Awu or Chief Awu? That is up to you to pick. Knight of the Diamond Spoon. You want to be the Alpha Awu or the Chief Awu? You're yeah. setting the stride for this whole club, buddy. Yeah, and Guys, you gotta type in the chat to get your wrench. Give it up. Give it up for Knights of the Diamond Spoon coming in so fucking hot. Wow. Unlocking wait. the new one. God, can we see it one more time? I could see, I could see it one more time. I, mm, mm. I could definitely see it one more time. Knock, knock. Who's there? Awu. Awu. I love the Ray. Oh, I love it. Lee. Shit. That's amazing. I so we got to we got to make up some Eevee I'm things. I'm at a loss. We got to make some Eevee things. I'm at a little bit of a loss, but oh, I drank if I drank. Mm, no, you're not allowed. To. Oh, sit, save it till I get back. I'll be back in five uh, minutes. And now the show's about to get so much better. You, you guys <laughs> behave until I get right back. No. Behave. Best behave. Holy shit, man, dude! Thank you. So Thank fucking you. much. Breaking the seal, becoming the first. The first member of the Awu Club. I don't, it, it's up to you. Do you want to be Chief Awu? Do you want to be the Alpha Awu? Do you have a better name? It's up to you, man. But thank you. So fucking, from the bottom of my heart, thank you. Uh, what happened to the Amberlin, Amberlin Binge Monster donation? That, that's still a dono. Uh, I want to say twenty six sixty six, but that's the that's the 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 cat. Uh, okay, let me play this. I'll get back to an answer. That's just popped up for me. Complete jump scare. Really? <laughs> Gotta make that go. They're so uh, good. Twenty six forty three is that one. Twenty six forty three. That is a new member, and it's a club. And we, oh, we did have cat noises. I fucking lied. Perfectly timed. We have we've had no Eve, but Shelly just smacked the shit out of her mic. She did threaten to call the cops. We got some blackouts. We got some blackouts. Should be Alpha, like in Supernatural, because he's the first. I mean, it's up to them. They're the ones who got to make the call. Sounds terrible, but it's not. It's so good because when you blend the avocado, they blend I'm, it with like honey. I'm at words. a straight up loss, man. The, 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 yeah. Maybe some milk, I think. It's so good. It's so creamy. It doesn't taste any it doesn't taste like avocado. Uh what do you mean? I ate a pork with more corn yesterday. Yeah, no, I didn't. <laughs> Interesting bread and butter. <clears throat> don't you get lonely not having any friends there? I know I do. No, I don't get lonely at all. I'm like always with Salah, and I'm like the type of person that like likes MySpace, so. <laughs> MySpace, yeah. I'm not a huge person on social. We tried to bring MySpace back, it didn't work. But I have friends I talk Night to. Night Awu? Night Awu's not bad. That's not bad. Like a couple of good friends, like on the phone. And then my family. And then you guys, like honestly, talking to you guys is like a form of socializing, even though it's on the internet. It's 2024, everything is cyber. I don't I haven't seen any Lexi, but maybe there are. Quitting with mashed apple, dark cocoa powder, agave dip, and yum. That sounds healthy. Actually, my hair is super huntress. Yeah, I can tell you guys, like, I was surprised. Like, today, after the shower, I was like, wow, like, it's like, getting long. No, you're good, better than better. I'm used to weird. Hello, Brie Mac. Hello, Brian and Kevin from Arcadia. Hello. <laughs> yeah, like, mine is kind of hiding my brows, yeah. <laughs> Knights of the Awu Order. Ooh, these are bad. 
Let's talk bad about Shelly. No. She's doing her best. I think Knights of the Awu might be the thing. I think it might be the Knights of the Awu. That might be the get. Which bagels are better than I haven't? It's Knights of the Diamond Spoon again. How does everybody feel about the Alpha Re? I, I'll put a B on that one. I'll put a B on the Alpha Re. That's pretty fucking good. The Alpha Re. Yeah, that's not bad. I like it. I'm hip. I'm doing a B. Yeah. You got me on that. Fuck B. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck B. Yeah. Hell yeah, f yeah. Real big old heart. Yeah, yeah. All right, there it is. The BS have it. Alpha re, Alpha re is the get. There it is. Knights of the Diamond Spoon, welcome. Flagship member of the Alpha re Club. Kettleman's bagels are the best in Ottawa. Holy Guys, let's get a big welcome and hearts in the chat to Knights of the Diamond really Spoon Salty, to the Alpha Re Club. Please send pizza cameo for a day. No, no, we didn't request one, Crystal. <laughs> Hi, Kate. Hi, Kai. Carrie, hello. Never heard of being at home with just family. I don't have friends except far away in different states. Yeah, same here, Deirdrop. I get you. Mm, I do like My it. My space. <laughs> Those are roads. That's so, like, oh, what's that, like 2000 and, like, what? Two? I can't remember. Your cat Minnie, say hi to Minnie. Minnie. Julia. Talion. Hi. <laughs> yeah, Bridget, we're just chilling. Killing. What? When she comes here, I'm gonna grow her. Chloe is not. Yeah. Katana, he's here. I mean, clearly he is. They are, Lexi. New York City bagel? <laughs> what is this about bagels? I've never had a New York City bagel. The fanciest bagel I've ever had is a not Einstein's uh Brueger. And those are pretty good. I do need to get back on it. Yeah. I I don't even know. I, I made a MySpace, but I like didn't even really post to it much. I think like once or twice. I remember. I MySpace is the shit. You need a new stream goal. I do indeed. Oh, I gotta, I gotta rack the neurons for this one. Oh fuck! You know what? <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Hold on. I feel so old. Like I'm like before the internet, but like I remember when the internet became a thing and like dial up that noise. Come. What are you doing? What are you doing? What? She has some crunchies, and now she's gonna clean herself. It's hard to make friends exactly blondie like it really is it's hard to trust people but i don't know i try not to let it like completely make me make me completely jaded but it is hard for the i don't um for the pie crust this time i, had, I didn't use olive oil because i'm low oh so in the cooking videos guys. yeah coming soon actually i'm starting to feel i got you feel a lot better you got mail <laughs> html no my space yeah html is hard for me yeah chrysalis hard to trust there's um, <laughs> Miss Sin in the chat. What are you doing? You have to use about three quarters. So if you put like. I cannot describe how much I irrationally hate. What are you doing? <sighs> Miss Sin texted it to me. And it took me like three days to figure out what was going on. But she'll text me. She'll be like, What are you doing? And I was like, What? <laughs> and she goes, What are you doing? They're like, oh my god, no, stop it. Now I do it too. So here it is. Why is Shelly in the chat? She's gotta take care of a thing. Two and a half cups of flour, you have to put about three quarters of a cup of oil. So I used sunflower oil, I think it was. Yeah. But it's just so easy, that's why I don't wanna have to make the butter super cold and then I don't know. It comes out like nice, really nice. Aren't there two Shelly's? No, the other one is much shorter. I don't even trust I don't trust myself either. I always let myself down. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
uh, Knight of the Diamond Spoon again. No, I thought of Alpha Re after all the way better names. Some of those are way better. Dude, just message me on Discord. You don't have to drop damn near a hundred dollars to 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 just say something. I mean, you can, but you don't have to. Okay. I like the Alpha Re. That's pretty good. But Knights, the, what was it? The the Order of the Awu? Fuck, what was it? I already forgot it. Shit, man. Not the Royal Awu. I'm Colonial? No, that one's stupid. Uh, where is it? There were... Fuck, now I fucked around and forgot it. Oh, by the way, thank you, Jamie, for joining the plebs. Much appreciated. Uh, since magicking. I, I've been to do that from time to time. Uh, fuck, I forgot what it was. I'm scrolling back in the chat looking for it. Read the chat, dummies. Okay, yeah, I got that. Uh-huh, Slurburger. Uh, time check currently 12. It is 12.13. Uh, where are you guys at? I'm in Arizona. We are in Cleveland. I think Sin answered that. Uh, fuck, man. Was it the Order of Awu? Knights of the Awu. That's what it was. Knights of the Awu. That that was the goodie. That was the Dewey. Break them. We had party like. And Raspy Wolf. Thank you for joining the plebs. Dudes forever, boss. <laughs> on our phone lines where we had to share lines with other people. Oh, yeah. <laughs> My space was fun. You could cuss. Yeah, dude, I, just, just let me know which one you like and I will make it so. I, I, I see you on the Discord. My profile, I have music. Yeah, it was all about music, wasn't it? Bring me a tissue, BBQ. What are you doing? Dude, what are you doing? What time is it? It is 9.45, so you guys are, um, okay, you guys are three hours behind. Form and she's seven hours ahead, I believe. Spring, no. If you had to use the phone, you had to, yes, you had to wait for somebody to stop using the phone line for the internet. Customizing my background on MySpace, yes, Patrick. <laughs> it's almost 2 a.m. here. Yeah, the time difference is crazy. Yeah, I know, right, Desert Rose? And I do appreciate what you're doing, by the way. That is that. What's your Discord? Well, you can type exclamate. Exclamation Discord in the chat. And Nightbot will give you a lovely little link to my public Discord, and you can go from there, and I will take care of you. Thank you so much, Knight of the Diamond Spoon. Just the, the John Wick master right there. I mean, he, dude's just killing it tonight. Can we just take a moment in my relatively inebriated state and raise a cup to Knight of the Diamond Spoon. Incredible. Absolutely incredible. Mm. Fantastic. His chair, yeah, it's more comfortable. Like while I'm having these flare ups, Lexi, like the other chair is kind of hard. Good night, Regina. Thanks for being here. I can't stand Twitter, but most love it. I don't get it. I, I really hate it too. I don't have a Twitter, I don't check, but people like lately have been sending me things. We know. We know you're on Twitter. It, it, she she screenshots whole ass tweets and puts them on her community tab and goes, well, I'm not on Twitter. Yeah, you are. We see it. We know that you are on Twitter. What do you mean? But I people have been talking crap about me on there for years and I haven't even seen probably 2% of it. So, he hasn't really been gaming, honestly. So, <laughs> we're just trying to uh, keep busy with other things and working, paying attention to each other and doing things together and stuff like that. <laughs> Jill, thank you, Fox and Glares. What are you doing?
I do believe Knight has single-handedly started a wick train. Is possible. Julia. The people like you. Look at her small head. <laughs> Look at your big ass head. What the fuck you mean? Why are you doing this? Why are you attacking your foot? No, no, she's very important, has spies everywhere who sent her every little thing posted on Twitter immediately. That's possible. Freak of nature. What? No. Yeah, she's always happy and hyper in the morning. Did you have your breakfast, breakfast? Tell them you had your breakfast, breakfast. You have butchers. So I am of the mind that Chantel has completely lost her mind. Do you have your breakfast, breakfast? Did you, did you, you eat your you crunchy, crunchy? Like, dude, just tell me you're insane. Just say that you've lost your fucking shit and that this is what you do. Lexi, why would I live here by myself? It doesn't make any sense. Nobody, nobody, it's all bull BS. <laughs> Do you think you'll ever go back to your Foodie Beauty? Um, I don't know. I don't think so. I don't know. You can't. I don't, I don't, I don't, you, no, you just, you can't for at least a week. I don't think I want to. You know. But you're still Foodie Beauty. You have done nothing but change your channel name. You are still Foodie Beauty. Chantel Marie Olive Al Refe Wolf Pondu Cook Soro, you are foodie beauty. Kick. I don't think so, bread and butter. I don't think I'd, I, I used to think about it like before when I was live streaming more, but I, I don't want like to live stream my whole life, you know? Julie's bilingual. I changed my name to my Muslim name. Just, I don't know, I'm tired of foodie beauty. But that's, <laughs> it's not a Muslim name, it is a religious name. There is a Miriam in every religion. It is not a Muslim. You can clean so let's be if any game sitting on the floor now. <laughs> <coughs> you got it. Love Julia. Thank you. They have no proof. They never do. Like, it's so stupid. Why would I? It doesn't make any sense. Why would I live by myself? Like, really, logically, why? Because nobody wants to be around you. Could you imagine living in a house with this person who does this all day, every day? Is there a reason? <laughs> yes, because Scatman left you. Poopster is nowhere to be seen. Salad is gone. And I do believe we are far out of the gorilla train by now, so that can go away. Why would I come here to live by myself? <laughs> like, I don't know. I don't even know if that's possible. In this building, it's not possible. It's for families only. They don't know the culture here. <laughs> you don't know the culture here. You don't understand what the culture is. This is apparent. <laughs> you know. It's definitely not for everyone. <laughs> Julia's adorbs. Thank you, Angela. People are so unbelievable. The dank conspiracy theories. Yeah, like, they don't even make any sense. Like, I don't know. Like, like the poopster. Yeah, I know. He, he, he comes in. He, he. It administers a feeding and then he goes immediately. <laughs> I know. Are you getting chubby or are you just fluffy? She's like a weird breed. I don't know what she is. She's like, looks like porty color, but then she's like got a smushed face like a Persian and long hair. It's a street cat. You, you kidnapped, you catnapped a cat. I don't know. She's strange. They need to make drama where it doesn't exist. It's still livelihood. You nailed it. You missed the last lap. Alright, so I think we are officially finally ranting about haters. <laughs> <laughs> Joanna Mike, I love catching lives. I vote for you officially ignoring all reaction and that BS. Time for better things. Can you block them so you don't have to even see what they're saying? Yeah, Joanna, mostly, uh, like... Uh-oh. I just felt the temperature change. What? Uh-oh. <laughs> uh oh. No. I can just like not not look or I mean sometimes I get sent things, but yeah, I know what you mean. I agree with you. It's probably better. No, I'm not naysayer. 
The big deal later. Julia? Why are your feet like- <laughs> Okay, it's like, fuck off. This. You're not allowed. Oh. I'm home. Hey, you. I got this. Oh, yeah. What you got? Candy. No, I cannot. It's illegal. What are you doing? What you doing? What you doing? <laughs> what you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? That salon is staying with his dad and only drives you to doctor's appointments. Why? Like, what? What? Like, there's no logic <gasps> behind that. At all. <laughs> like, it's so stupid. Ugh. Just like that. You can get a DNA kit for your pets to see what breed they are. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I just read that. <laughs> I don't think she's Persian though. She's definitely not purebred. No, I don't think she's purebred. That's what I mean. She's like a mixed breed. Like, look at her face from the side. It's like pushed in like a Persian. I think she did use the mascara on her eyebrows she's like, again. What are you doing? <laughs> she's cute. Rob Roy, you can. I think it's hilarious that she texts salad with what you're doing. No, I don't breed. <laughs> if they use their brain power for their own lives the way they do, coming up with unfounded conspiracies, they wouldn't be so miserable and petty. Sorry, yeah, true. <laughs> that one's Bernie. My intro for those who miss it, yeah. <laughs> She knows she's she's showing off for you guys. Are you showing off to the people? Whoa. She's not showing off. She's just catting around. <laughs> she's paying no attention to you at all. Can we visit the pyramids in Egypt? <laughs> Maybe someday. You but I hear like they're hard to, to go into. Yeah, this so, like, was she's, she's, she's just being a cat. She's like, oh, she's showing off for you guys. No, she's just being a cat. But uh, are you you know that's a phrase, right? Catting. Yeah. But does does that mean being a cat? No, it means like strutting. No, that's not what she's doing. She's just flopping around like a cat. But I okay. But did you know that was a phrase? No. You never heard that? Uh, to mean strutting? Yeah, like you're catting around. You're 